just to see moments ago here at American Airlines Arena in South Florida on championship ring night. LeBron James collecting his first championship ring. For Dwayne Wade, it is his second. It's been a coronation for the Heat, but now it is on to year three of the Big Three era. It's the Boston Celtics and the defending NBA champion Miami Heat as we welcome you to TNT's traditional opening night doubleheader. LeBron James knocking down his first attempt. Boston up by two were early first quarter. So James took, took the clock and he'll go to the line. Foul in the act. Nice pass down low to Bosch. Beautiful feed. LeBron yeah, and good patience from Miami. They really moved the ball well in the possession. All of a sudden, LeBron recognizing that Bosch had position. Rondo ripped it up. He had nowhere to go. Really tied up. Here's the lead pass for Wade. Has to save it. James kicks it out. They swing it again. See how the ball's moving so much better than it has in the last couple of years. I think that started in the playoffs as James knocks down the jumper, but they're playing hard with such better pace and flow and rhythm. Miami with a one-point lead pass, pops it up. Here comes James, leads way. James with lots of room. Third bucket for LeBron, three of five, eight points in all, along with six rebounds. Oh, the out of the pass. LeBron James from Chris Bush. 6.7 assists nice. for Rondo James. Gets it away. Yes, and the foul. Bad pass. First turnover in quite some time. James took the hit, and he'll go to the line. Reaching his call on, on Courtney Lee. Lee tried to extend and was turned back. Here comes the ball. In possession, James open for three. Yes, that's his first three-point attempt of the game, Marvin. And I, I think that's going to be consistent this year. LeBron James for three. So that's a second from downtown in this third quarter. Now you say front court, I prefer to say hybrid. <laughs> I think <laughs> that should be out okay. of bounds. Fair enough. Speaking about a good <laughs> flow, you got LeBron that right. James. That's a two. He had a foot on the left. LeBron is uh, back on, on the court. That was deflected to the backcourt by uh, Terry, so the ball still alive for Miami. Shot clock to five. Here's James. That's a two. Had a foot on the line. LeBron with 26 points. Lewis for three. No hesitation from Rashard Lewis. And the defending champs open up with a victory here. As we welcome you back to Madison Square Garden, opening night for the 2012-2013 New York Knicks. They were scheduled to open last night in Brooklyn against the Nets. That was postponed to later this month, but they will begin tonight against the Miami Heat. He did not expect it to start the season, but again, with all the injuries, he's starting at the two guard. And that's one of his great strengths is his versatility because of his size. He can rebound, he's got strength, he can guard multiple positions. He's better right now against bigger players as James takes it to the rim versus the jet quick point guard. Taylor coming off one of his best seasons. Jason Kidd, oh, he tips it in. Kidd tips it in. They'll give the basket to Chris Bosh, who is the closest Heat player to Kidd. Pass. Bosh intercepts. Transition defense so critical, they got back. <laughs> James with a pretty move. You know, Kurt Thomas led the country in scoring and rebounding at TCU. And then when he became an NBA player, he became an elite defender, rebounder, screen setter, who was also a capable scorer. And his longevity has been incredible because early in his career, he had what could have been career-ending foot problems as LeBron James hits Bosch on the roll to the rim. Felton tries again, penetrates. Bad pass stolen by Battier. Right there, Felton's got to look to score. There's no rim protection by this small Heat team. Drive to score. 
Norris Cole knocks it down. Cole, the second-year point guard out of Cleveland State. And the crowd with the chance of defense. James fires away and answers back with a three-pointer. Oh, what another beautiful pass from LeBron James. He's got four assists already. As James banks it in. Anthony blocked from behind. Chandler tried to tip it in. And Smith forces a travel on Wade. Wanted to pick up a charge. Wade tried to avoid him. Felton is guarding Wade. And Brewers on James. Tough matchup for anybody. Brewers a good defender, but James knocks that one down. And LeBron James now with 14 points. Brewer outlet Anthony one man to beat. And LeBron James defends it beautifully. Anthony thought there was a foul. That one man to beat may be the toughest guy to have behind you in that particular situation. Felton has it knocked out of his hands, thought he was foul. Three on one. Wade Alley up. Yeah, that's an easy two. They take turnovers and turn them into layups. Nice pass from Chalmers to a cutting James. But Mike Whitson says he's going to be so good with the Kurt Thomases and Marcus Camby's and Rasheed Wallace's that they don't have to play big minutes. And he knows that when he puts them out there, and when he puts them out there, they'll be ready. And they don't have to play every game as Novak fouls James on the way to the rim. A lot of spirit and a huge Knicks fan being treated to a special night, Mike. As LeBron James hits the three, it's back to 15 now. Smith on the drive, trying to create some space. Tough shot won't go. Smith has been off most of the night. Three for 10, and Wade gets inside easily, and it's a 13-point game. Felton penetrates. Layup blocked by James. Right back out to Kidd. They've got to shoot. Kidd leans in, draws the foul. It's going to be a three-pointer. A 20-point win by the Knicks as they hit 19 three-pointers led by Carmelo Anthony's 30 points. It is game number three of the NBA season for both the Nuggets and the Heat and South Florida off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Dwayne Wade who had a very uneven game last night as Bosch sinks the turnaround so on two Chris Bosch jump shots the Heat have a 5-4 lead. All five Heat players touched the ball on that play. The Heat co coming off two uncharacteristic games defensively, allowing over 105 points a game in their first two. LeBron doubled. Deflected ball finds Battier. Kaboom! Shane Battier from downtown. Nice pass by Wade. Bosch got it back after mishandling. And deflects it to LeBron. Battier, angle three. Kaboom! Oh, baby! Good cross-court pass by LeBron after good hustle by D. Wade to cut that ball loose. Heat lead by two. Chalmers pick and roll with LeBron. Ducks in and connects. First score for LeBron. And a nice setup by the point guard. He's always fun to talk to, isn't he? Really is. Really respect and admire George Carter. LeBron James, a guy you can respect and admire. He's got four points. Fareed is on LeBron now. Allen for three. Come on. Ray Allen, his second three of the quarter. He has eight points, and Miami already with five triples. Allen already short of the three. Allen hustles to the rebound. And here comes LeBron. Downhill. You love the way he comes down the floor, picking and choosing where he's going to go with the ball. LeBron against Gallinari. Help from Andre Miller to the left, so LeBron comes right for Miller's three. Come on. Well, the threes are keeping Miami in this game. Six of ten from downtown. Lawson attacking. LeBron with a block. He had a chance to run. Four on two. Bosch with the offensive rebound. Short on the putback. Loose ball battle. Bosch deflects it to LeBron with a fresh shot clock. And that's good. Eight points for LeBron James. His first score in the second quarter. Miami trails by three, just under two minutes to play in the first half. Nice pass, good catch, and finish. Good use of the backboard there. When you catch a ball like that on, on a sharp cut, the tendency is to aim the shot. Use the backboard, it's got more give to it. Five seconds left. LeBron, great play. Oh my, Bosh with a two-handed stuff. How about Eric Spolster's play in the timeout? LeBron with a block on Gallinari's shot. 
second block tonight for James and a 24 second violation on Denver. The Heat have led by as many as five. The Nuggets biggest lead was eight. We had 12 lead changes in the first half. Now despite the face guarding from Kufus, Bosch able to connect. Tony Chris Bosch. They're really having a good start to his 10th season. 22 points and five rebounds tonight. Bosch taking it away from Iguodala who goes to the deck. Chalmers for LeBron. Again, loose ball, 50-50 situations now a lot different in the first almost four minutes of the second half. The Heat are getting after it. It's leading the easy baskets at the other end. LeBron got it. A long two on a laser beam line drive for LeBron James. And you can see the Heat is starting to get into a rhythm at both ends of the floor, something they never got into last night in New York. Dwayne Wade with four blocked shots in tonight's game. Bounces for LeBron. Allen for three. Come on. Oh, boy. Wow. Ray Allen lifting Miami into a tie at 101. 19 points for Allen. Iguodala for three. Cannot answer. Fareed does on the offensive rebound. 20 points and 11 boards for 22-year-old Kenneth Fareed. He sealed Chris Bosh under the rim that time. Here comes LeBron over Gallinari. First score in the fourth quarter for LeBron James, who has 16 points to go along with nine assists and eight rebounds. Seven double-figure scores for Denver Chalmers with an answer. One-point lead for the Nuggets with 3.44 to go. LeBron got Fareed in the air, and he committed a hard foul, and that'll be the fifth on Kenneth Fareed. Now LeBron facing Fareed. Drives left and finishes. When they need it most, LeBron James is always there. 20 points for James, and the Heat go ahead by one. Win or lose time. LeBron against Fareed. Allen for three. Got it! Ray Allen plus a foul! 11 points in the fourth quarter for Ray Allen. 22 on the night. Six of ten from three-point land. This free throw could put Miami up by three. With four scorers like that, Eric, and Chow was able to hit a three, the, the, coach, the opposing coach has to pick his poison. That time they double-teamed LeBron. Ray Allen had just enough room to make the shot, and uh, LeBron picked up his 11th assist. Wade is on Lawson. LeBron's on equal now. Now LeBron switches out to Gallinari, who fires a long three. It. Rebound, Lawson, tie runs out, and the Heat win it, 119-116. It is an NBA Monday night in Miami, Florida, and it is also game number four for the Miami Heat. They'll take on the Phoenix Suns. Heat go with Chalmers and Wade in the backcourt. Bosch, LeBron, and Battier up front. A four-point lead for the Heat. Dragic now with five points for Phoenix. Nice roll. LeBron lays it in. Terrific pass from Mario Jammer. Beasley for the, f well, not the first time, but certainly, oh my, LeBron just blew by him on the baseline for an easy score. LeBron had to sneak that in before Gortat could get over and block it. LeBron out to Rashard Lewis, a quarter three. And look at LeBron jump for the rebound and score. That was a power rebound if you ever saw one. Warren Dragic looking for open space finds Brown for a three. Shannon Brown. His first two threes of the season have come here in the second quarter. Now coming over, a two-year deal in the offseason. Nice lob from Wade to LeBron. Eight points for James on four of five shooting. Good recognition by both guys. Dudley, open three. Jared Dudley came into this game shooting just 32%, and he's still struggling, missing four of his first five attempts tonight. Brown against Beasley, no contest, plus the foul. Beasley's third. Chalmers gets away from Dragic, finds Wade. Allen back to Dwayne. And LeBron battles and wins for the rebound. 20-footer by Bosch. Well, hard work paying off. 16 for Bosch. Heat lead by 12. Yeah, he get rewarded on that hustle by LeBron. Beasley's miss pulled down by Shane Battier. LeBron the other end. 
12 for James. Lead is 13. So a new era begins in Phoenix without Nash after eight years with him. LeBron for three. His first triple tonight. He's got 16, and the Heat lead is 13. How about that? That's a good one. <laughs> LeBron James hammering home another fast break score for the Heat. The Heat, all of a sudden, take their largest lead of the game at 18 points. This is the largest Heat lead of the season. I guess you could tell Steve LeBeau's back with us, our ace statistician. Oh, my! LeBron hammer time at the Heat's house. LeBron for three. Kaboom. What a night from downtown Miami. 11 triples in 16 attempts. Yeah, ball game's over. The Heat win it by 25. From start to finish, Miami never trail. Officials Mike Callahan, Josh Tiven, and Tony Brown. South Florida and the Heat Nation, glad you're with us. Off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. The Heat are 3-0 at home. The Nets playing their first road game after splitting their first two at home. A win against Toronto and a disappointing loss the other night against Minnesota. Off the steal. Here comes Wade from LeBron. Four guys touch the ball. The steal by Bosch, the dunk by LeBron. Here's Humphreys. And Chalmers emerges with a rebound. Nice bounce pass. What a perfect pass by Mario Chalmers, which has been typical of his point guard play here in the first week or so. Bosch comes away with a steal. The hit ahead for LeBron. Look out! <laughs> Another great pass by Chalmers. Hitting LeBron in stride. When Thomas threw that ball, LeBron was even with his man, but out raced him for the pass. Wade catches underneath, finds LeBron outside. And LeBron hits a three. His seventh triple of the season. LeBron has nine of Miami's 13 points. Johnson's penetration sets up Chris Humphreys. And this time the Heat do get the rebound. Nice cross court for Batty A straight. Kaboom! That deserved to go in. Wow, what a great look by LeBron. He was double teamed on this side. And you know, it's a strange stat. The Heat, 20 of the 22 points for the Heat are by the starting front court. And meanwhile, at the other end, the Nets have eight points on second chance opportunities. Time for a stat update. As James gets his 11th point, so he had two more to be total for the Heat starting front court. LeBron driving, finding Lewis. The win pull-up for the Deuce for the 33-year-old Richard Lewis, who's had double figures in two of the Heat's first four games. The steal by Wade. Brooks is back. LeBron gives help. Look out! You know it was coming, Eric. As soon as you give the ball up, it's a magnet. The other guy's going to get the dunk. Joe Johnson defending LeBron. Allen with a glimmer of space, and that's all he needs. Three for four shooting for Ray Allen. He has six points all here in the second quarter. Wade. Oh, that's well executed play. LeBron hit Dwayne Wade, and Wade now has all 12 of his points in the second quarter. LeBron for two. First points of the second quarter for LeBron. Third quarter underway here in Miami. Thanks so much for joining us here on Sun Sports. Uh, NBA Wednesday in Miami. And Bosch, that's a nice way to start the second half after you went one for eight in the first half. Bosch on the right wing. One on one with Lopez. There's the ball movement. Lane open for LeBron, and Bogans had no choice but to grab and hold. Miami leads by 15. Biggest lead of the game. Chalmers makes it bigger. Mario Chalmers only his fourth triple of the season. The Heat's fifth kaboom of the game. LeBron rumbling in and then tipping it in. LeBron James. He now has 17 points, eight rebounds, seven assists. To Ledovich, chipping paint off the rim down on that end. Three of 18 are the Nets from three-point land. Nice pass by LeBron. Udonis lays it in. That should be the eighth assist tonight for LeBron James. You know, the Nets started off in, in the ABA. They were the New York Nets from 1968 to 1977. Nine years as the New York Nets. Eight of those were ABA years. They moved to New Jersey for the 77-78 season and stayed in the Garden State for 34 years before relocating to Brooklyn this year. LeBron for three. 
LeBron James with his second triple tonight, his seventh of the year, and he has 20 points in this game. Fifth straight game this season. Five games, 20 or more points. The Heat win it by 30, 103 to 73. And the Heat lineup first. Miami will go with Shane Battier, LeBron James, Chris Bosch in the middle. Mike Miller will sub for the ill Dwayne Wade. Mario Chalmers will be the point guard. He's been playing terrific basketball here at the start of the season. Here's Korver from the wing for three. A little long. And a run-out rebound for LeBron. With no Dwayne Wade tonight, we expect LeBron to take over early. And here he goes. 2-0 Miami. Oh, that was a little bit too easy for him there, Bob. That's one thing the Hawks are going to have to do. They have to come over and close down that lane. Shot clock at seven. Josh defending LeBron. Just Three seconds. Up here about the game to see. Bingo. Yeah. LeBron's so been hard. shooting his outside shot so well here. So hard to stop him when LeBron shoots like that. Yeah, that good defense, better offense. Steal by LeBron. Showtime. Devin Harris, break down by Chalmers, Miami running, LeBron, powers it up and in. Brian Forte making sure of what spots on the floor as LeBron triggers. Chris Bosh shoots over Al, great challenge by Horford, but a high archer. You can't defend that shot any better than that. No, no, no way. Well, they're going to have to click on all cylinders tonight to beat this Miami team. No doubt, there's Ray Allen, who has been terrific in a Heat uniform. That's his 14th three-pointer in five games. LeBron, cross court, Ray Allen, another oh. three. Ooh. I do not know where he is on the floor. LeBron. Well, he is about as close to unstoppable down there <laughs> as you can get. LeBron against Stevenson. That's not, much, not much you can do about that. That's a tremendous, <laughs> that, that shot is so difficult to do. Not much, you, not much you can do about that. Nice pass inside to Bosch. LeBron. 15 for LeBron. 50-46. Chalmers. Nice off the window. Second bucket for Chalmers. Chalmers. Back to the basket, Bosch. Mario goes inside, LeBron up and in. 17 for LeBron, 55-50. LeBron to get it in for the Heat. Oh, right down, Peach Tree goes Chalmers. Jeff was on the wrong side of his defender that time. Died at 62. LeBron, high glass and good. What a move. Hawks. Show zone, Lewis turns and hits. Richard Lewis with five, all here in the third period. Miami goes up by one. Here's LeBron, back out to Chalmers. Let's it fly, a three ball good. Mario Chalmers hasn't been heard from in the scoring column since the second quarter. LeBron to the wing, Ray Allen. Made away, got it. Ray Allen with 15, Miami by two. Shot clock at 13 to the game clock at 22. LeBron. Wow. Why is the MVP? That's folks? exactly why he's MVP. And that will be the ball game. Miami goes to five and one. As Jeff Teague and the Hawks are frustrated, falling to two and two. And we come inside for the Toyota starting lineups for the visiting Heat at 5 and 1. Mario Chalmers, Dwayne Wade back from a one game absence. Chris Bosch, Shane Battier, and LeBron James, fifth in the league in scoring at 22.2 points per game. For head coach Eric Spolstra, Bosch from outside, 12th in the league in scoring at 20.2 per game. Grizzlies, the last two years, leading the league in steals, forced turnovers. Nice baseline move by Dwayne Wade and the feed by LeBron James. Rudy missing there from three. And LeBron James guides that one in. And after the Grizzlies had a 10-2 lead, the 6-2 run by the Heat. Miami shooting a league best 51.5% from the floor. And they're one of the top three-point shooting teams in the league.
And even though you don't look at a perimeter team as a team that's going to enjoy much success, Conley works to the baseline. So far, Miami's made it work. They're not a paint team. Rudy underneath. Body missed the shot. Chalmers. And James ties the game at 12, and the Grizzlies need a timeout. Chalmers down the lane. Off offensive rebound, LeBron James. And again, you cannot give second chance opportunities to a team in Miami that typically doesn't get them or convert them. Space for the deep gun. Jared Bayless is in for the first time tonight. James with a head of steam against Quincy Pondexter. LeBron James with eight early. James with three. Rises, hits. One point game, nine tenths of a second. Miami has won their last four. The only blemish, a loss to the Knicks at Madison Square Garden. James with a fadeaway, banked it in. Hey, listen, if he is going to make that for the entire night, the Grizzlies weren't going to win anyway. Conley turns the corner, down the lane. Tap by Gasol, no. Randolph got grabbed by Battier, no call. And the rebound to LeBron James. James with a full head of steam. Lead is now 16. Miami has never tasted the lead. We've been tied twice. LeBron nearly traveled. Battier for three. Battier's first field goal of the night, just the second Miami triple of the game. They shoot 43% from three this season. That's third in the NBA. Conley, right down the middle of the lane, feeds to Gasol, who bobbled. Wade underneath. Wade with just eight. James against Gay. Circus shot converted by LeBron James. James with a full head of steam. High screen by Haslam and James with 18. With Revan Knight and Rob Fisher on Pete Pratica. LeBron James missed it, got it back, put it in. James goes to 20 with that make. Pondexter now works against James on the attack. Knocked out of bounds. Grizzlies keep with three tenths of a second on the shot clock. And Harrelson will dribble it out. A dominant performance by the Memphis Grizzlies, particularly in the second half. They get 25 from Wayne Ellington, 21 from Rudy Gay. And they beat the Miami Heat, holding the league's top offensive club to just 86 points, 21 below their season average. Live from Toyota Center in downtown Houston, Comcast Sportsnet presents Houston Rockets basketball. And tonight, the Rockets taking on the world champion Miami Heat. Ashik takes it down low, lost the basketball, got it back, has it deflected again. Chalmers on the run. Alley up! Wow. Woo! When you say athletic, LeBron James, the greatest player on the planet, he, his head was over the rim, guys. Jeremy Lin's open. The Rockets just simply have to hit that shot. They're hitting only 27% of their threes this season. Not good. Danny A hits a three. See, the Heat are in full. I mean, this team is, it's like they never stamped off the court. Well, their bench is deeper this year than it was last year with Ray Allen. Parsons lays it up. And Rashard Lewis. Yes. Rashard Two of the better well. three-point shooters in the entire league. How do you get them both? Anybody going to guard him? Wow. Looks like he came out early for practice. Now, Miami is number two in the NBA. They shoot almost 50% a game. Up ahead, fast break, Harden. Harden's got to take on uh, Battier. Contact, no whistle. Quickly back to Dwayne Wade. Hit. They just have so many good defensive players. From Battier to Wade to LeBron. Osset gets it back outside. Parsons swings it around the horn. Down into Patterson. Patterson turns, fires, misses. This is one of those games where you got to make real big-time moves. You can't make Bush League moves. Whoops. Like that? <laughs> you know, you got to don't go for the pump fake. And LeBron got him pinned uh, inside. Chandler down. Parsons been underneath the basket. That's about as easy a basket as you can get. Come on, Chandler, push him out of there. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Going back to LeBron, mainly on the low post now. 
turns and fires it over Parsons for two. I was going to say tough shot, but he made it look easy. Jeremy Lin right down to Patterson in the middle. Back to Parsons. Parsons puts it up. That would have given the Rockets the lead. Back the other way to James. Tipped away by Parsons, and goaltending is called on Chandler. Parsons will have to fire it from way downtown. See, they'll give him that one all night long. James got a mouse in the house. Missed it. Bosch, good job of trailing it. They're going to go for a three. Got it. And LeBron James is in the building, folks. And Wade puts it up with the miss. Right to Bosch. Bosch back to James. James got the three. What a pass from Bosch. One-handed. Quickly in the corner. Delfino again. He's red hot. That's what happens with a shooter. He was 0 for 4 in the first half, but you don't stop shooting. And he's a guy you don't want to leave out on the court. Don't leave this guy either. <laughs> the Rockets are all excited about hitting these threes to get back in the game, but they're not playing any defense on the other end. LeBron puts it up and in. He just keeps rolling. It's tough off the pick and roll. He penetrates so well, you have to get off of him, and when you do, he knocks down the open. He's jump. got 14 points in this quarter alone. Yeah, you knew you knew that would happen. Eight on the shot clock. James falls back, fires, hit. Wow. Oh, that was a step back that was, he probably shot it from the three-point line, but he, he started at the elbow. James, cross court. Ray Allen hit. You don't want to leave him. That's what happens when you send people running after LeBron on one side of the court. Allen, back to James. James puts up a three. 6.42 left in the game. Chalmers inside. Two more for LeBron James. Well executed play by the Heat down the stretch. Eight seconds on the shot clock. D-Way going to the basket. Parsons clips it. It goes to LeBron, and he puts it in for a three. LeBron James with 30 points. He had only six at halftime. Harden on the isolation with Bosch. Puts up a three. Missed it. And is tipped out of bounds by Houston. Now, the problem with that shot is it's too quick. Yeah, they've been you getting, want to run some clock. They've been, getting, they've been getting better shots. The clock is your friend. He had Bosch on him, too. And that's a big, tall guy. There's Bosch again. Look at that pick and roll. Whoa, James. Goodness. 153 left, five on the shot clock now as Dwayne Wade brings it in. All the way to LeBron. LeBron raises up for a three. Guys, That's just incredible there. Wow, what a shot for LeBron James. And he was deep, deep, deep. deep. He, he shot it from the broadcast boot. Rockets need defense, leading by a point. James and Delfino. James and Delfino, James gets a step, takes it up and in. And Miami has taken the lead by one point with 18 seconds left to play. LeBron James with 38 points. Parsons will bring it in. Bosch will be on the ball. So that means that LeBron's got it. Three seconds down to two. Harden steps back, fires it. Oh, missed it. So Miami pulls it out. Outscoring Houston 31 to 25 in the fourth quarter. It is NBA Wednesday on ESPN, presented by State Farm. The defending champion Miami Heat take on the LA Clippers as you look live at downtown Los Angeles on this Wednesday night. And the fans settling into the Staples Center. The Heat have won five of their last six. They're six and two. The Clippers have won three in a row. They are five and two. Oh, James left there. That's a fine way to start the game. Let's give LeBron an easy dunk. James posting on Butler. LeBron on the turnaround. We know what a great three-point shooting team Miami is, but they've actually been outshot from the three. They've given up four more threes than they've made. I think they've got to get back to covering both the basket and the three-point line as Wade breaks out. <laughs> But they can do that with the speed and quickness they have. You should be able to cover the basket and the three-point line. Paul and Griffin trying to play a two-man game on that far side. And Battier defending Blake. The help from LeBron comes up with the block, and here come the Heat. As Griffin responds. And Blake Griffin has worked extensively 
to gain consistency in that jump shot, the free throw, that jump shot from 17 feet looked good. The offense coming easy both sides. Battier knocks it down each team. Shooting over 50% at the start. And that is what this team's been doing so well. Battier on the business end with a three. Where that hockey assist term has been so much a part of Miami's play in the early part of the year. You've got to make your decision quickly. Either pass it, drive it, or shoot it. They're just moving the ball so well as James backs down Griffin with a nice running hook. Third time, James on Griffin. Got to the basket. Coming to the line for a three-point play. Crawford trapped in trouble. James on the takeaway. Ray Allen throws it ahead, and here is LeBron. And I love what Miami did to Crawford there on the pick and roll. They trapped him instead of let him play with the ball in space. Shot clock at seven. LeBron, bullet pass inside to Ray Allen. Blake Griffin, who hit a couple of early outside shots, missed that one. The Sent Vinny Del Negro's hand through his hair. After his first rebound of the night, James comes to the basket and a chance for the three-point play. You almost have to think it'd be a no-brainer for Chris Paul. It's L.A. He's playing with talented players, good veterans. James across the lane with the hook. Miami back on top. I mean, you can't stop that. It's so good. <laughs> that's, just, that's just too good. That's his third post-up basket. Griffin has five assists tonight. Bosch gets his second field goal. With plenty of time on the shot. Ten with Griffin getting it back to Butler. Hit one from there a moment ago. Gets it stripped. Here's James running out. Griffin joining Green back. And LeBron gets fouled on the outside by Willie Green. It was one on two, and Willie Green felt like he was in trouble on the wing. Look at James Strong take. Oh my gosh, that is just so darn unstoppable. And, and I have a lot of problems too with Barack Obama not winning for Hawaii. Some guy named Mari Mosa or somebody. Come on. There is Alaska's sexiest man with a dish to LeBron for the layup. And Benny Del Negro needs to pull the plug on this one. Timeout. Taken by the Clippers. It is Lewis, Ray Allen, Dwayne Wade, LeBron James, and Udonis Haslam for the defending world champion Heat. In the midst of a season tying long road trip as Barnes fouls LeBron. And a great comeback by the Bulls after squandering a 14 point lead in the fourth so early just eight games into the season as james comes back door couldn't get the circus layup as hollins took his headband off and his calls for the foul boss knocks it down from the outside his third field goal in 13 tries hollins left up top with lebron comes left got the bump got the basket chance for the old-fashioned three-point play for james jamal crawford off the bounce Rebound, James, you said this is not over. No, and LeBron James talked his way into staying in the game. Norris as Cole rattles home the jumper. It's 13 here. At the last timeout. The meeting here at Staples to the Clippers, 107-100. Welcome, everyone. We're live in Denver, Colorado. A spectacular night in the Rockies with the reminder that the NBA on TNT tonight is brought to you by State Farm. A good one, the defending NBA champion Miami Heat taking on the four and four Denver Nuggets. And here is Kenneth Fareed, the reigning Western Conference Player of the Week. And here comes the Eastern Conference Player of the Week, LeBron James, working on Iguodala. Outside of three, Battier right down the hatch. Not what Eric Sposa did on that miss there by the Nuggets. Battier wide open, triple again. The Miami Heat have four different players that have all yeah. hit over 1,000 threes in their career. Here comes LeBron inside, losing the ball. Nice defense by Denver. Three, he throws it away. Chalmers and James. LeBron James is asking, where is the foul? Kufus did a good job of getting back into the play, trying to block that LeBron James throwdown. And a drive. 
with Miller. Oh my goodness. And here comes LeBron in flight, landing safely. And James has put in four. And we're approaching three to play in the first quarter. Second game in as many nights for the Miami Heat. And the shot clock at two. LeBron. LeBron last night with the 30 points, and he's had such a marvelous start to the game. Probably the best start back of his career. Kyle talking about defending James a, a lot of how you attack his aggressiveness is what is going to be shown by him. Cole from outside. In other words, they want to read LeBron and figure out what kind of player he's going to be. Is he going to be a scorer? Is he going to be a facilitator? How is he going to approach the game? comes LeBron, 3 of 7. Fareed was defending. Uh, so easy. Miller watching James. Love it. You know, for so many years, people were wondering, you know, LeBron James is the most physically gifted, probably athlete that's ever played this game. Hamilton puts in a three-point shot from Los Angeles High School in Compton, went to Texas. He was a late first-round pick by Denver, played a bit in the D-League, and they have high hopes for him. Well, and he's one guy that could really stretch the floor with his three-point shooting and a reliable shooter as Mike Miller answer is, answers the three-pointer at the other end. Teams are pretty much getting what they want. They're giving up 100 points with three straight games to opponents, and that's unacceptable. Now, if you're Eric Spolstra, is that just the championship blues that this team is going through? Or, as you said, have it. Shot clock at four, big clock, a second higher, and here's a long three. Ray Allen drills it. James with the assist. Watson for Reed right to the lip. Oh man. I yeah. love this kid. Ready. 15 rebounds and 14 points. 15 rebounds. Nine offensive. Norris Cole. LeBron. Last season average 27 points. This year averaging 24. Gliding in for two. LeBron James. He's taking the second most shots in the NBA in back of Russell Westbrook in Oklahoma City. Miller firing the triple. Mike Miller puts in a three-point shot. Ron, six of 14, 15 points. Miller, a three. Well, the good news is his right hand is fine. <laughs> it's just his guide hand, which is messed up. Remember, Miami has lost 10 consecutive games here. They have not won since 2002. Come on, man. Bettier puts in a triple. <laughs> it's become a shooting gallery inside for the defending champion. Now they put McGee on James. <laughs> LeBron took a shot as he went inside. Rashard Lewis is in. He's out there defending the Hamilton shot. Here comes LeBron the other way. Man. Just like that. Oof. Back up to 15 points. Yep. Farid has come in for Gallinari. James over Brewer. LeBron. So smooth. 19 points. Miller just accounted for his fifth assist. Bosch. 14 for Chris Bosch. And LeBron James scooting right inside, 21 points and 11 assists. He's gone 9 of 20 tonight. James with Iguodala defending. LeBron with 23. That is a game high. Nice rejection of the Fareed shot. The best defender for the Denver Nuggets is Iguodala. And LeBron takes him right there for his 25th. Cole, he'll put up a 3 and bang it home! A big time three from Norris Cole. That'll be it. Miami is going to go to seven and three. And in the fifth stop in a six game road trip in a nine day span, they come up with the win in their fourth game in five days. Battier and Miller combined to go 10 of 15 from beyond the arc. One night after the curtain came down in Hollywood versus the 16-time champion Lakers, the Suns lock horns with the defending NBA champs. Welcome to U.S. Airways Center here in the Legends Entertainment District of downtown Phoenix. It's the one and only visit 
for LeBron and company as the Phoenix Suns take on the Miami Heat here on Fox Sports Arizona. James, pretty, and guess what? His first field goal. The Suns averaging 8.2 steals, already have eight tonight. And the foul on Phoenix. It's on O'Neal. Miller to inbound. 3.35 to go in the in the half. The ball faked by James and Beasley. Oh, fell right into it. And he hit. One minute to go in the half. LeBron James puts on a one-man show. LeBron James. Tough shot. In terms of Gortat, if he continues his struggle, don't be surprised if Alvin goes to Jermaine O'Neal and that Suns bench, which came through with some big numbers in that first half. All right, Kevin, then... Uh, a nice shot from the corner by Norris Cole, the second-year man out of Cleveland State. This is Beasley rolling left, throws up a lefty, and it goes over the rim. Miller, the lob to James! Right on the money! He knew it would happen sooner or later. Isolation with LeBron moving in on Beasley. He swings it out to Battier for three. So many weapons. Battier, a deep three. Back tap by Haslam, a fresh 24. James for three. Right on. Kevin Ray's got it. Nice play by Chalmers, Kevin. Well, LeBron James back on the floor. Alvin Gentry's got his uh, youngster, P.J. Tucker, locked up on him defensively. And LeBron looking right at Alvin saying, I'm going to foul your boy out quick. I'm going to foul him out quick. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Telfair's pass off a knee. Here's Chalmers on the turnover. What a pass by Bosch James, the beneficiary. Yeah, Bosch didn't know he was behind them at first, and then a peek over the shoulder found his teammate. Beasley had it stripped. Yeah, you can't jump. Can't jump and pass against his team. James, oh, brother, a reverse emphatic slam. And he came down in a hurry. 88-79, LeBron has 18. Four-point game under a minute. Anxious moments. Here at U.S. Airways Center, the pick by Bosch. James. Threading his way to the rim. And there's your buzzer. So the Phoenix Suns fall to four and seven. The Heat end their six game road trip. Going to eight and three, and they sweep the season series two to nothing. On this night before Thanksgiving, the Heat a perfect 4-0 at home. And now they begin the longest stretch of games in their building. But they begin it against one of the NBA's most surprising November stories and a team that has had rare success here in Miami. Welcome inside the Heat's house, the American Airlines Arena, for the first of four games between 8-3 and three Miami, the 6-3 and three Bucks. We always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. Miami Heat basketball on Sun Sports presented by AT&T. Shot clock and the 6. In the paint, LeBron converts. Good patience by the Heat. They get a good shot. Jennings for three. And the rebound of LeBron and the Heat are off and running. Three on two break. Easy for Jennings. There's no way Jennings can stop LeBron in the open court. LeBron knew it and had an easy layup. And LeBron just blocked down there. Figure the Heat go to this matchup pretty often tonight as LeBron comes up short on the hook but gets it back. And wait, attack to the left hand. LeBron always knows where his teammates are. We know records are meant to be broken, but you got to love it when a guy like you does stuff. You know, he's an amazing individual on and especially off the court. And um, he is a, uh, a Miami Heat legend. He's a, a legend here in the community. His roots of basketball started here. And again, I can't think of anybody more deserving of this, this accomplishment than him. Well, thank you for your graciousness at the top. Good man, thank you so much. Yeah. Eric, what makes it even more special, what Udonis did, is that twice he could have taken more money to go somewhere else. He turned down millions of dollars to stay here and play on his hometown team, and you can see the benefit of that. LeBron James backing up for the jump shot. LeBron has 10 first quarter points. Dwayne Wade also has 10. And they get 12 rebounds for Bosch. Wade the trailer. 
finish. Uh, good pass from LeBron. Good timing on the pass. Here you Sova, he had nothing he could do there with two of the best players in the league on the same team in the open court. Here's LeBron. A three. His 15th triple of the season is first of the game. Chalmers from the angle. Kaboom. Mario's first triple of the game is 10th three of the season. Ilya Sova drives in on Batty, a block by Bosch. LeBron zigzag by Gallimbert, two Wade. Best thing about that play, Eric, was LeBron avoiding the charge and making a pinpoint pass to his buddy Wade. LeBron with a steal, a laser hit ahead. And Trey Wade with an easy score. Just over five minutes left, third quarter. Ellis lost it, and it's a two-on-one break. Chalmers and LeBron. No contest. Jennings was helpless on the defensive end. Harris has played LeBron a lot better than we thought he would. James has outscored Harris by only four. Make it six. LeBron now with 17 points. Miami's ahead by six. Milwaukee got a fortunate bounce at this, bounce at this end. He got one at the other. LeBron for three. Come on. That's LeBron James time. We've seen this many times. LeBron James hit a three a moment ago. Nice catch by Dwayne and finish. First score of the fourth quarter for Dwayne Wade. Evens the game at 91. LeBron against Udo. Allen for three. Come on. If LeBron's not scoring, he's hitting a teammate for a three. Wow. Miami trails 98-96. Here's Wade, gets it off, no, blocked by Ellis. And no foul, and we go to overtime. LeBron throws Wade. What a screen by LeBron, and then he got open off the screen. Those guys complement each other so well. Four point lead, minute 50 left in overtime. LeBron, giddy up. Oh man, to his left, unstoppable. And right now the Wizards, are tied with the Hawks with three seconds left in regulation. Bosch's pass off the boot. Taken by LeBron. Here's Allen for three. Oh, man. Dagger. Dagger time for Ray Allen. A late three in the fourth quarter. And that one that puts Miami ahead. 109 to 100. The Heat go to 5-0 and at home. 9-3 and three on the season. On this cool, clear NBA Saturday night in Miami. We're back at the Heat's house, game number 13 this season for 9-3 Miami. They take on the 3-9 Cavaliers first of four matchups between these clubs. We always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. And this is Waiters missing the three. And LeBron off and running with his first rebound. Nice pass, that's Chalmers, and that's good. Uh, Chalmers snuck in behind the D, but he didn't sneak on LeBron. LeBron saw it all the way. LeBron from downtown. Waiters hanging but missing. And Haslam able to box out Varejao yeah, that time. Here's Twain. LeBron! Twain knew exactly what he was going to do with the ball before he caught it. I know I say that a lot, but it's true. Twain Wade with great court vision hits his partner for the dunk. So G defending LeBron. G has no back down in his makeup. James draws a foul and powered right through it. Powered right through the rookie Zeller. That guy doesn't have any back down either. Nope. Jazz <laughs> ahead by six. Under five minutes left, first half. Bosch, the prince of mid-range, getting a steady diet of jumpers he can make. He's got 13 points. Thompson, Tristan Thompson, really struggled to score earlier this year, but he has made all five of his shots, he has 10 points, and the Cavaliers right now thumping a sleepwalking Heat team as LeBron lays it in with a reverse. 13 for LeBron. Wade against Gibson. LeBron underneath, lays it up, spun out. Again! That, that pass was for Bosch. LeBron happened to be in the right place at the right time. Miami down three, LeBron James driving to the basket, draws foul on Anderson Varejao.
Ziller getting one of the two free throws, extending Cleveland's lead to two points. Tyler has five points in the game off the bench as C.J. Miles draw, uh, draws the foul. He picks it up on the LeBron drive. On Miles, his first foul. A couple of free throws ahead for LeBron. Miller off the shot fade. This is LeBron for two. There's that cut again. The great timing about those hard cuts and then teammates willing to share the ball. Under a minute left in the third quarter. This has been the Heat's best quarter of the game. LeBron, his best quarter of the game. A two for LeBron. He's got 12 in the quarter, 23 on the night. We're even at 75. LeBron against C.J. Miles. He'll let it fly. Two more for LeBron James. What a quarter for James. He's got 14 points in the quarter, 25 for the night. Allen out of the corner for three. His first triple of the game. His 25th of the year, the Heat really needed it. They're down three. LeBron backs up, Zeller to seven. Three on the way. Kaboom! 28 for LeBron James. His second triple. Waiters, long three. And Dwayne Wade doing a great job out jumping Verja to deflect the rebound of LeBron. Wade down the lane has to flip it back to Chalmers. Wade from LeBron. Four points in a row for Dwayne Wade. The Heat have scored four in a row. It's 101-100. Cleveland has seven straight points since it was even at 101. In the NBA, anything can happen as LeBron scores off the out-of-bounds play. They'll be two to tie, three to take their first lead since the first quarter. LeBron on the move. Allen for three. Yes! Wow. Ray Allen to the rescue. Off an assist from LeBron. Looking for the win in the final possession of regulation. Miami up one. Parko goes up. Blocked by Wade. Allen has it. Dwayne Wade. Game saving block on the defensive end. G looking and looking. Mishandled game ends. Wow. The Heat do it. They score the last nine points. They stay unblemished at home. And as the NBA champion Miami Heat take on the San Antonio Spurs. Nice slip from that previous play there by Splitter on that high pick and roll. And LeBron putting up a three-point shot. And Reggie, we know that the three-point shooting for Miami is better this year than a season ago. So from great Popovich's standpoint, they're finishing a 10-day trip. This is their fourth game in five nights. They've got an older roster. They've already done an eight-day trip early in November. I understand where he's coming from. Yeah. This is a tough sale, though, from a basketball standpoint, because you and I are competitors. Yes. If a coach would have came to you and said, look, we've got one of the best records in the league. We're going against the defending champs. Pat I would, I would want to play. What? Patty Mills yeah. getting it up, isn't it? <laughs> hey, this is a chance for Patty Mills to play. That's why it, it's a tough sell as LeBron James knocks down his second three of this first quarter. Bonner, a three, the top three-point shooter in the NBA. With LeBron grabbing the loose ball. James and Chalmers have oh, no. oh, all 13 points so far. Rashard Lewis. Time out, Popovich. Neal, by the way, for the Spurs, the only perimeter player. Oh, they go inside! LeBron to Wade with a beautiful pass right there by James. But the thing I like about the Spurs, even as Tim Duncan got older and Ginobili's getting older, they still have the best record with guys off the street. That's what's amazing to me about the Spurs. The Spurs have had the best record in the NBA like two out of the last three years. And that, to me, is about coaching. What a pass there by Mario Sarver. Absolutely. Bosch with a screen. What a pass. Pick and roll, James with what the feed. Pass. Yeah, nice. And there's a reason why he's a three-time MVP. And splitter. Bosch will defend him here. Plenty of time on the clock. Not See, that's, at that, home. that is there all night that if he wants is nice. to. That is nice. He can post up all night. Look, Chris Bosch is an undersized power forward. If he posts up, that is there all night. He's got 12, and Bosch had all 12 of his in the second quarter. LeBron chiseling inside. Yeah, too late. Yeah. You can't let him get that low. 
Yeah. Coach Popovich told you and I, he said, we've gone to a European style of offense. We want a lot of movement. We're going to stress offense and high speed, and they've tried to keep that pace. And Charles just talked about well, that. Nice shot from outside, but that pace oh, is such a big deal for well, San Antonio. That's because he had Tony Parker and Ginobili. Jeans from outside. Wow. Knocks that in. LeBron now. Just for, hey, grew up in Miami, played the University of Florida. Fact, his roommate in college down in Gainesville was Mike Miller. Nice little move wow. right there by LeBron James. Now that hurts now, because uh, in, in America, that guy's 6'8", 260. Just drove around a little guy. It takes a physical toll on your body every time you go to the hole and you're hitting wood. Well, that's why you have to learn when your talent le comes down because everybody gets older. You have to learn to play below the rim. James. Wow. Beautiful shot by LeBron. LeBron. LeBron's gonna have to win this game. Cause nobody else, Bosch is playing well, but nobody else is playing well. Chalmers, James, Allen, a big three here and a miss. Another offensive rebound by James, he's got Le nine. LeBron's man got two offensive rebounds in a row. In the the off to Hassel. That's the only difference in the game, superstars. LeBron's got two offensive rebounds and assists on that one play. James. They're in trouble right now. Splitter was there defending and draws the foul. And when you got LeBron James, that's why I said, when you got LeBron James coming at you full speed, you are in trouble. Bosch with the screen, they switch and put Splitter they, on They got to be careful right here because somebody might get a wide open three when he takes the ball to the basket. James. Oh, my God. Woo. Are you kidding me? What made that move so difficult oh. is when he curled or turned and went right into the body of Tiago Splitter. Just put him off balance. Bad switch. Knocked away by Nicolo. LeBron, shot oh. clock at three. Allen card! Wow. Well, there's got to be a lot of respect for this uh, championship Miami team to get the kind of game they got tonight. It shows right there. 11 and 3 Miami, 11 and 4 Brooklyn. Both teams have won five straight. The winner tonight leaves this building with the best record in the East. Our officiating crew, Scott Foster, Curtis Blair, and Brian Forte. Both teams come in with a five-game winning streak. Blatch with a rainbow jumper. The eight-year veteran who spent his first seven seasons with the Wizards, and he has resurrected his career after an injury-marred, enigmatic season a year ago in the nation's capital. Chavers got the layup. Rio did a good job when he came off the screen. He read the defense, little hesitation, and then he speed up, he sped up to the rim. Got clock at five. Hunter! Wade cuts Stay through. Hard, hard. LeBron finds Chalmers for a three. Come on. Five points for Chalmers. Triple number 12 this season for Mario. Cole, baseline drive for two more. All three of Norris Cole's buckets have been layups. Johnson missed the jumper. LeBron with a rebound. James has played 14 minutes, still without a field goal. No longer. LeBron against Gerald Wallace. And Miller intercepts, three on one break. LeBron, he missed it, got it back. Oh, he got hammered, but did score and draw the foul on Stackhouse. I think that may be the play that revives Miami. LeBron and the foul. Well, LeBron James taking it personal right now. Joel setting the screen for LeBron. Got by two defenders. LeBron James with nine of his ten points here in the second quarter. He's exploding off that first step when he goes to the rim. Five on the shot clock. Wade for LeBron. A three on the way. And he hits. Got a nice bounce for his 21st triple of the season. Seventh rebound for LeBron. He trailed by seven, game they have not experienced the lead. LeBron posting up Williams. He made quick and efficient work out of the low post position on Darren Williams. Good recognition by Chalmers to get the ball back to LeBron, who had the advantage. Joe Johnson defending LeBron. Nice pass. Allen backs it in. Seven points for Allen. He's made all three of his shots. LeBron with a steal. LeBron with a slam. It is a 12-2 run and Miami's first lead of the game. Game tied for the fourth time. Nice give and go. And Wade just went. 
Wade with 12 in the quarter, 28 on the nine, five on the shot clock. Two minutes left, third quarter. Miller, quarter three, come on. First points of the game for Miller on his 11th triple of the season, and the Heat all of a sudden have a five point lead. How about LeBron, 17 points, eight rebounds, six assists. And Eric, give Coach Foles the credit, playing uh, Norris Cole a lot of minutes tonight because he was playing well. LeBron James with 21, so he's, he extends his streak to 20 consecutive games with at least 20 points, and that would include all 15 games this season. And we'll see the Nets again in Brooklyn at the end of January, but here at the beginning of December, the Heat sit atop the Eastern Conference at 12-3. and 15 years and going strong. A revitalization of downtown D.C. as Verizon Center celebrates thrilling moments, lasting memories. And tonight, add one to the list as Comcast Sportsnet brings you Wizards basketball. The Wiz get set for their first meeting this season against LeBron James and the 12 and 3 Miami Heat. Michael Jordan, the only other guy to do all those things that Chris said. That was back in 1992. As LeBron enters this year ranked third on the NBA's all-time scoring average list behind only Jordan and Chamberlain. Here's Bosch, has hit two shots so far. Looking in the low post for James. Streaking down the middle is Wade. Great pass. And he's fouled. Crawford thinking about it with eight seconds to shoot. Spins on a very tough fading shot. And the rebound to Chalmers. Good defense to stay down on Wade. It's Crawford. LeBron gets baseline. The size and the strength that he has, and then the quick footwork. Allen, screen roll. They go into the corner. The shot missed. Kept alive by Lewis. Once again, boy, somebody's down. Yeah, there's a wizard down. It looks like it's A.J. Price who was covering his mouth. But he jumps up quickly. Oh, what a pass from LeBron. Allen wow. off a screen. LeBron back in the game with Wade. Bosch from the corner. Like I said, he's a big man that can really help stretch the defense as a silky smooth release. Nene has to lay it off and he turns it over and now it's a two on one break. And a nice pass by Ray Allen, and the lead is down to four. Bradley Beal with nowhere to go. That's tipped away by Wade, and that's stolen. Ariza spots up, and LeBron is there for the rebound. His fifth rebound, he's got eight points. Wade goes all the way and slams it in. LeBron kicks it out to Ray Allen for three. You know, at this point, I would just have somebody stay right with Ray at all times, never leave him. Bosh, boy, that play was beautifully done and a foul call. You see the numbers, four points, five assists, and three steals. Again, Trevor Ariza out for the rest of the game with a left calf strain. Yeah, but he has been so active on the defensive side, uh, not just stealing the ball, but disrupting the offense, helping out. And LeBron starting to pick up the pace. He and Wade both starting to pick things up. Eight times this year, the Miami Heat have trailed going into the fourth quarter. They've come back to win five of those games. Nene keeps it, saves it. Back to the big man. His pass is picked off by James. Got to slow down now. Ray Allen. Measures the three and can't get the bounce. Nene battling, but LeBron James, so strong, pulls down the rebound and gets the poop points. Game looks like it just comes so easy for him. He can do just about anything out there on the floor he wants to do. LeBron. Uses so that uh, he uses that off arm as well as anybody in the league. Well, he but wedged himself in between in in front of Martell. Singleton tries and he rims it. 
Washington with a couple of opportunities to extend this four-point lead could not cash in. They leave Bosch alone and he gets the roll. Pass to Webster, reverse layup is blocked out of bounds. The Wizards lose it and give it back. That was LeBron James came in, coming in. It looked like it was going to be a reverse layup. Three-pointer cuts it to one. Not much you can do yeah. about that. Tough guard for Kevin Seraph and everybody else trying to stay home. Wade underneath. And he scores. To LeBron, driving, scoring off the glass to cut it to one with eight seconds to play. LeBron steps behind the line and shoots. That's off. Tipped up, rebound, Nene. The Wizards are hanging on, and he's fouled with 2.2 seconds to play. And he gets it. With 2.2 seconds to play, Washington leads by four, and they have defeated the Miami Heat for the third straight time. Beautiful 73 degree day in South Florida. Great atmosphere here in Miami in the midst of Art Basel Week, a popular annual art festival that takes place in this area and a sellout crowd of better than 19,000 have made their way into American Airlines Arena. The NBA on TNT is being presented by State Farm. It's a matchup of the top teams in the Eastern Conference, the revitalized New York Knicks and the NBA defending champion Miami Heat. Miami at 12 and 4. That equals their best start in franchise history through 16 games. They got off to a 12 and 4 start. Oh, beautiful play. Haslam with the dunk. Just a gorgeous feed from LeBron James and Marvin. A beautiful possession, indicative of what Miami has been able to do offensively. They've gotten so efficient in the half court. And they've been winning or without really trying that hard as Haslam gets the two off another beautiful feed from James. Beautiful ball movement and James able to finish it off. So the Heat up by one. Amber's pass picked off. Here's LeBron putting the speed on. Took a bump. Gets the continuation. Yes. And it counts. You know what the best home record is of all time? NBA history. I do. Yes. Do, we, do you want me to answer yeah, or should we leave of, it? It's kind of a quickie quiz, yeah. 41 and 1, correct? The Celtics back in 85-86. Uh, you are correct. Oh, James for three. James, yes. Well, I'm going back to Woodson. Played for Bobby Knight, obviously, so learned under some great coaches. You mentioned Bolzman. LeBron will work it down. No fouls to give for New York. Five seconds. Down to three. Miller for three. Yes! What a beautiful pass from LeBron. He found the open man. They will review it, but he got it off on time. The Miami Heat allow nearly 100 points a game. That's a high number, 21st in the league. Last year for the season, they allowed just 92 as Wade is able to hit. Or I should say at this point, they were giving up about 92 a game, which was fourth in the league. Miami has added Ray Allen and Rashard Lewis, which has really improved their offense, but neither one of those guys is a particularly good defender. A beautiful look by James. He was double keen. Somehow realized that Haslam was wide open as he cut to the basket. And there's another assist for James as he found Chalmers and had very little room, little space to get it to. Off the steal by Allen. Oh. LeBron James, 13 points along with his six assists. How about this highlight reel play? The alley-oop from Allen and another alley-oop from Wade to LeBron. I said, what do you mean by that? He said, well, Tyson Chandler gives them vertical spacing. And what he means is Smith gets all the way to the rim oh. but can't score. What he means is when Chandler rolls to the front of the rim, they can throw the ball up high as Allen knocks down the jumper in transition. Got clock down to five. James over Chandler. Yes. So LeBron with a sensational first half. Six of seven from the field. He has 18 points along with seven assists. Felt with a gorgeous move. No help on the part of Miami.
and has the uh, easy drive. But I know where you're going with this, Marv. You're, you're asking, is Miami motivated enough as LeBron exactly. knocks down the three? I mean, we're not seeing the energy, but that has been a problem with this team, even though they have a record of 12 and 4. Here's Allen. And that's a two pointer for Ray Allen. A rare bucket for Miami in this third quarter. LeBron James with 23 points. Smith missed the layup. He thought he was fouled. Here comes James. Oh, oh my goodness. LeBron James. Oh, bad pass by Felt. Here comes James. Shovel shoot. And you get the feeling Miami very much back in it. Mike Wilson has that feeling. Takes a timeout with a minute eight left in the third. He wants his team to close this quarter well because LeBron is on fire. Just shot out of a cannon right there, slamming it down the lane. But important final minute for the Knicks. LeBron will probably go to the to the bench to start the fourth. Can the Knicks maintain this lead? James watched by Brewer. Now Wallace comes over. Here's LeBron, and he's fouled in the act by Wallace. LeBron backing his way on Brewer, uses his power and score. Brewer did a great job defensively on that possession, and LeBron just scored. LeBron James with 31 points for the final score. The Knicks 112 and the Heat 92. And welcome inside the American Airlines Arena. Game number 18 this season for the Miami Heat. They'll take their 12 and 5 record and their two game losing streak in against the New Orleans Hornets. The Hornets have lost 13 of their 18 games. Heat move it for a Haslam jumper and that's good. Tony more than X's and O's, Eric Spolster says it's about energy and effort and defensive intensity for his team tonight. LeBron going against Xavier Henry making his second straight start. The spin, Amalaya! Eric, that was a good job by Mario Thomas telling his teammate to get out of it. Nice pass into Udonis. Nicer back to Chalmers. Kaboom! Very good ball movement by the Heat. They're not settling for the outside shot. Henderson and Lopez both have 10 points on a combined 8 for 9 shooting. 12 of the Hornets uh, points tonight have come in the paint. Well, Mario Chalmers twice has connected on triples here in the first quarter. LeBron, good movement without the ball, and then very efficient with the ball. Good use of the screen on the baseline. Aminu guarding LeBron. A blow by. What a move by LeBron. He went left, crossover right in the lane, made it look easy. Ryan Anderson and Robin Lopez leading the world. There's a steal by LeBron. LeBron racing ahead by Vasquez for the slam. It should count. I what think he's a full court maneuver from LeBron James. That's a freight train coming straight downhill. And Eric, it came off the defense. They double teamed the ball. LeBron stole it. You got him coming at you in the open court, you are in trouble. I don't care if it's one on one, one on two, one on three. He's going to find a way to get to the rim. He's either going to score or hit an open teammate. And uh, people who are worried about maybe him being hurt earlier, worry no more, baby. That Expo replay brought to you by Randi Institute. How about a little free advice from the coach? What do you do if you're a defender and LeBron James is coming right at you? You got to grab him higher up. He, once he gets under the launching pad, it could be a three-point play. Put him on the foul line. You're not going to stop him. 5-10 left here on the first half. Mike Miller brings down the Lance Thomas miss and then chases down LeBron. Couldn't do it. What a play! A perfect pass from Dwayne Wade. Touchdown, baby, on Saturday night by D Wade to LeBron. LeBron, who has 11 first half points on five of six shooting. How about two more, that time using the glass. LeBron in the box, well done. Wade six of eight from the floor in the first half. LeBron James was six of seven. Tony, really big factor in that first half, the foul trouble to Ryan Anderson. He had it going before he had to sit down. LeBron James keeps it going. 
He's now seven of eight for 15 points on the Heat again, lead by 17. By the way, the Heat made 13 of their 17 shots in the second quarter, the best field goal percentage in the second quarter this season for Miami. Another driving score by LeBron. He has 17 points. He usually goes over the defender. That time he went under the defense. In the passing lane, Chalmers with the steal. Oh, my! <laughs> Great court vision for Chalmers. He put it up in the air, and LeBron smashing it through. Eric, Wade running down the center of the floor set that up. LeBron for the sweeper. There's that. He got over the 20 mark again. LeBron. LeBron tips it in. Eight points in the quarter for LeBron James. Ray Allen from downtown. Come on. It's amazing how LeBron always finds Ray Allen, no matter where LeBron is and where Ray Allen is. Battier for three. Come on. There's LeBron again, finding the three-point shooters. Six assists, five rebounds, 24 points by LBJ. Cole with six points in his 23 minutes. Chalmers, six points, four rebounds, three assists in his 23 minutes. And those two guys played very well at that point guard position. They haven't been playing that bad. Well, there recently, but they played well tonight. I'll tell you, it's good to point that out. The Heat have been victimized by many of the league's point guards as Patty A triples out of the corner. Miami shoots 58%, their best field goal percentage of the season. It's the ninth time this season the Heat have shot 50% or better in a game, and they have won all nine of those games. Welcome everyone inside the American Airlines Arena for the second of four meetings this year between the 13 and 5 Miami Heat and the 12 and 5 Atlanta Hawks. We always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. Miami Heat basketball on Sun Sports presented by AT&T Uverse. Miami's missed their first two shots and have a turnover. Brown against Smith for the fade. Through Wade and over to LeBron. Lewis for three. Kaboom. 17th triple of the season for Richard Lewis. He's ranking 11th in the NBA in assists this year, almost seven a game. Oh, next nice play. Dwayne Wade, he left Devin Harris in the dust. Harris tried to overplay him on the perimeter, and, and Wade hooks up with LeBron. Morrow with a steal, and the Heat turn it over for the fourth time. Ray Allen tries to get it right back, and does. Cole to LeBron. <laughs> How about a great play by Ray Allen to save it. Norris Cole out jump to Atlanta Hawks. And then how about the frame of mind to give it to his boy? Josh Smith back to back triples. He has 10 points. And the Hawks have even the game. LeBron unevens it. It will count just before the lamp lit to end the first quarter. Chalmers, baseline drop. A three for Miller. LeBron ramming it through. Oh, his man. second dunk of the half. His eighth point of the game. Stay with us at halftime tonight. The ceremony honoring the Miami achievements of Glenn Rice and Steve Smith. And that one saved by Chalmers on the end line. Here's LeBron. And the official helped save that one. I believe it hit his leg and it stopped the momentum of the ball. If the ball hits the official on the court, it's in play, and that's what happened down there. That's a good battle. LeBron James defending Josh Smith down on the block. Good matchup for the Heat defensively. LeBron rattles down a three. His 26th triple this season. And the Heat take a four-point lead on their sixth triple of the first half. Off Joel Anthony's screen. Giving up threes continues to be a weakness for Miami. LeBron racing in for the score and the foul. On the switch, Horford was on LeBron. Bad matchup for Atlanta. LeBron takes advantage of it. When you start talking about playing a top-notch team like the Miami Heat, the way you're going to beat them, you have to have two things. You have to have guys that can beat them up down low, or you have to have three-point shooting. You're not going to beat them off one-on-one -on -one because they do a great job of helping. But when you close out, they keep knocking down threes, and it discourages teams. And if they can keep staying and shooting at that pace, they have a chance to be really good. Oh, what a steal by Chalmers. He rolls it ahead to LeBron. Look out. James on the move. Oh, Nobody oh. better on the open floor than LeBron James, who now has 18 points. The Heat are up by two. You forget he's 6'8". Miami ahead by four, and Dwayne Wade is playing well. 16 points for Wade on seven of eight shooting. Wade has six of those 16 in this quarter. Eric, and despite the fact that he have had five turnovers in this quarter, they have a seven-point lead. 
Shane Pattier makes it a 9-0 run for Miami. Pattier's second triple of the game. Good defense by Pattier. He stripped it from Teague. And a near steal for Smith. LeBron, no look for Wade. You see the way LeBron looked to his left, knowing he was going to go to Wade inside. That freezes the defense. He looks off the defense and gets it to the guy who wants to get it to him. Battier, kaboom, from downtown. Third triple of the game for Shane Battier. See the shot clock, right part of your screen, down to four. Look out! Oh my, it ricocheted out for LeBron James. You call a foul. Eric, Five on the shot clock. The last two games have been really good for the uh, for Wade and LeBron. We'll give you those stats in a second. Here comes LeBron against Lou Williams. Maneuvers into position. That was easy for James, who now is 9 for 12 for 22 points. Harris. Oh, rejected by Joel. And he keeps it in bounds so that he can get a fast break at the other end. LeBron, oh my! A towering finish on a fast break started by Joel Anthony's second block shot of the night. He always tries to block it with a soft hand, so he keeps it in bounds. Alonzo Mourning had that quality. And then Harris defending James, who's had his way. 10 of 15 shooting for James. Well, he's just getting anywhere he wants on the floor. The Hawks appear to be defenseless against LeBron. Well, the smaller guy's playing against him. He just powers his way inside. And you know the Heat uh, guards are really getting this pass down. I guess you can't throw it too high for that man. Again, elbow above the rim on the dunk like he did the other night against the Hornets. A very efficient and pleasing performance tonight on the home floor for Miami. Now 10 and 1 at home at 14 and 5 on the year. They'll take a game and a half lead over the Hawks in the Southeast Division. A pair of 14 win NBA teams set to collide in Miami tonight. Heat own the NBA's second best record at home. The Warriors have the second most road wins in the NBA. Tonight, a test for both of them. Welcome everybody inside the American Airlines Arena. The first of two meetings between. 14 and 5 Miami and the 14 and 7 Golden State Warriors. Curry splitting the D and then a beautiful behind the back feed. And Chalmers brings down the Matt, uh, the Harris, Harrison Barnes miss. Uh, quite a chore for the rookie Barnes defending LeBron James. You're right about it being a chore, Eric. LeBron back to work against Harrison Barnes. Step 101. Yeah, Barnes going to get an education tonight about what everyone else in the league knows. It's almost impossible to guard LeBron. Quick release for Thompson. And LeBron with both hands on the ball down. LeBron jumped a little early that time, but he stayed up there to get the rebound. Here he comes. He loved the way he switches hands in midair. He's done that a lot lately with the left hand. Barnes losing it to Wade, who saves it in behind the backstop. Yeah, you can see that coming, Eric. As soon as LeBron caught it, he knew he had Dwayne Wade open. Good play by Chalmers to get the ball to LeBron. Jared Jack defending LeBron. Anthony sets a rock solid screen. Battier for three. Come on. Eric, that screen is what set up uh, Battier being open. Oh, the vision of Curry to find Thompson again on the three point line. Good work by Wade to grab the rebound. Curry, not only a great shooter, a gifted passer. LeBron on the attack. Oh, oh my, a hard fall for LeBron James. A seemingly indestructible one was jarred by that crash landing. And LeBron stays in the game after making both free throws. He has eight points and gets two more. I guess his shoulder's okay. <laughs> now shouldering a rather heavy burden for Miami. I right, thank you, Jax. LeBron James now with a dozen points. Harrison Barnes has come to life. Got six points, four of them here in the third quarter. LeBron gets two back for Miami. James now has 14, and it's 14 and seven takeoff by the Warriors, their best start since the 91-92 season. They've waited a long time in the Bay for good basketball. Bosch dribbling out of the corner, his fourth three-pointer of the season. Five on the shot clock for LeBron. They made that look easy. Miami well, might want to get back to that. 18 points for LeBron James. Now 
Ron draws double coverage. Here's a LeBron three. Come on. There it is, Eric. 25 straight games with 20 or more points. LeBron with a burst. And a bump. Bosh from the wing. Got it. Chris Bosh having a quietly efficient night with 17 points and eight rebounds. Nine and a half minutes left in the game. Warriors lead by five. LeBron got fouled. It rolls in. And Draymond Green talking trash to LeBron James. Not a good idea. <laughs> Showing you immaturity there. Don't get him fired up. Allen fading out of bounds finds LeBron. He'll take the three. Kaboom. And he ties it. And Miami has even the game at 87. Tough matchup here, Lee guarding LeBron. Eight on the shot clock. LeBron will try to reset. Four to shoot. Oh my! Talent overcame everything. LeBron James with eight of his 31 here in the fourth quarter, and the Heat have the lead back. Jeff Curry inside, knocked away by Wade, stolen by LeBron, and here they come. Good defense by Draymond Green. Wade, yes, and the foul! What a play by LeBron. He out-rebounded three Golden State Warriors on the cold miss. This is Jared Jack. Game on the line. Jack guarded by LeBron. Two seconds left. Green with a layup. Nine tenths of a second left. And a great pass from Jared Jack. LeBron on the turn for the win. It was actually for the tie, and the Warriors do win the game by scoring the last six points of the game. Chalm, Wade, Haslam stays in the starting lineup. Bosch in the center, and LeBron James. Tip controlled by Miami. South Florida, glad you're with us. Off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. LeBron, the layup and the foul on Martell Webster. Coach Bolster talked about, with his team, about getting off to a better start in game. Chalmers rattles it down. So, four different scorers on the Heat's first eight points. This is the 38th year in the league for Bavetta as an official. Tonight, Tony, he's working his unprecedented 2,563rd consecutive game without ever missing an assignment. I don't think I was ever fast enough to run, the floor, run down the floor as fast as he just did. Udonis getting it done with two perimeter jump shots. And the Washington Wizards won and nine on the road this year. Their only road victory came at New Orleans Tuesday night when they defeated the Hornets 77 to 70. The other two wins for the Wizards an 84-82 victory against Portland at the end of November after they dropped their first 12. And of course the four point win as Bach slams it in for James. The four point win over Miami. Heel missing on the move and Chalmers moving this way. Like that one. Nice pass, Betty eight for three. Joel Anthony ripping it away from Singleton. Fresh shot clock. Betty another three. Come on. Oh, second chance points because of Joel Anthony's hustle and strength on the offensive board. Wade with a steal. Singleton giving chase. Oh, what a great play by Wade. He avoided the foul and got LeBron James a dunk. Singleton didn't even know that Wade passed the ball. He thought he still had it on the baseline. He was looking for it. Singleton doesn't know that Wade gave it up. He's still guarding Wade, thinks he's fouling him to put him on the line. And LeBron's in there with the dunk. Good play by Wade and LeBron. Those two guys, Eric, are some of the fastest guys in the NBA with and without the ball in the open court. Crawford pushing off and losing the ball. And there's Bosch down the other end. Well, the only resistance coming from the ball boys, he had to get out of the way with the mouse. Man, Chris Bosch basket hanging, never came back on defense. He got rewarded for it. And this may be the night that uh, LeBron doesn't get his 20, Eric, because the way the heat's going, LeBron may not play the fourth quarter tonight. Good point. Here's LeBron. There's two. Nine points for LeBron James. Just under six minutes left here in the third quarter. Miami up 21. LeBron will go to the free throw line. You heard, you heard a few people get there. Wade for the cutting LeBron. And Vesely with a block shot. But the foul. Good play by D. Wade and LeBron. LeBron saw that Wade was in a little trouble. They're on a 20-4 run right now. 
And a head by 27. LeBron with a left hand from Wade. And it's now a 29 point lead for the Heat. LeBron on the turn. Yep. 10 points in the quarter, 17 for the game for LeBron. James for the jumper. It's good. Now he's up to 19 now. A 12 point <laughs> quarter for LeBron. Bradley <laughs> Beal 6 5. But somehow the Heat got it. Here's LeBron. There it is. Yes, oh, there it is. He got it, baby. He's got his 20 plus for 26 straight games. Two more for LeBron James. Having quite a third quarter. 16 of his 23 points in this period. A very pleasing game. Start to finish. The Heat win it by 30. 102 to 72. Miami now 15 and 6. They go to 11 and 0 when they shoot better than 50%. Welcome back to Miami. Your tip of the game being delivered by Papa John's. Chef Florida, glad you're with us. Off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. LeBron cuts back door and hammers it home. Beautiful one bounce from Udonis. Fit fires a three. And LeBron quickly ahead. Snaps it to Wade, who splits the defense for the score. Wade and LeBron, when they get up in the air, they make up what they have to do in the air. He had 26 in back-to-back -back games, and then 27 combined in the last two. The defense by LeBron forcing the Kirilenko miss. But Kevin Love draws the foul. He is a second chance kind of guy. Pat Riley on Rick Adelman as Kirilenko scores again. Eight points for Andre Kirilenko all in the paint. Meanwhile, Dwayne Wade has the Heat's last eight. Chalmers from downtown. 18th triple of the season for Chalmers. And the Heat take the lead back 17 to 16. Eight on the shot clock for LeBron. Fading back, but right on target for LeBron James. His second field goal in three attempts. And we have our fourth lead change of the pool. Shred misses both. Alexi Shred, the 24-year-old rookie from Russia, stays squints. Cole for three. Come on. Norris Cole igniting Miami. He is playing good defense on Berea. Pushing the ball up the floor, then hitting the three. Six to shoot for LeBron. Slips by Williams and lays it in. Boy, he made that look easy. Love had it deflected by Battier. Here comes LeBron. Love retreating. Wade slamming. It's amazing how those two guys find, look for, and find each other on the break. 23 to 5 and second chance points has been no contest. LeBron got fouled with 27 seconds left in the half. Minnesota with the last five points of this quarter. Come on. Chalmers from downtown. Mario Chalmers has tripled three times in the night's game. Good. Back to Kirilenko. Blocked out of bounds by LeBron. Brown James with his third block shot of tonight's game. That was a good play by Wade. Chalmers for three. Come on. Four triples for Mario Chalmers. Well, Miami does have four straight wins against Minnesota by an average of 16 and a half points of victory. The Heat averaging 110 a game against Minnesota. Those four straight. Pretty play. Bosh on the catch. And the sweet reverse off the seventh LeBron James assist. And love double team. Chalmers steals it. LeBron for Wade. Oh, boy. As soon as LeBron caught that ball, he knew what he was doing with it. He weighed with 22. Finds LeBron for three. Kaboom. And LeBron James with his first point to the second half. Remember, he had 16 third quarter points Saturday night. Dante Cunningham defending LeBron. James drives in and makes a tough shot over Pekovic. Five in a row for LeBron. And the Heat lead by seven. Chalmers looking, finds Wade. Joel back to LeBron for three. Come on. Oh boy, talk about inside out that time. What great ball movement by the Heat. Kirilenko, nice pass. Derek Williams denied. Good defense by Batty and LeBron. LeBron may have gotten a piece of that. He did. He got a blocked shot on that one. That's his fourth block of the game. And he hit by eight. Just over 11 minutes to play in the game. It's Derek Williams. The young man misses the three. LeBron has his fifth rebound. Brown James with eight points in the third quarter. He finds Battier wide open three. Kaboom! 
Shane Battier with his first points of the game on his 36th triple of the season. Berea missing the three. LeBron with another rebound. That's Joel knocking both of those last two rebounds to LeBron. LeBron with a burst, bumps with Williams, draws the foul, and finishes. It's amazing, Eric, how he can go to the basket with such power and then stop and put a soft shot up, take the hit, and finish the play. In his post-playing career, Porter has been a head coach twice in his native Milwaukee with the Bucks, and then for less than a season with the Suns, has been an assistant with the Kings, Pistons, and now the Timberwolves with his old Blazers head coach, Rick Allen, alongside. Back over to you, Eric. Jack Sanson, great days in Portland together as Ray Allen triples for the second time tonight. Allen leads LeBron, who hammers it home. Oh, perfect pass. Again, LeBron filling that right lane. Berea misses. LeBron inhales another rebound. Eric, right, Joel Anthony is doing an outstanding job this quarter. Down low, changing shots, push, uh, tapping balls out that they can't rebound. And the Heat are on a roll right now. Miami shooting the doors right off the American Airlines Arena. Heat will win their fifth in a row against Minnesota. They'll go to 16 and 6 on the season. They move to within one game of Idle New York for the best record in the Eastern Conference. We welcome you to Dallas, Texas for game two of our Thursday night doubleheader. It's the defending NBA champion Miami Heat and the Dallas Mavericks. And here is Haslam with a rainbow shot. I think that kind of that game kind of epitomizes the Miami approach. They're willing to give up something on the glass and play fast. And where they make up for it is the extra possessions through tough defense and the easy baskets from James off of you know playing off of him. I don't know how easy that was. <laughs> no. It's not take turns for three. Dallas, not a team. Looks for a three. Certainly the way Miami has been looking for it is James is able to knock it down. I, I like what they've done. Danny Ferry making that Johnson trade freed up a lot of cap room flexibility. They could sign a max guy this summer. So I think the Hawks are in pretty good shape. LeBron James comes straight away. They double up again on, on Mayo. Miami continues to do an excellent job defensively on, on OJ Mayo. But you can see what happens in the half court without Dirk as LeBron gets free for the lob. What a pass from Dwayne Wade. One major factor for them now. They have now finally gotten Joel Anthony back into the rotation. And that will start to bring the numbers down as Kamen misses that little fadeaway jump shot. Joel Anthony, so important to the deep team defense. Talk at the start despite the fact that the record is 16. Yeah. Beautiful play. James with the assist. Bosch with the bucket. And he'll head to the line. Down low, Marion not able to hit, contested by, by Bosch. And now off the steal, here is Marion. <laughs> Tip missed by Collison. Couple of opportunities for the Mavs. James pulls it up for three. Yes, and he is on fire. Five for five, 11 points. Sorry, sorry. Marion not able to hit his trademark shot. Here's Carter for three. Rebounded by Wade, who fires one down, and Chen oh, James leaping for it! Out leaping, the combination of Collison and Carter, that looked like a pass. Throws a jump ball to a wide receiver. A lot of new faces on the court here for the Mavs. Cole backs it home. Eric does not like to use the phrase small ball. Nice move by LeBron. There's the reason you can play positionless because LeBron can play all five spots. Shot clock down to five. Marion. Rebounded by James. Boy, Dirk Nowitzki can't come back soon enough. I mean, they get involved in a game like this and James knocks down the three in transition. Came in again, a strip. Here comes LeBron. Turns the foul around and draws the foul. That's how they won the title two years ago, Dallas. That's exactly how they beat Miami as Bosch knocks down the jumper, but they, they eventually broke Miami's defense down with the penetration, the pass. LeBron James with his third three of the night. As, as we see yeah. Battier drain a three from his favorite spot in the deep corner. <laughs> that thankfully wraps it. Miami.
with a 110-95 victory over Dallas. The high point man, LeBron James, 24. Big welcome to American Airlines Arena tonight. The Jazz make a stop in Miami to take on the heat home of LeBron James. And the three-time MVP is making a strong statement for number four. The Jazz and the world champion Heat right now on Root Sports. James penetrates. Miller's in the ball game. A three-point specialist. And Mike Miller, Miller knocks it from downtown. Marvin's got a wide open look. Wow. Boy, the Jazz are knocking down their three ball tonight. Marvin Williams with an eight-point quarter. Makes all the difference in the world when they're making three-point shots. LeBron, scoop shot for two. See, this is why I have a problem with this. You've got to foul him. Ray Allen, the sharp shooter for two. Back-to-back -back threes. Ray Allen, 46%. LeBron has the ball slapped away. James has taken two shots here in the quarter. Ball poked away by Millsap. Five to shoot. Down to three. Put it up. Rattles it in. Tough shot. LeBron nothing, James. Nothing you can do about that. Buller. LeBron James has looked over at me and shook his head like Millsap came guard me. Miami's lead is three. LeBron back with Dwayne Wade. Stops and pops. Long about 18 footer to it. This is where he's really worked on his game. His perimeter shooting has been off the charts this year. 54% from inside the arc, and a lot of those are jump shots. James goes around, Carroll stops, pops, 15-footer. LeBron, nine points. Yeah, he's missed two shots tonight, he's four or six. Paul takes it to the middle of the floor, skips it out, Marvin had the hot hand, airballed it. Yeah, he was, I think he was sitting on the bench a little bit too long. He'll try again, no. Rebound, backside, LeBron James. He'll run it away, takes it right at Big Al for an easy layup. Big Al's got to give a little bit better effort than that. First shot taken, and LeBron James in double figures for the 443rd straight game. Battier, three, just like that, and a quick five by the Heat. And we talk about the first five minutes of the third quarter being so important. Championship caliber teams know that, and you see the, the Heat come out making two of their shots. 17-footer Big Al straight away and throws up an air ball. Al, it's just out of sync. The last two games now was he one of eight against Indiana. He's two of seven tonight. So three of his last 15, and there's another three. This one off the hand of Mario Chalmers. Jefferson, dump it down, Earl, put it up, missed the layup. Oh boy, look at this. And then Big Al has to run down the floor and wrap up. LeBron James. You know, they have LeBron James. There's no LeBron James on the Utah Jazz. There's no Dwayne Wade. They have to use everyone on the basketball court. They've got to use all five guys. Well, the league is going away, Matt, though, from that five, true five spot. So they're more kind of hybrid players where they've got the dribbling ability, the shooting ability, the rebounding ability, which is really what LeBron is, yeah, uh, the there's, package. There's just not many centers anymore in the NBA. And even on the All-Star ballot, I think they took the center position away. Now you just vote on forwards. But you look at Miami Heat, they've won in a small lineup. All these guys are interchangeable. They're all about 6'8", 6'9", and they just play. They say, what position do you play on the basketball court? I don't know. I just play. How about that move? Yeah. Missed the jumper, rebound, I mean, left hand hustling, layup. But if you were to tell me what position is LeBron James playing right now, is he playing the two, three, or four, or five? LeBron fires it, kick it off the glass. And LeBron with a 19 point night. Another $50 donated to the Huntsman Cancer Research Foundation by Mountain America Credit Union, your family, your home, your life. And LeBron just knocked down. And he's over 20 again, boy. Tinsley with eight to shoot. Penetrates four, looking for three. That shot won't go tonight. Haslam, the rebound. What a struggle tonight. Foy, one of nine. And on the other end, it's an easy layup for LeBron James. It just seems like when the Heat want to turn it on, they just go ahead and turn on the switch. LeBron goes baseline. There's a turnover. Ray Allen, though, tried to take it back from Earl. He slides across the floor. The Bulldog hustles. But the ball goes to the LeBron. Bang, down she goes. 30 for LeBron. And the Jazz will go to 500 on the season at 14 and 14, 5 and 12 on the road. And Miami pulls away.
And they win this game 105-89. 29 different All-Stars are in these five NBA Christmas Day games. And a boatload here between the Thunder and the Heat. But we'll see a lot of trapping of pick and rolls and especially forcing the big men to score. Beautiful find by LeBron James to Dwayne Wade. Breaks the scoring seal. Westbrook. Off the mark and James goes to get the rebound. Look out here. LeBron accelerates and pitches to Chalmers. Two field goals, both on assists by James. Now that's what he's all about, Mike. He's in the top ten in assists. Think about that. That means, you know, there are an awful lot of point guards that he's putting in second place. And he's going to get another one here. From Chalmers for the dunk. Seven nothing Miami. Patrick Perkins left to guard James. He's done that in the past, including the Boston-Cleveland matchups. And LeBron has done that to many defenders over the years. Well, LeBron James is having a great shooting year. LeBron attacks Cephalosha. That's what he did in the finals when it was a smaller player. He took him right down to the basket and did his business there. Find of Martin, terrific shooter. Turned out that three, and here's James on the push. Yep. Chalmers couldn't catch it clean, but knocked it down anyway for three. It, whatever it is about this rivalry, it sparks Chalmers' game. All right, Lisa, thank you. Norris Cole on the drive to start this second quarter. He misses. Deflected back out to James. Mike. Great finish. Oh, what, what a floater. James inside. Catches on Cephalosha. Goes up quick and scores. Now give Bosch a lot of credit. He could have forced up that shot. That's his area. Chalmers to Donis Haslam. Oh. Didn't want the layup. Didn't get the assist. Oh. But LeBron's got all that. LeBron over Ibaka. 14 for James. How about the ball thing? Wade got Perkins in the air. LeBron on the attack to the top. And what? That was right the first time. Ibaka has 11. I want a new stat monitor for Christmas. James, 19 points. A great first half for LeBron. Perkins blocked by James. Wade, good if it goes. End of the half. First of the two meetings between these teams. The rematch comes on Valentine's night in Oklahoma City. Chris Bosh saddled with foul trouble in the first half. Hits his fourth field goal. Good job out of the timeout. Bosh to LeBron James. LeBron over 20. He has been every game this season. We'll give you the perspective on that. Next dead ball. As James comes back the other way for Miami. Chalmers, just like that, five. Before you can blink points put up by the Heat to retake a three-point lead. We asked Scott Brooks before the game about Durant and his growth, his overall game, the stats. I thought he was going to go there. He said uh, his leadership. So remember, he's only 24. Magic Johnson's the only guy that he remembers to be that young and be a leader. But now year six in the league, as you said in the first half, that resume of experience and doing it under pressure as James hits over Durant to put Miami back on top. Allen off the catch and shoot, and there's Ray. Uh, with a deep two that they'll review at the next stop. Smart goal. LeBron got Kevin in the air. NBA this year trying to deter flopping. Video review of plays, even if they're not called as fouls against you, as Chalmers knocks down the jumper to give the Heat a four-point lead. It's Martin defending LeBron James, who gets the space. Collison waiting defensively. A good find of Fox. That was well done, not only by LeBron, because he was looking for Bosch to move without the ball. LeBron gets Perkins, he clears space, he wants to take Kendrick, he'll take a deep two with a toe on a tape, LeBron knocked it down. <laughs> LeBron's got Perkins and he's got space, if they help, Allen's waiting for a three. James, a couple of free throws coming. Yeah, Ibaka catches up. He catches him up underneath. Where will the action come for James? It's a Wade screen to get LeBron the ball. On Durant. With no help. Screen for Wade on the switch. Trying to get it back to James. Guarded by Westbrook. The clock's at six. Perkins is helping. Oh, and Bosch yeah. is free for the dunk. How about that? LeBron saw that all the way. 103. 97. 
into the Time Warner Cable Arena with a little more excitement at hand. The Miami Heat are in town, and whenever that happens, it's a big event. And it is, of course, during the holidays. It's Bobcats and Heat right here on Sports Out. LeBron was quoted as saying he's tired as the four-letter word. <laughs> here he goes, Mr. Tired. <laughs> He looks stressed. Get Gilchrist on the wing. James on him. He'll split the defenders. Now finds the basketball. Eight on the shot clock. Handed it right to Bosch. James on his way. Kimba back. James. That was easy. A 9 0 Miami start. James with the steal. Wade with the finish. Oh! James comes right back after Kim Gilchrist did all he could on Dwayne Wade. He says, okay, I'm going to give it to my buddy. If he doesn't finish, I'm going to be right there to clean it up. So you're constantly on the move, never expecting a layup to be made. They got behind, and now they're hustling back. And that's what's great about the new coach and the new team. That's right. Never give up. That's right, and we like that about them. Sessions looking inside, wrap around to Warwick. No. And a steal. LeBron with his third of the game, and the basket by Wade. And Wade runs right into Jock with a block. It's got to be a block, because otherwise it's a travel. James down the lane, up and over. Got the bucket and the foul. LeBron James. Cole. Kick out to Battier for three. Joel Anthony with the rebound. James. And Battier tries it again. He said, I was almost good that time. I'm better than that this time. Inside here is Wade, turns, fires, hits, and fouled. Haslam misses the shot off the front of the iron. His pass deflected by Chalmers, picked up by Wade, and finished by LeBron James on the foul line because of a foul. And now they're going to discuss what kind of foul this is. Sessions on Chalmers, heads inside, got it. Sessions has one true route to the basket, and he is using it. Boy, used his body very well there to shield a defender, get it on the board. 13 now for Ramon. The only guy who's got as many points as him is the guy who just passed it, James. Jones for three. Walker down the lane, and scores. Ran right down the back of Chris Bosch, who never turned around. Chaw, uh, James never came up in the front court, and he'll lay that off the oh, rim James. and in. James with a shot fake, the pass out to Chalmers for three. Nicely done by LeBron James and Mario Chalmers. Boy, James saw him right out of the three corner of his eye. Look at the field goals this quarter. Five for eight versus one out of six. James, two out of seven. That's a foul. Bosch inside to James, posted up on Henderson. Shot clock at nine. Chalmers wide open for three. Chalmers has 28 three-pointers on the year, and that gives Miami a 14-point edge. Ten-point game. Here comes James. Here comes a three. Chalmers. He likes that spot. He does. He's got four threes in the game. James on the wing. He'll fire. Oh! 26 straight games with 20 or more. James with five, Battier with three. The big three points. James is good. He set Shane Battier up so well. Wade goes to James. Biombo switches out with Warwick, who's now covering Haslam. Three more. Oh! Out to Sessions. He'll take the three. Walker inside, swatted away by James. Walker recovers, but Miami hangs on. Bobcats got to two. They never led in this game. Miami felt it and pushed back with a 21 to 10 run over the last seven minutes and 12 seconds to beat the Bobcats here, 105. To 92. The reigning NBA and NBA Finals MVP, LeBron James, brings his spectacular game to the Palace tonight for the first and only time this season as he and the Heat work to repeat as NBA champs. Live from the Palace, it's the Pistons and Miami Heat. LeBron in a hurry, had a steam to forecourt. 
Kearns fires, fills it. Well, now all five starters have scored. It's 12 to 6, Miami. Four on the clock for LeBron James. Jumper, yes. Deadly. Cross court to Miller. Now LeBron finds Bosch, who buries it. What it? They just do not allow you to double. Shot clock at 10 for LeBron. Keeps that dribble. Stops from the paint, flicks it up and in. Goal to the baseline. Chase back outside. LeBron with a jumper off the high glass. And he hits it. Andre's pass for Tayshaun. Picked off by LeBron. Saves it for Cole, gets it back, lays it up, lays it in. Wow. The reverse glasser goes. LeBron now has 10. Four seconds, three. LeBron with the jumper. Nails it with 1.3 to play in the first. LeBron with the drive. And the Pistons grab him and foul him on the way to the rim. It's on Andre Drummond. He got him first. You see, the thing about Will Bynum, when he goes inside, he can score. He can finish. So you have to respect that, too. Oh, you better guard him. LeBron goes inside on the other end for the jam. Will 7.6 assists. LeBron James from the baseline buries it. They feed to Greg Monroe. Clock at four. Works against Hazard. Here's the hook. Short. Everybody after that basketball for the Heat. They bring it to four court. LeBron gets a Haslam screen. Steps back and fires. Fills it up. It's a triple. Kind of what you expect. LeBron nearly lost it. Brandon Knight poked it away from behind. Four on the clock. LeBron with the shot. Sticks it. LeBron with 24. LeBron with the clock at 10. Has Brandon Knight in front of him. Sizes him up. Five on the clock. Step back. Gun goes. LeBron with a triple. And now the lead is inside 10. Anybody surprised LeBron has it? Here's the shot. Sticks it. A long deuce for LeBron. Four tenths of a second to play in the quarter. Miami to LeBron. Working against Tayshon. Five clock at seven. Up fake. Now fall away. Fills it up. What do you do? You did all you can do. He played that perfectly. You did all you can do. A ton of time left. Will at the top of the key. Fires off the iron. Rebound Bosch to LeBron James. LeBron James, 13 for 18, drives it, finishes it. And Lawrence Frank has seen it up. He's going to take a timeout. 9-0 piston run, stopped right there by Bosch. Make it 90 to 79. Will's pass picked off in the paint by LeBron. Still with it, with the drive. Lays it up, lays it in. Now it's a nine-point piston lead. Austin Day, Tayshaun sneaks in, LeBron blocked it. Yeah, he's doing everything, isn't he? LeBron. Finds Shane Battier for the corner three. It's through, and he is fouled. Ray Allen triples. Pistons lead by 10. Deep bounce, LeBron to Bosch. What a pass. What a pass. The Pistons have beaten the champs here at the Palace. The final score, the Pistons 109, Miami 99. A light snowfall in Milwaukee has greeted the Miami Heat. The Bucks host the NBA champions for the first time this season in the BMO Harris Bradley Center. Three pointer, Jennings, Battier shrugs his shoulders, and the Bucks lead 5 0. Bucks must shoot well tonight from the field and the line. LeBron James, the Bucks did not have a good start in Miami. They fell down in that game, 18 points. Wayne Wade, just off a little screen on the free throw line, he curls around it, the defender has to trail. LeBron James, four points. Bucks will be in Detroit tomorrow night. Then San Antonio and Houston are here. Yeah, and Big De games coming up. And Detroit beat Miami last night.
Lakers having fun tonight? LeBron James. Well, he usually talks to people in the crowd. He's talking to the Bucks bench. He's been playing with a big smile on his face. I say they he's, try to change that. He's one of those guys that always kind of looking into the crowd and talking to people. And he, he, he likes to kind of show off, but he's good at it, and, and he, he engages people. Perhaps it's because the game is relatively easy, apparently, Perhaps, for him. But, you know, he's always been that way. He always kind of knows what's going on around him, and yet plays to it, but can also stay focused and get it done. He draws everybody and then kicks it out to Chalmers. Miami moves the ball to now, Miller for a three. Now see, they put him in the deep corner, weak side. Now the defense has to cover a lot of turf to get to him, and that's deadly. Larry Sanders off the Bucks bench. Milwaukee leading by eight. James with a quick move at the first step and a very tricky reverse. Wonderful play. All the way. The moves and the finish. Bosch. See, I would have fouled him out there right on the screen. Yeah, Bosch took Matamute off yeah. James, and it's over. Should have grabbed it. Bosch, fouled by James. What a great foul and pass, but nothing. Nope, that, those are called alters. Those are shots, very difficult shots. And look, here they come. They're yeah. putting the pedal down right now. Well, you called it. Ah. Oh, for 11 to start the quarter. James draws a foul out of Hugo. They're going to count the basket. I believe they do. Bosch shows on Ellis, sets the screen, then rolls. Battier swings it to Chalmers. Drive and kick for James. He's alone. See, I don't think you should come off of him at all to help out. Abute got trapped along the baseline, throws it out. Chalmers. Hugo uh. with a block, but James is there to clean up after Wade. Look at it. I mean, it's like, okay, kids, here we come. We're going to tune it up. James holds by Mute on the inbound pass, and gets one. it, and is fouled. Uh, uh, that's just out of hole. Marquise Daniels probably should. Why would Wade want to foul after I got dumped? Harrelson all alone under the basket. Jennings. Hey. Norris Cole with the rebound. Wade goes down, tough angle, bank shot. He has 22. Rebound, Ray Allen. Milwaukee, three of 24 in the third quarter. Can't beat the champions like that. Call that, Mr. James. Now, I would say he wasn't trying to bank that, so now he's got it rolling. That was a banker. All along, Wade from James. How did that happen? Well, it might have been that back screen on the baseline again that worked in the first half. It's Miami team, 6-5 and five on the road. They have played an awful lot of home games. LeBron James on the dunk, 14-2 and two at home, so 16 at home to try to dribble this out. 104-85, the Bucs knock off the Miami Heat. They took Miami to overtime on November 21st on the road and win at home to square the series. A New Year's Eve Monday in Central Florida, the Amway Center in downtown Orlando, and a Sunshine State matchup, the Orlando Magic hosting the Miami Heat. The one, two, oh man! University of Miami sends it to the Heat. How about that to start this game? <laughs> Oh boy, we've seen a lot of stuff happen here in oh the first uh, 20 seconds of action. You think he's fired up to play Miami? Well, you know what, probably uh, having gone to the University of Miami, probably got a chance to uh, play and pick up basketball as Chris Bosch answers with some emphasis. LeBron Jones, a rookie from the University of Miami. LeBron James, cross court, Chris Bosch makes it an 8-5 game. There's an errant pass. Picked off by LeBron James. James makes his move on to Quan Jones. Out the basket, he hangs in the air. Double pumps, puts it home. Here's Allen for three. And there it is, Ray Allen busting out of the slump here at the Amway Center. Three for his last 13. Some coverage on the defense against pick and roll, that, that works, but... Not the way that the Magic are attacking it. Aslam, not exactly a, uh, a rookie. James spots an opening and takes it.
takes it to the rim. Six for LeBron. And the Magic are, are moving well, though. Uh, move the ball well. Swing it from one side of the floor to the other. Two minutes. And, and most two defenses minutes. are you know, very good. A lot of contact there. Yeah. LeBron took it right at Josh McRoberts, and there is a foul on Josh. Well, that's six turnovers for the Magic in the first period. That's one of your keys, Matty. Yeah, but none of them, David, have uh, led to a fast break, if I'm not mistaken. They've all been uh, either ball out of bounds or, in that case, just brought up the floor. James correcting traffic. Gets a screen from Anthony. Nicholson switched on him, the rookie. Held him to a jump shot, which is about yeah. all you can ask if you could get of it. If you could get uh, LeBron James to take 20 of those, 25 of those, if he makes 12 or 14, so be it. Turkler was on LeBron James. And a foul on Hito. Well, that's a good job by Nick Vucevic. 22 years old out of the University of Southern California. Eight-point lead for the Magic with one minute to play in the first half. Uh-oh. Oh, that was way too easy. Uh, miscommunication. James shoots the heat back into the lead. James has Vucevic isolated. And a foul on Nick Vucevic. That is his third personal. The lead for the Magic is 11, their largest. LeBron explodes to the basket and leaves it in. 19 for James. Uh, as long as they are two-point baskets uh, for Miami, they don't want to. Again, it's not. I gotta have to gamble a little bit on some threes, but you don't want to start giving them uh, three-point plays at the basket. That was not an easy shot by Ray Allen. Laquan Jones missed a three out of the right corner. James into the lane, gets the call, and will go to the line. Peter oh, wasn't trapped that time. Just as Joel Anthony showed up, made Hito pick up that dribble. Miller's three trickles off the lip of the rim, and we're tied at 77. Hito got a screen. They're going to trap him in the corner. Again, the Magic turn it over. Ray Allen throws it ahead to Mike Miller. James is going to finish. Well, there are a lot of games in this. Uh, First part of the season where the Magic were not getting enough threes up. They are coming up plenty lately. Shot clock down to five. He glanced up at the clock. He steps back and shoots a three. James for three. His first three of the night. James looking. Wade cutting. Dwayne Wade. Oh, that's easy for Miami. They get two in about three seconds after they inbound the ball. Inbound the boss. He takes two dribbles and shoots the jumper. No good. Overtime. Vucevic now matched up with LeBron James. James fires over the seven-footer. They go to James again. This time a flower was on him. Backing in, muscling toward the basket. Scores again. Two buckets for LeBron James in the overtime period. Now the switch. Vucevic picks him up. Don't go out too far. Don't go out too far. Well, Vuce is doing a good job. He had good position. Perfect position. And Roberts with five fouls on LeBron. Now a follow switches on him. Vucevic hands him now. Shot clock at six. James attacking, lays it in. He take the lead with a minute seven to play. Hito Turkoglu to the basket, lays it in at the horn, and Miami survives in overtime, 112-110. The Heat's first game of 2013 is in Miami, where they have won 14 of their 16 games this season. Tonight, the second and final matchup this year with a team they face in both the 2006 and 2011 NBA Finals. Welcome everybody inside the beautiful American Airlines Arena in Miami where we get to enjoy the 21 and 8 heat against the 13 and 19 Dallas Mavericks. Mayo is on Wade. Marion against Bosch, who hits the three. Seventh kaboom of the season for Chris Bosch. I mean, down 18 to 9 halfway through this first quarter. Collison has it. Wiggle out. Kamen 
Had the tip, but here comes D-Wade. The lob for James. Oh, my. Eric, when LeBron was running down the right side, he pointed to the rim. Wayne Wade looked to his left, knew what he was going to do with the pass. Easy play for the two of them. They've done that many times. First score for LeBron in this game. Dirk Nowitzki in for Dallas for the first time as Marion misses on the hook. Bosch pulls down his first rebound. And Dirk's in early in this game. LeBron, foul by came and they don't call it. LeBron scored. Oh, man. He ripped right through the seven-footer Chris Kamen, and LeBron wants to talk it over with Daytona Beach native Eric Lewis. As Nowitzki turns and misses. LeBron off and running with a rebound. Finds Allen for a win three. Come on. What a perfect combination. LeBron spotting Allen in an open spot from downtown. Have a, have a foul to give if they want to use it. LeBron with a sweet kiss off the glass. Collison forced into the turnover by Chalmers. Here comes LeBron by Dirk to the hoop for the basket and the foul on Mayo. Again, led by a defensive play by Chalmers stealing the ball. Got clock at four. LeBron against Kamen right by him. I don't want to say LeBron made that look easy, but didn't he? But he did. Bosch drives in for two. That time they played Wade coming off of Bosch's little uh, brush screen on the elbow, and that left Chris Bosch open. Four on the shot clock. Long three, partially deflected by Bosch. Mayo did not have a good look at that. LeBron for Bosch, put it on. The recognition of LeBron James knowing that Bosch had a small guy on him down in the box. Carter's dribbled it into a turnover. LeBron by himself. Carter ran into a brick wall in Bosch. And here comes Rio, a three-on-two break. LeBron! There it is, 20 points again for LeBron James. His 35th straight game, a 20-year better, 51 in a row, including the playoffs. Mayo almost knocked it away from Wade. Chalmers from LeBron. Kaboom! First triple tonight for Mario. The Heat lead it by four. What about LeBron, 20 points, eight rebounds, five assists. That's Bosch. Chris Bosch with a baseline splashdown. Eight in the quarter for Bosch. Four on the shot clock for the Heat. LeBron with a second on the shot clock, unloads a three. Cover. That one brought rain. <laughs> Mayo, corner three. And LeBron comes down with his 10th rebound of the game. His 16th double-double. James drives in, draws the foul on Chris Kamen, who could not avoid contact or get out of the way. That's the fifth foul on Kamen and the third team foul on Dallas. LeBron without a field goal in the period. Allen for three. Oh, that is a big-time kaboom for Ray Allen. His second triple tonight. It brings the Heat back to within three. LeBron all the way home. First field goal of the fourth quarter for King James. Lifts them right out of their seats at the American Airlines Arena. 20,000 fans are standing. Eric, Dallas has no timeouts left, so if he can score here, Dallas does not get the ball. Batty is three. Come on! Not, and he gets the ball out with no timeout. Do you believe that? His only points in the last two games. Battier puts Miami up two. Eight seconds left. Callison for Dirk. The fadeaway is good. We're tied at 103 with just under four seconds left. In the LeBron against Carter. Two seconds left. The fadeaway short. We go to overtime. Dirk Nowitzki right back into the action for Dallas. He got only a minute's rest to start overtime. He's guarding LeBron. Remember, Nowitzki's seven feet. LeBron using glass, it trickles in. 29 points for LeBron James. The Heat are up 108 to 103. LeBron finds Battier. Here's a three. Come on. Well, Mr. Big, Shane Battier. Two huge triples when the Heat have needed him most. LeBron off the spin. It falls, and he'll go to the free throw line. And that may have just sealed the deal for the Heat. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, the Heat stay perfect in overtime and nearly perfect at home. 15 wins and 17 tries. The Heat have won 22 of their first 30 games.
and they win their first adventure in the calendar year 2013. And meanwhile for Eric Spolstra and the Heat, Jonas Haslam now positioned in as the starting power forward. Oh, we're guarding Bosch to start, James on a pull-up, and James shooting a career high. 54% from the field. Game stripped the foul. Who's around the reach in? Now, what's the problem? With the shot clock down, when they kick the ball out on a double team, the three point shooting sporadic. A year ago, automatic. That's the difference. Uh, losing so many of those key guys as James knocks down the jumper. Heiner will try again. They're getting good looks, Mike. You can't ask for any better looks than they're getting. James off the glass. See, unfortunately, the transition game is hurting Chicago. Not the half-court sets by Miami, but the transition game. You see LeBron James back to the game. Had eight early points before he sat for a good stretch. Shot blocked, but a foul. Butler and Boozer converged. And James will shoot two. You know, it's, it's impossible to gauge how good Chicago can be this year until Derrick Rose comes back. Again, there's, there's no target date for Rose. They're thinking maybe February, maybe after the All-Star break. It's James uh -huh. puts that one in. But Rose is rehabbing. He's actually on this trip. First time he's traveled with the team this year. Good defense from Heinrich. And then Chalmers takes the contact and knocks it down. Yeah, I say when Chalmers is feisty, I really like this game. And that's what he is right now. James, good open look for three. LeBron James, first three-pointer of the night. The Heat were just two for ten before that one, and it's back to three. The turnover. Three on one. James to Wade. Alley up! It almost looked like an impossible catch, but then <laughs> he made that look pretty easy. Then number six comes into your picture and throws it down. LeBron James igniting the crowd. James all wrapped up by Noah. Nothing malicious there. He just grabbed him around to stop him and then tried to help him. It's a flagrant one. James draws the foul. And dang with the bump, James right back to the line. Well, Chicago shooting so well, 54% through the first three as James oh throws it down. Oh and it's back to three. Timeout, Chicago. After they cut it to three, an 8-1 run led by Nate Robinson. James, jump shot. Wade slicing. Kicks it out, stolen by Robinson. Robinson, a burst of speed. James got a piece of it. Ray Allen, the rebound. Robinson slow to get up. Wade back to James, and he's fouled. Now that was a terrific play by Robinson. Unfortunately, he knew that LeBron was running him down, and he sent up a shot too hard. Bosch fakes. Bosch drives. Oh, Noah may have got a piece. They're going to count it. Noah's hand went up and appeared went up through the net. That's what Eddie Malloy is saying. Tom Thibodeau obviously disagrees. Chicago Bulls come into Miami and and the Heat just their third home loss of the season and one of their more impressive performances of the year. We hope you've had a great weekend and thanks for joining us, Chef Floyd and the Heat Nation, because off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Of course, the Wizards shocked Miami in the first of two meetings this year. December 4th, a 105-101 win in Washington. They were 1-13 and at the time, and it did put an end to a six-game Heat winning streak, one of two six-game streaks the Heat have had this year. And they outplayed the Heat that night. They, they earned that win. LeBron gets his first bucket, but ball movement, a, a sticky subject right now as LeBron blocks Okafor's shot. And Okafor misses a second time. Tony, the Wizards average just 89 points a game on 41% shooting. Both are low marks in the NBA. Chris Bosh, two for two. As a team, the Heat are four for four. Well, what you don't like, Eric, is when you're sitting there with your peers and you see where you're standing, ball watching, you're not hustling after a rebound, and you're not, you're a great play right there by LeBron and, and Bosh. And Temple, but a quick study as Bosh gets it from LeBron, and the Heat are still perfect. Six of six for Miami. Bosch has four of them. How about five assists for six field goals? Heat led by ten. Now it's down to two, and LeBron misses the leaner. And LeBron leans back and gets the rebound. There's a three, and that's good.
LeBron James with his 43rd triple of the season. Temple will let it fly for three. And Nene in a real battle with Joel, and Joel Anthony wins that skirmish. And he up five. This is LeBron drawing two defenders and finding Ray Allen for a three. Kaboom! That was pretty. What a smart move. Ray Allen was thinking about swinging that ball to Norris Cole in the right corner, but who do you want shooting a three? Ray Allen or Norris Cole? Washington's got a problem now, and they cannot guard LeBron on the perimeter. Can anyone? No, not, not especially someone of that size. Seven points for LeBron James, who carefully dissected the Wizards' defense on that possession. Uh, bad matchup here, right, Tyler? Right. Jan Vesely fouling LeBron James, who will go to the line with his seven points. LeBron for the three, kaboom! Oh, it's two, it's two in one game. <laughs> you got your two kabooms. <laughs> He's running that elbow play they like to run. The many options off that play, especially with LeBron. Look at that pass oh, inside. Good pass, good pass, LeBron. The elbow play with LeBron on the elbow is really a tough play for the defense to play against. We're with Tyler Gutzmer, the 15-year-old from Hollywood, who's delighted along with the rest of us watching LeBron James and the Heat. James with 14 points. Bosch has 15. I can't really describe it. Just to have, twi to have 20 or more points in how many, how many did you say? Well, that's double figures. Now he's headed towards 20 points with, with every Thir game this season. LeBron James, 36 consecutive regular season games. He opened the second half with LeBron, D. Wade, Mario Chalmers, Udonis Haslam, and Chris Bosh. And there's Wade chiming in for the first points of our second half. LeBron, that's good. First points of the second half for James. He has 18 points. Most impressive thing today for the Heat, their defense. Holding the Wizards to 37% shooting and triggering offense like that. Uh-oh. LeBron comes out of that skirmish. Hobbling. And LeBron goes almost to his knees and now takes a knee and is unlacing his left shoe. LeBron banks it in. 22 for LeBron James, and the Heat lead has grown to 16. Tony, I want to get back to what I was going to ask you. You were on the Heat coaching staff the first three years of the franchise where the wins were sparse. 15, 18, and 24 in the first three years. The Wizards, in what looks like at least now, without John Wall and the other injured players, in almost a hopeless situation. And as a coaching staff, how do you help your get, your players get through a dire situation like the one the Wizards are currently in? What you keep selling is the improvement. Every day you go out, you, you keep a positive nature. Ron Rothstein was absolutely great with that. And, uh, you know, every day we went out, we, uh, we had six rookies that first year. And each year the, the uh, wins went up. And then the fourth year, even though Ron Rothstein wasn't the coach, Kevin Lockery was there as the head coach. He wound up making the playoffs in that fourth year, and it was a lot because of Coach Rothstein and his teaching. LeBron James with 24 points now. Miami held under 100 points, but they win it 99-71. The Miami Heat are 23-9. and nine. They played the fewest road games of anybody in the league. Tonight is the first of six straight on the road. Udonis Haslam, LeBron James, and Chris Bosh up front. Mario Chalmers and Dwayne Wade are the guards. Bosh with his second shot, and this one is good, and a two-to-one lead for Miami. So Lance Stevenson goes to the bench, second foul, seven early points, and that means Gerald Green is up, and he'll guard Dwayne Wade. He, not only seven points, I, he did an okay job against Dwayne Wade. Dwayne Wade just made some terrific plays. That is just power by LeBron James from almost two steps away from the basket, took a step and just powered it through. Uh, Roy Hibbert. Norris Cole is in out of Dayton, Ohio, and his jump shot is good. Second year out of Cleveland State, played at Dayton Dunbar, and also out is the ageless one, Ray Allen. James free throw line, ducks in, and the jumper good. Did you see how much space he cleared? I mean, he literally cleared about 10 feet by just jumping away from Jan Mahini, who at seven feet tall, just couldn't get there to block the shot. Paul George had the ball knocked out. That's a block by LeBron James. Miami just three and three in its last six games. They had won eight of nine. James goes in and scores. He has six. He, he took two dribbles, and he'd been shooting shots left-handed. He shot that right-handed, and Roy Hebert couldn't get over there. Boy, Chalmers got his hands on that ball. 
Oh, no. They were able to throw it up after they, they, Dwayne Wade messed it around a little bit, but Wayne, LeBron James only had uh, George Hill to jump over to get to it. That was only Indiana's fourth turnover. Again, George Hill missed three straight games with a thigh contusion. Came back on Saturday night against Milwaukee, had 14 points, eight rebounds, four assists. Bosch on the baseline and hits, and Miami scores the first two of the second half. And here's George Hill, a three-point shot, no good. Missed all three of his shots. But that's a good look. I mean, it's a wide open look. He can't get it here. There's no way. He, when he did a stop and start, there was no way that Paul George was going to be able to get in front of him enough to keep LeBron James from lifting through there. And the, there was just no help. He had their largest lead of the game just moments ago at four. Now they have James in the post against Paul George looking for him. Now they want to force him baseline. Even from there, because that's where the help will come. He likes to go middle. They, they want to force him baseline. That's why he's such a problem, because he can make shots. James in the post. Turns, left hand. James, averaging 27 per game. Turned it over. Here comes Hill. It's inside, pinned. Well, he did. He got there. Only because Batty held him up long enough. Screen comes from Anthony. Not much you can say about that. That is just the best player in the world making an unbelievable play. Wade out to James. His three-point shot good. 19 for LeBron James. Indiana's hit 9 of 21 from behind the arc. Green's hit one. Paul George has four. He defends James for a step back jumper and it's a long two. James has 21. James goes inside, leaves it off for Bosch. 28 and 7 tenths to play. Bosch has 14. The Pacers get LeBron James in Miami's attention. And Paul George, the star tonight, 29 points and 11 rebounds as Indiana holds Miami below 80 points. And the Pacers win it, 87-77. It's the only visit by the defending NBA champions to the Pacific Northwest as we welcome you to Portland, Oregon, and a capacity-filled Rose Garden. The defending NBA champion Miami Heat taking on one of the true surprises of this season, the young Portland Trailblazers. For the first year of this triumvirate, the tomb somehow gets that dunk attempt to roll in. But that first year with Miami, they, they were so predictable as LeBron scores in transition. Matthews can't connect on the three, but I think a big key for Miami is Bosch's play in the paint. And James again leaking early and getting down at the other end. Nice feed from Mario Chalmers. It's an end game. We're at 15 rebounds. Oh. Miami back inside. Great find. Bosch will corkscrew up and LeBron who is uh, number 10 in assists right now in the NBA, comes up with a beautiful feed right there. Damian Lillard won his second Kia Rookie of the Month award. He said he had a terrible time early on guarding the screen and roll. He left a lot of space between himself and the man he was guarding. He's since tightened that up, and he feels like his improvement defensively has helped the Blazers as a team improve defensively. Devin? Wade puts that in. Thank you, Dave. There's each nothing run right now by the Trail Blazers, number eight in the Western Conference. James for three. Good! And LeBron puts it in from outside. Matthews knocked away LeBron. <laughs> How fast and powerful is LeBron in transition. We've seen it a million times. And the two made a great effort after this beautiful block shot and rim run from LeBron. But look at that speed and then the, the grace in the air finishing with that left. Well, you know, as Steve mentioned, they they have to sell LaMarcus Aldridge on this because he does have options. He thinks they need some help. He loves J.J. Hickson's effort and intensity, but in all honesty, if this team's going to take the next step, he said we need somebody 7 feet, 7'1", seven, that can take some of the pressure off of us inside defensively, and that will help him out as well down the road. They love Hickson as a piece, but going forward, they do have cap room. They do have Myers Leonard. Aldridge across the hey! Here comes Wade. Boy, you know what? He looks healthier, but too with a nice knock away. But there is LeBron to clean up what looked to be a great defensive play. Comes back to bite him, and Batum quickly the other way racing and fouled on the play. And LeBron, who doesn't get fouled uh, in foul issues a lot, 
Wolves the one to pick it up. Now Portland's trying to get this crowd back in. The crowd, they want to get back in. But they need a, a couple more plays like that. And it, cutting this deficit a little bit more as Bosch knocks it in. And it seems like every time it, Portland's been ready to make that push, Miami's had an answer. Allen inside, caught it, and dumps it in. And Allen, 4 of 8 with 11. It's a three from Mike Miller. And when he starts to hit along with Allen, this Miami team becomes very difficult to beat. It's over by Wade. Brown's got four to work on. A Batum defensive move and a good shot by LeBron James. He's played the 37 minutes. He gets his first field goal since the final minute of the first half. Allen a three. Braves got seven in the quarter and 14 for the game. A great execution for Miami. Chris Bosch. Big night for Bosch. 27 for Bosch tonight. Lillard, the rookie with the ball. Wade, the veteran, defending. Good find, the two. Wesley Matthews, a three! What a big time shot! That ties it again, now at 88. What a gorgeous play. Brought up by Terry Stotts in that situation. Absolutely, perfectly executed by the Blazers. James to Bosch with a quick flush and a Miami two-point lead. LeBron James, there's nobody better. The penetration, the find, he just threw the entire Portland defense to him. Spectacular play. James with nine assists, 10 rebounds, and only 15 points. He's had 33 consecutive games of 20 points or more. May come to a close. Matthews, a three, cold! Oh, oh, what a cold-blooded three by the assassin, Wesley Matthews. And they had a big fourth quarter lead of 12 points, 7.55 to play. Portland's been on a 24-10 run. Here we go. Matthews on James. Bosch a screen. Chris Bosch. Chalmers for the win. Nine consecutive home wins for the Portland Trail Blazers. They go five games over 520 and 15. The middle game of Miami's six-game road trip is here in California's capital city of Sacramento. The Heat has lost five of their last eight games, including the first two on this trip, but defending champs very hungry for a road win. And welcome everybody inside the Sleep Train Arena for the first of two meetings between the Heat and the Kings. LeBron with a steal, took it away from Simons. The chase is on. Oh my! A ferocious 47th dunk of the season for King Jam. Rebound to Wade with a heat up four. The long pass for LeBron. And he draws the foul on Garcia. That's too bad for uh, Sacramento. They bailed him out on that play. He caught the pass behind the backboard. This is Cousins. Cross court for Evans. And Evans pass at the side of the backboard. Another Kings turnover, a chance to run. Wade for LeBron. Oh, man. <laughs> Well, they got what they paid for tonight, baby. That's what they came to see. We haven't seen that one before. And, and all the lob passes, that might be the best one, man. Throw it up there. Throw it down backwards, baby. Wow. Oh, Cousins traveled, and Joel sent it back at him. Here comes LeBron. Look at him go. Oh, my. Right through Isaiah Thomas. He shredded the point guard for his eighth point, and the Heat lead by 10 again. And yeah, he got fouled with no call. LeBron has made his first three shots tonight. Look at the pressure on Evans. Throws it off the body of Allen. It's stolen away by LeBron. Three on one break. Look out. Well, the Heat are ripping apart the Kings defensively. Thomas missed it. Cousins missed it. And then LeBron blocked it. And now there's a 2-3 matchup zone by the Sacramento Kings. With the Heat up 14. Four and a half minutes left first half. Miller. Kaboom. Mike Miller has just pulled even with Antoine Walker, the former Celtic and Heat swingman, at number 22 on the league's all-time three-point chart. Mike now with 1,386 career triples. And a nice rebound for Miller. Excellent defense by Joel Anthony that time. Wade hammers it down. His 36th dunk of the year. He'd have made seven field goals in a row. Jackson will talk with Heat assistant coach Bob McAdoo right before the third quarter begins. But don't go anywhere. Dwayne Wade tossing in the jump hook. Wade has six of his eight points in this quarter. Bosh! Oh, that's stuck for Chris. And he now has 14 points for Maya. Cousins whips it cross court for a Thomas three. And LeBron 
with a rebound, and here he comes. Chalmers, corner three. Kaboom! Eric, he knew Six Chal triples for Chalmers. He knew Chalmers was there all along. That's Marcus Thornton for three. And D Wade, great box out and rebound. See what LeBron does. One on two. Rips right through. <laughs> he, made, he made that look easy, didn't he? Salmon's great defense by Wade. And the Heat in the fast lane. Look out below. Well, it's amazing how D Wade and LeBron fill the lanes when they're running down the floor. Let's see. Sacramento Kings, 65th year of a, a nomadic franchise. They moved here in 85 86. This is their 28th year in Sacramento, California. Of course, the franchise began as the Rochester Royals. They moved to Cincinnati, then on to Kansas City. LeBron scoops it up and in. Miami putting on a clinic and a show. Thomas blocked by LeBron. LeBron James, five steals and now two blocks. You can see that coming all the way. Heat on the shot clock. Nice pass by Cousins. Bosch with a block. Well, the Heat having a grand old time here in Sacramento tonight. Ahead by 35 and still playing hard. Allen for three. Kaboom. LeBron could have shot that, Eric. He gave it up to the open man. That's the teamwork you, you love about this team. Now Miami wins it 128 to 99. Ball game is over. The Heat with a 29 point win. And the starting five for Miami Mario Chalmers, Dwayne Wade in the backcourt up front, Chris Bosch, Udonis Haslam, and the three time MVP, LeBron James. Big Al. He'll take it up, push shot, right hand short. Al has shot the ball extremely well on that road trip. Right at 60%. Easy two and a dunk by LeBron. And you can't let this happen. If you're going to beat the Miami Heat, you have to stop their transition points. Three to shoot it. Tinsley on a dribble drive. He'll pull the trigger. No. Off the back of the rim, and there's a big rebound by LeBron. LeBron leads his team in rebounds, points, assists, and steals. And the continuation will put LeBron on the line for a three-point opportunity. Miami with the ball up 12-8. LeBron inside. Jazz, we're caught sleeping. And right, now, and, and right now, the Heat are scoring on inside the paint in layups. And that's something you have to take away from them. Wayne out front. Lob it down. Catch and shoot. LeBron James. There's some plays that just aren't fair. Al coming off a double-double in Detroit with 20 points and 10 rebounds. And what was more impressive is defense as well, Matt, with four steals in that game. Yeah, we've been talking about his defense lately in the last three weeks now. He's really stepped it up. You see LeBron, how easy he scores the basketball. I'll tell you, that's strength. After the timeout, they go to LeBron inside. James breaks away as Jamari Carroll took the slip. LeBron fires it up. No panic. No, you're talking 40% from the three-point land this year. LeBron holds it with one hand. Cutter, Wade. And a late foul, Foy. That's going to be three on Foy. Chalmers trots across the timeline. Back out front, LeBron throws down his shoulder. Went for the slam that came off the rim. Crowd gives him a little razzle. There's a steal. Chalmers, LeBron. He won't miss that time. You won't see LeBron James miss many dunks, especially as wide open as that. There's a steal out front. Foy couldn't grab it. LeBron, great got, acceleration. Amazing recovery speed. That's his third steal of the game. He's up to 1.6 steals a game. Bosch for two. You see Bosch. We talked about him in the first half. He averages 18, but he gets a lot of wide open jump shots. LeBron, right back with a three-point shot. Tenacious D by Utah. Ray Allen tries to roll in, throws it down low. LeBron and one. Going back to Kobe, he always tried to do it hard. And when he did his shot, sometimes he would try to hit fadeaways. And it seemed like he scored hard at times. LeBron scores so easily. Yo-Yo is a dribble against Carroll. Makes his move. And there you go. He worked the clock down to four and used the glass and knocked down his 28th point of the ball game. Cutter, LeBron. Layup, left hand. Pick and roll it. Anthony. LeBron, stop and goes against Millsap. Very few players make that shot. Chalmers. And one. Hold on. 23 for Al. 104.95. Bosch. 
That's a two-pointer. 104-97. Millsap will inbound. Tinsley takes it across midcourt. And listen to this hometown crowd. NBA champion Miami Heat in the middle of a six-game road trip facing the Golden State Warriors at Oracle Arena in Oakland. Warriors one of the surprise teams in the NBA this year at 23 and 13, matching their win total from all of last year. And Chris Bosch off to a good start. A couple of things to watch in this game. No Steph Curry. He sprained his ankle today at shoot-around and is missing his first game of the season. Jared Jack is starting. And LeBron James comes into this game 18 points shy of 20,000 for his career. He has not scored yet until now. <laughs> Dwayne Wade from midcourt the alley-oop to LeBron. Miami in the middle of a six-game road trip, one and three record. Golden State, meanwhile, understands the importance of this game. Already beaten the Heat once. Great look by LeBron to Wade for the jam. And by the way, coming into today, he's two assists shy of 5,000. And he's already there. You got two here in the first five minutes of the game. And he feels more proud about that than the 20,000 points. And this is a guy that is an incredible player at everything in the game of basketball. Rebounding, defending, scoring, passing. He does it all. Knocking down threes is not too bad either. Golden State having a lot of trouble protecting the ball. Another steal. Here goes James. Here comes the show. LeBron with the slam. James with a spin. Hang. Can't score. And James hit the deck and he's hurt. LeBron holding his arm as uh, Wade gets a steal. Now LeBron on the other end. Wade with the jam. And LeBron continues to hold that right elbow. James for three. The elbow's not bothering him anymore. <laughs> Well, let's test it out here. Here's Allen from the corner. Rarely do you see him miss that one. James on the rebound and finishes beautifully with the left to give him 13. Great luck to Wade, and Wade throws it down. Golden State playing awful in the fourth quarter up in Denver, had complete control of that ball game, started turning the ball over, and you don't want to do that against teams like Denver or Miami as we get another one. Wade to LeBron, wide open Chalmers, another three, and it's back to a 12-point Miami lead, 10 straight points for the Heat. Harrison Barnes picked up his third foul, now you get Draymond Green defending LeBron, and James hits the long two. And he took a peek at him, saying, young fella, not yet, this is not your time. Lee gets past Haslam, and missed the layup, oh, and out to Jack. He boards for Landry, my goodness. And James rips down his third rebound. Carl Landry just cleaning up the glass for the Warriors. He's got nine rebounds as LeBron fires and connects. Uh-oh, one more. 17 points for James. One point away from joining the 20,000 club. Here's James on lead. LeBron with a pull-up. James hit it. The youngest in NBA history with 20,000 career points. Another great pass by James. That's six assists now for LeBron. 13-point lead for the Heat. LeBron James, 19 points. Over 20,000 now for his career. Youngest player to reach that mark at age 28. LeBron backing up and hitting another one over Jefferson. LeBron with 21. But in the first meeting with Miami, Thompson had 27 points in the win at the Heat at 21 in the first half. And Steph Curry struggled offensively in that game, yet the Warriors still won as Chalmers buries a three. And it's a 17-point lead. Harrison Barnes unable to score. Here is James. And Chalmers wide open. And back-to-back long-range jumpers for Mario Chalmers. Clay Thompson too strong. And Haslam's got it. Wade alley -oop. Oh, oh, LeBron with a finish. How about that look from Wade? And James exploding for the jam is 23rd point. LeBron James has had quite a career, great resume, great 2012 finals MVP and won his third regular season MVP. First since uh, Michael Jordan to win at least three. 
And in some areas, he's having a career season, shooting the ball from two-point land and three-point land. Speaking of threes, Choma's another one. And also a career high in rebounding for LeBron at over eight per game. What would that mean for the NBA if there was a team back in Seattle? Well, I, I love that for Seattle, too. Uh, it was a shame that they had to leave there. It's a great NBA city and so many great teams up there. A couple titles back in the 70s with Lenny Wilkins. I'd be real interested to see what happens tomorrow night with the L.A. Lakers. When the Heat go there? Heat tomorrow go there night. tomorrow. Yep. Two, two wins in a row for the Lakers, albeit the Cleveland Cavaliers, Milwaukee Bucks. James again, 25 for LeBron. As LeBron James puts up 25 points, 10 assists, 7 rebounds, eclipses the 20,000 point mark, the youngest in NBA history to do so. And how about the defense by LeBron in the Heat, holding Golden State to a season low, 75 points. It is the usual packed house better than 19,000 making their way into Staples Center. Kobe and LeBron getting ready. The NBA on TNT is presented by State Farm. It's the defending NBA champion Miami Heat facing the Los Angeles Lakers in game two of our Thursday night doubleheader. There's a steal. It's going to be a layup or a dunk here. Well, it is a dunk off the lob. LeBron James with his opening field goal. Pass picked off by Bosch. Here comes LeBron. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That never gets old, does it? <laughs> Are you oh, kidding me? And if you turn it over against Miami, particularly a live ball turnover, I mean, forget it. It's either James or Wade. One of them is going to throw it down. A steal by Wade. World Peace is back. Wade to the rim. <laughs> the Rucker has come west. <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez. James with the steal. Oh, what a pass. James on the hop. Finds Wade. Timeout. Lakers. Miami, four for four in terms of dunks. 0 for nine from every other spot on the floor. This is a mismatch right here. And LeBron takes advantage. Might have gotten fouled, too. And James goes right at Gasol, able to connect on the reverse. He thought he was fouled, does not get the call. Pass broken up. Another Laker turnover. Wade, beautiful pass to James, and he scores. Seven turnovers in this first quarter for 12 points for the Heat. Bryant, 4-3. Played by Ray Allen, who just came on along with Patty. Oh, what a move by Wade. This is why, you know, we talked about the Heat's struggles, but keep in mind, when they get to the playoffs, somebody has to beat them four times. James checking the shot clock. It's down to four. Here's LeBron! LeBron and Dwayne both in double figures in that first quarter. Is that something that can continue, or do you expect to share the ball more? It depends. I mean, they're getting uh, the active ones as a uh, benefit of our defense. So they're getting the open court, and we'll take those whenever we can get them. James double team. Bosch, yes. That's his first field goal after missing his previous four shots. You know, when you all of a sudden see Ray Allen and Batty A as a, as a turnover for the Lakers, with, you know, Miller, Chalmers surrounding LeBron, now they become impossible to go. James with the runner. Kobe Bryant actually elevated and changed his mind, and Howard was not looking for the pass here. Bryant putting the pressure on Wade. Allen sets the pick, and here is Wade slipping it to James with three seconds remaining in the half. Wade, yes, and the foul. Wade Wade showing the lively legs here tonight. World Peace on a backup shot. Got a fade. Howard missed the putback. Love the effort there. Oh, nice lead pass. Wade from James. The Lakers call for time. Bryant cannot get going. Yeah, how about let's credit the defense of Dwayne Wade and on that time. LeBron James. It counts and the foul. 21 for James. And he heads to the line. Clark. Stopped from behind by James. The foul is good on the foul. Jameson with the bucket and he will go to the line. How about the recovery of LeBron James missing the shot? Gets the block on Clark. 
the chase down. How many of these chase down blocks? Oh, that's, this that's guy beautiful. Get? With Miami in foul difficulty, Rashad Lewis. Oh, James with a nice play. Charles Clark got picked off. James to the rim. It counts of the foul. Well, Miami allows 97 points a game, which is middle of the pack. Here's LeBron oh, with the reverse. Come on, man. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Well, Pace now defending on James, who fires it. That's a three for LeBron, who has 32 points. That's their first three-pointer of the game. This is a team that averages almost nine a night. Bryant on the pull-up. LeBron diving for it. Kobe tried to take it away. Allen for three. Yes. Ray Allen, who had not been able to find the range, able to knock it down to give Miami the lead. Shot clock to five. James. Yes. Effortless. Yeah. Well, well said. 22 for Kobe, 13 have come here on the fourth, and his third for beyond the three-point line. Wade giving Miami a two-point lead. Allen off the curl. Oh, oh the high oh. arcing jumper by Ray Allen. Wow. Here's LeBron. Yes. Timeout, Lakers. Miami with a 96-90 lead with 49 seconds remaining. What a way to con to end this six-game road trip. It's the finale. Five of the games in the West. They had gone two and three. And this will make it three up and three down. They'll have five days between games. Their next game Wednesday night back home for Toronto, followed by a home game with Detroit. As James takes to the bucket and a foul. As the Heat will go to 26 and 12. And they split the six-game road trip as they head back home and the Lakers will drop to 17 and 22. The Toronto Raptors are in South Florida tonight. They feel the heat. The defending NBA champions, the opponent from American Airlines Arena. We bring you inside. The Raptors go back to back Florida tonight in Miami. Tomorrow night in Orlando, we have both games for you. Haslam gives it to LeBron James, double clutch, and James finishes. LeBron James fourth in the NBA in scoring. Last two games have combined 16 points for DeMar DeRozan, Dwayne Wade. And Wade knocks down the shot for a player like Dwayne Wade who had injuries last season, and he has two rings, one from 2006 and one from last season. And, and he's shooting 50 percent, so he, he's a tremendously efficient guy. Up at the rim, and here's Wade. When you get shots like that, you're going to shoot 50 percent. And you got a guy like that passing it to you, you're going to be a really good player. James up top. James backing down on Calderon. The help comes with the mirror, and with that, Bosch is open, and Bosch with a bucket. 
A great read that time. LeBron, he knew they were in the zone, and he took it into the heart of the day. Here's James, and that's what we were just talking about. As James explodes to the rim. It's interesting, the three times that Miami coming out of the timeout, there's Wade to James. James with a scoop shot. LeBron James crossover at the foul line, picked up by Allen Anderson. Joel Anthony sets a screen. James in the lane, off balance. Look at that shot. James fading, tough shot. It goes, and this is a time where James, who is six of eight, may just decide, you know what, it's my time. Lowry three, no, and Abbas with the rebound. James will bring it up. James drives right to the rim, and Amir Johnson got hung up on the Haslam screen. And it's a 10-point game. Two four-point plays for Toronto. Chalmers with a three. Raptors, Jose specifically never had control of the basketball, possession of it. Therefore, the shot clock is at 3.4. Here's James right in the lane, and a foul. And a foul is going to be charged. Raptors up by 11. James sends it in the corner. Battier with the bucket. All Battier had to do was stand there. In the corner, the three. Chalmers in front of the Raptors bench. Shot block. Has one. Here's Wade. Wade to James to the rim. Last time Miami led, it was 10 to 8. Here's James tied up at 73. Great cut. Wade. Ray Allen, the veteran, with a response. 83, 81, James right to the rim, counted in a foul. Joel Anthony powers over Davis. Tied at 90, entry pass on a post up. LeBron James, 92-90. To the cut, Allen. The response, what a game in South Florida. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds left, 4 seconds, James. He's going to try to win it right here, right now. He doesn't. How about this? Overtime, James up top. James gives it back to Allen. Quick trigger, Gray, sweet stroke by the future Hall of Famer. Jose Calderon gives it to Anderson. Three doesn't go, that's gonna do it. Game over. Game over in Miami. 123, 116, the Raptors gave it their all, but they come up short. And now they move on to take on the Orlando Magic. Welcome back to the American Airlines Arena. Game 40 this season for the defending NBA champs. Tonight the Heat will take their 27 and 12 record and their three game win streak in against a Piston team that 10 under 500 but they've won two of their last three and nine of their last 15. That's what the Heat have done lately. Turn the teams over and this is what usually happens off of it. It must be great, Eric, to just throw the ball up in the air, full court, know that LeBron can go up there and get it where no one else can go, and then get an assist for it. Brown James defended by Prince in his prime. He's one of the league's best defenders. Half him shook free, and LeBron hit him with a dart. Boy, how about the patience of LeBron waiting for something to develop? It finally did, and he delivered. LeBron posting Prince. See Maxi will go down a double, now retreat back to Bosch. And LeBron burns Maxi for the jump hook. There's no way to cover that man. Frank said about uh, Brandon Knight, it, it's defense first. You have to learn to defend the position before you can play the position. But we're seeing glimpses of it. When to pass, when to shoot. A kaboom for Ray oh, Allen. Boy, he was guarded tightly on that play. It doesn't matter. Here's LeBron. 
drives on Drummond and draws the foul. And Andre Drummond put himself in a compromising position when he turned his back on LeBron James. 5.50 left, second quarter, he'd have scored six straight points as LeBron looks for more. Now an 8-0 run for the Heat and a one-point lead for the Pistons. Well, LeBron backing this man down and then making a left-hand bank shot. Block shot by Joel. Here comes LeBron. Right at Brandon Knight. Right by Knight. Good night. Just like Alonzo Mourning used to do, Eric. Block the shot. Start the fast break. And he's ahead by seven. Wade dunks it down off a great lob from LeBron. Dwayne Wade with 23 points. His highest scoring quarter of the season. He has 18 points in this second period. How about he's got four assists to go with his 23 points? And how about the Heat shooting 61% as a team? Wade with a steal. Here comes Miami. LeBron! Crash! Boom! Hurrah! Oh my, you do not take your eyes off a game when the Heat are playing with LeBron and D. Wade on the floor. Everyone expected Wade to go to the basket. He's been the hot hand. What did he do? Feeds the best player on the planet to throw it down. Could've, he could have done that with his chin. LeBron James. Watch LeBron now. Watch. See, they're going to catch the defense sleeping right there. They make eye contact on the play, so D. Wade's got to come back and return the favor. How about D. Wade with his fifth assist to go with 23 points? Wow. Look at that majesty. The ascending greatness of Dwayne Wade and LeBron James. You know, those two have 24 of the Heat's last 26 points. I still think they're the two best players in the open court on the same team in the NBA. Here's LeBron on the runway. Look out below. <laughs> what do you remember most fondly about your four seasons playing for the Heat? Well, you know, I remember coming here with the idea that I was going to get to play with Alonzo Mourning, and that didn't pan out. And then uh, we had a couple of bad seasons. But the most memorable thing was that fourth year when we started out 0-7 and turned it around. Yeah, you and Anthony Mason combined uh, as a terrific front court duo. You guys actually won 50 games that season. We did. You know, we went out there and did what we had to do. As soon as Zoe went down, Coach Cameron talked to us and told us that our roles were going to change. We started off 0-7, and, and I think everybody thought, oh, my God, here it goes again. And then Stan Van Gundy was the one that kept us together and kept us believing that if we continue to grow the way we were growing, we would start winning by the 10th or 12th game, and we did. You know, selfishly, I could have wanted to stay here and been on that team, and maybe that team would have grown into something. But that was probably the best business move that I think Pat Riley made because it brought a perennial player like Shaquille O'Neal in here that got it done in just two years. And when Brian Grant watches LeBron James play, he thinks what? I think, wow, look how far he's come because those first two or three years, he was just trying to fill his way. So I never got a chance to play against the King. I was playing against LeBron. And then that, now he's become the King, you know? I mean, his game is just incredible. He's, he's, a, he's a freak of nature out there. Bosch will shoot and him. Chris Bosch with four points in the quarter, 13 for the game, minute 35 left in the period. LeBron on the pull up. That's good. 23 for LeBron James. Five on the shot clock, seven seconds left in the third. Allen for three. Kaboom. Second triple of the night for the NBA's all-time three-point king. How about LeBron, 23, seven and seven tonight. Kim English missing the three. And Rashad Lewis with likely the final rebound of a very pleasant night for Miami. The Heat get their 28th win. They go to 18 and three at home and miles and smiles here in Miami. The defending champion Miami Heat in New England to take on the Boston Celtics as we start the Sunday showcase. And it's the NBA here on ABC on this Sunday. Temperature below freezing in frigid New England and the Celtics just as cold to match. They've lost six consecutive games after a six game win streak. James working on Pierce comes baseline. Shot clock down at 10. And the all-star Chris Bosh comes to the basket. Works inside Garnett and breaks the scoring seal on this one. LeBron beats a similar space at the top and knocks down his first field. Watch out here now. James in transition on Pierce. Comes to the basket and gives Miami the lead. Now that was beautiful. Celtics on top by one. Here in the early going second meeting between these teams. Now he just called for the ball. He wanted that one-on-one. -on -one. 
Lee was defending. Bosch from the outside, the forgotten star of the Miami All-Stars. He'll be making his eighth All-Star weekend appearance coming up in Houston. Bradley got around James. James got around the front end of the basket to knock it away. Brandon Bass on one end, Dwayne Wade on the other, and Miami takes the lead to 16 3rd Jason Terry off the bench, off the mark. Sollinger couldn't get the put back, hit the deck as the Heat come the other way with James. Chris Bosch has knocked down a couple of jumpers from that same right wing. Terry a transition triple. Well, we're so accustomed to seeing him in a Dallas uniform being able to do that and knock it down and shoot the high percentage. Here they have confidence that he'll come out of his slump. Morris Cole, the backup point guard on the miss. It's another second chance for James at the rim, and Miami leads by four. James bully to the basket. Nobody's stopping him. Well, well come on. <laughs> it was great, right? All he did is he dropped the shoulder and said, I'm going. James knocks down the three from the outside. First three-pointer hit for Miami today. James, same spot, oh, oh. brings up back-to-back three-pointers. And after Boston took a brief lead, LeBron has erased it. Well, there are only five guys in the history of this game to score 20,000 points, 10,000 rebounds, and 4,000 assists. Kareem, Carl Malone, Wilt, Charles Barkley, and Garnett. Not bad company. That's good company right there, James and Wade. Wade in transition, bounce change. Now that was good. Okay, Jeff, longtime PR person here with the Celtics, so that happened, I'm sure, late at halftime, and then Rondo coming back here at the start of the second half, and in the back there, James knocks down the outside shot. 4.9 the difference, game and shot clock. He loves to attack from this spot late in the quarter. James with a knockdown, he's having a big quarter. Strong drive, James on the fadeaway. LeBron 24, timeout Boston. Allen triggers to LeBron. James Allen floats to the corner for three. No good. Rebound kept alive. James can go get it as it was deflected. Now down to 10 seconds left. James for the tie. Got them all. No timeouts, Boston. I'll leave it at 87. Garnett's got to get it in. He does to Pierce. You have plenty of time here now. You're going to get a good shot. Here is Pierce to the basket. Lost it out of bounds. It's Celtic ball. Two seconds left. And they have no timeout. Terry trying to shake free. Got to get it inbounds. It's Terry from the top for the win. We'll play five more. Clock at six. James with a great point for Allen coming around the baseline. Now that's just a great pass by LeBron. Wade with that serpentine dribble. James three. Battier back tap right to LeBron. Jason Terry had run out for a layup. Can't Ball came that. right to James. Bullies his way to the basket again. Uh, as soon as he saw Terry on him, you knew that he was going to take him strong. Secondary screen got Wade some space. Couldn't make it. Pierce couldn't time the jump, and James is yeah. 31. Now from Tied here, up Austin. Pierce got pushed in the back. Miami will keep it right here. 15th rebound keeps it alive. At the end of the game, it is Dwayne Wade leaning, stepping back. Double overtime. Miami hit the score first two minutes of the second overtime. What a fine boss diving down the lane as they try to trap James. James got a step coming to the basket. What a contact. Blocking foul is called. James has 34 points. The Miami lead is three, and Boston will stop it with 102 left in the second overtime. Battier gets it in to Wayne. Got a two. It's Battier for three in the win. No good. And the Celtics. Show resiliency and win in double overtime. Welcome to NBA Wednesday presented by State Farm. We kick off our NBA doubleheader in Brooklyn, New York, the Barclays Center, a sellout crowd. The defending champs with their one and only visit of the season facing the Brooklyn Nets. Johnson throws it away, James the steal, James gets it back, pretty passed away. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? See, that's incredible vision. Yeah, Williams and Johnson back backcourt, much hype before the season started. Maybe the best backcourt in the NBA is Bosch knocks it down. It, it does take time, Ruby, for, for guys to get used to each other. James, a couple of jab steps, and that's going to be an interesting matchup because Gerald Wallace, he's got at least the physical style 
to try and stay with LeBron. Yeah, the main thing is if you get LeBron to take the jump shot, you're doing your guy. Games to Chalmers. Mario Chalmers connects on a three-pointer, and the Heat go up by six. Wade, nice bounce pass. Haslam blocked by Wallace. Excellent recovery, but look who comes up with a loose ball. Nice. He's so quick. You know, Williams, self-admittedly, did not play well early in the season. He felt that was a big part of why they lose it, why they were losing. Playing much better recently. He's been a little healthier recently. Really. Johnson can't connect. Well, the big thing for him is, is, is if he's healthy enough, he can shoot a high percentage in threes as well as on, on the regular field goal. James takes his time, gathers, and easily puts it in. It's double figures. James fires away. Flick of the wrist. The three-pointer is good. LeBron James, nine points, three assists, and a couple of rebounds already. Evans tries to help. Uh, nice pass to Bosch. James with a beautiful feed. Yeah, that was, that was terrific. And he's still with the best record in the East. The hesitation from James to the basket. Right, that's that's when he's at his best. Wade picked up by Lopez. Wallace tries to help. Wade blows pass. Flips it up. Shot won't go. Haslam the offensive rebound. Shot clock did not reset. Wade's going to have to put it up. Just gets it off in time and it rattles in. Credit Udonis Haslam from getting him another opportunity. Way finding Haslam. James, the corner three. And LeBron James now with 14 points. Johnson isolated with Wade. Here comes the double now. Bad pass. Chalmers with the steal. Chalmers finds Wade. Alley up to James. And the lead is back up to double figures. And it was Joe Johnson's jumper. Too long. Ball deflected. Haslam comes up with it. Yeah, I like the energy level that we're seeing from Miami. James for three. LeBron James from downtown. And the run is now 18 to 2. And this is the largest lead of the night. As Haslam throws it down and a foul. James sets him up beautifully. And a chance for a three-point play. Seven to shoot on the inbounds. James off one foot. Now with 21 points for LeBron James. See, this is where you got to be careful, right there. They showed you. They showed it to you in that first there. Oh, oh James no. knocks it down, oh, oh. and it's up to 23. Second foul on LeBron James, who really enjoyed that last shot. Yeah. Now watch to the right of the screen. You're gonna gonna see the trap. There it is, right there. And they look for the. They they were not set up for a zone attack. And then this guy, LeBron James, has come out in the second half and has just been spectacular. Norris Coles, jumper is good. Uh, a tough night for the home team, but an impressive road win for Miami. They dominate the second half, outscore the Nets by 20 in the second half, and win it 105 to 85. Here's a look at the starting lineups. Chalmers and Wade in the backcourt for Miami. James, Udonis Haslam, and Chris Bosch up front for Miami. Here's LeBron James. Down low against Paul George. And the jump hook is butter. Yeah, I, I just love that. I, I just think he can get to that anytime he wants. Stevenson. And Len Stevenson active here in the early going. He's coming off his first career double-double in that victory against Detroit a couple of nights ago. Yeah, he went through a period where he really struggled. Frank Vogel sat him down and just basically explained the importance that he has for this team as LeBron knocks down the three-point shot. LeBron, folks, this year shooting a career-high 40% from three-point territory. Well, that was his 58th. He made 54 all of last season. So obviously a lot more comfortable when it could be showtime here, Mark. LeBron James, the post-up move inside, misses twice, but fouled on the putback by the rookie. Boy, they are really going at Orlando Johnson. Mahimi, Jan Mahimi. They get the rebound back. Shot clock didn't reset, though. It's at five. Hansbro had it blocked inside by LeBron. Miami defending that two-man game pretty well. Hibbert coming up short. A chance for Miami to come within two. They've got numbers here. Mark, that's five or six possessions for the Heat, but for the Indiana Pacers as LeBron gets the hoop in the horn. And one for LeBron James, his mere strength, getting it up to the bucket. LeBron James posting up Paul George. He's got the side to himself. No double team coming. And LeBron gets well, it to him. <laughs> you, you can't handle LeBron James in the paint one-on-one. -on -one. I'm sorry. Look out. The lob. 
And LeBron James cashing in at the other end. LeBron back to Wade. Ten on the shot clock. But the screen from Haslam didn't use it. Five seconds, no reset on the shot clock. LeBron with the tough jumper over Paul George. But you just see the shots that Miami gets versus what Indiana gets. Vogel was right that Indiana's playing hard though. Yeah. Let's see if they can turn on the switch. LeBron with the floater gets it to go. Lead at 19. The defending NBA champs down. As we close in here on the end of the third period as the Birdman slams one home. Defensively, how do you withstand this oncoming charge now for the Heat that you think might be coming? We know they're the best offensive team in the NBA. So, you know, we know they got a lot of work to do. Thanks, Coach. Yeah. Well, all he has to do is have his team do what they did through in the third quarter. Bosch on the pick and roll with LeBron. Bosch didn't think he was that open. Ended up scoring a bucket. James trying to break free. It's the screen from Bosch. 360. Just another routine play by LeBron James. <laughs> Six on the shot clock. Stevenson's pass kicked off. If the Heat have one last push left in the oh. Wade trying to say yes. That's pretty. And Vogel calls timeout. The lead down to 12. The Pacers making a bit of a statement tonight, atoning at least a little bit for their playoff loss last year at the hands of the Miami Heat. On this beautiful Super Bowl Sunday in Toronto afternoon, NBA action for the defending NBA champions and the new look Raptors. Miami defeated Toronto in overtime 10 nights ago, and today looked in their four-game road trip with a victory. Welcome, everybody, inside the Air Canada Center, the second of three meetings between the Heat and the Raptors. And you know we always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. And the Heat turn over the Raptors. The lob for LeBron. And his 70th dunk of the season off a nifty dish from Mario Chan. Rudy Gay, his second game with Toronto, his first start. And Gay hits the jump shot. Now the seven-year veteran from the University of Connecticut with 20 points in 32 minutes in his Toronto debut. And smashing success for the Raptors. They beat the Clippers, who without Chris Paul two nights ago by 25. Yeah, that's the marquee matchup. LeBron and Rudy Gay as Chris Bosh hits his second J. So Bosh has four points. Look out! LeBron racing with a steal and ramming it in with a right hand. LeBron for two. And that ends a 9-0 run by the Raptors. LeBron with six points on three of three shooting. This is Battier against Allen Anderson. And Shane hits the runner. One of his rare two-point field goals this year. Five seconds left here in the first quarter. LeBron against Anderson. Oh, he took it right to the rack and powered it home. Oh, man, he took a lot of hits when he went as well, but no call. Here's Twain driving through, finding LeBron. Oh, my. LeBron landed hard. And he is shaken up. My goodness. LeBron taking Ross to the rack. Good pump fake. Good finish. LeBron James now has 13 points for Miami on 5 of 5 shooting. Wade on the attack lays it in. And he has a pretty hard landing. 12 points for Dwayne. Yeah, Coach Bosa complaining there's a lot of contact on that play. Here's Wade pitching to LeBron. Top side for a box 20-footer. And Chris exploding with seven points here in the third quarter after a six-point first half. The Heat have now outscored Toronto 12 to four in this quarter. Battier's pass for Bosch. Now over to LeBron, who hasn't scored yet in this quarter. Great pass, and Bosch goes way with a left hand. And the Heat lead is down the one. LeBron streaking through, fouled by Valanciunas. Once LeBron gets through the first line of defense the bigs for the opponents have to pick him up and he's got the advantage on that you'll never forget those pat riley coach blue collar teams with alonzo morning and pj brown and thunder dan and all the rest yeah. tim hardaway lebron oh never been better days and these days lebron james leading the way he's got 20 points the heater up three and lebron headed to the line cole from the corner got him a two-pointer for Norris Cole. His first score of the game. LeBron with 21 points today. Working on Anderson. And rolling it home for his first score of the fourth quarter. You mentioned the blood-red influence of the Heat uniforms. LeBron is a shark in NBA terms. DeRozan's jumper is no good. Rebound to LeBron. 
James against Rudy Gay. Bosch for three. Kaboom! There you go, baby. He'd need a win to keep hold of first place in the East. LeBron with a steal and slam. Oh, and a little extra gusto on LeBron James' third slam dunk of the day. By the way, a win today would not only... Here's LeBron for three. Kaboom! Well, nine points in a row for the Heat to put this game in the icebox. Congratulations to Coach Spolster and his staff. As they go, they're going to be headed to Houston to coach the Eastern Conference All-Stars, just as you mentioned. You know, coach, every staff would like to have a few days off, but, oh, LeBron with another beautiful jumper. Nine points in the quarter for LeBron, and for the 15th time this year, he reaches the 30-point mark. Now the clock is winding down. Miami outscores Toronto in the second half, 56 to 35. They turn the close game into a Super Bowl Sunday blowout. Fresh off a stretch of playing 10 out of 12 games on the road, the Heat are finally back at home in a place where they've won 18 of their 21 games. Tonight like they'll open a five-game homestand when they take on the struggling Charlotte Bobcats. Welcome inside the American Airlines Arena. For the second of four games between Miami and Charlotte, we always hope you enjoy every bounce and basket right along with us. LeBron, nice catch and finish. The Heat tie the game at two. Jeff Taylor defending LeBron James. Big task for a rookie. Now two scores for LeBron. By the way, about a thank, as thankless a job as you can have in the NBA <laughs> is defending it. LeBron. Yeah. Bosch from LeBron for two. Bottoms up for Chris Bosch. We had a big game yesterday in Toronto. 28 points on 12 for 19 shooting, almost halfway through the first quarter. LeBron draws the foul on Taylor, and that's his second. LeBron, when he has his back to the basket, you're in trouble. That was a great game, Jacks. The win over the Raptors, and a, a great team bonding exercise for the Heat, enjoying Super Bowl 47 together. LeBron James, that's a team bonder right there. He makes everybody around him better. Even though Shane Battier went down with his 49ers, Colin Kaepernick jersey and all. <laughs> it was no doubt he was the life of the party. He was a great teammate yesterday, uh, fraternizing and joking with each and every teammate. He truly was the life of our Super Bowl party. Yeah, and he said it was a great bonding experience, maybe the best of his career. 10-point first quarter for LeBron, three-point lead for the Heat. Here's Chris. Drives on Henderson, who poked it free, but right to LeBron. Oh, the Heat got a lucky, uh, not a bounce, but a, a, a carom right there. Nice pass by LeBron, setting up Norris Coles for a score. Heat lead by four. LeBron James back in the game after scoring 13 in the first quarter. Boss quick to close out on that one. Got by Jeff Taylor, laid it in. Another great dish from LeBron. Excellent. Williams missing the three ball. LeBron reaching up for his third rebound. James with a burst and a bucket. First score of the second quarter. He has 15, and he's made all six of his shots. Shane Battier with a kaboom. Miami's first three of the night. LeBron single coverage with Jeff Taylor, the rookie. Couple of pump fakes and an easy score. Seven for seven shooting and 17 points for LeBron. Bosh. Got it. A long deuce for Chris Bosh. Just under three minutes left in the third. Heat lead by two. Tighter than it probably should be. Nice pass by Cole. Gorgeous finish for LeBron, who's still perfect, coach. He's made his first eight shots. LeBron against Gerald Henderson. Oh, he made that look easy. He did. Henderson went for the steal. 21 points for LeBron. He's made nine of his ten shots. Gordon. We've seen him make shots like that. LeBron James with his sixth rebound. He trailed by one. Eight minutes to go. LeBron all the way through for the goal. Good screen by Chris Bosch. LeBron comes in the game, and he scores. One-point lead and possession for the Heat. Wade bumps with Gordon. Pitches out to LeBron. He attacks Henderson and scores again. 25 for LeBron James. An 11 for 12 shooting. And for the first time tonight, they are out of their seats at the Heat's house. Sessions double team. He coughed it up. And LeBron has Cole ahead of the field. Nice deflection. Look at that. Oh, my. From a nice deflection 
to a tremendous dunk and dish. Norris Cole with a dish. LeBron with a flush. How good has Norris Cole become throwing that lob pass up there? Bosh against Mullins. This is LeBron. Back to Bosh. Eight points in the fourth quarter for Chris. All of a sudden, he has 21. Mullins went over to help on LeBron. LeBron found Bosh. Important possession. Wade from LeBron. Another terrific pass by LeBron James. Bosh sets the screen for LeBron. Allen for three. And Mullins with a rebound. Ray Allen. Oh, the Heat get it back. Here's Bosh from LeBron. That is your play of the game. Wayne Wade knocked it away. Eric Mullins got the rebound. Wayne, Wayne knocked it out of his hands. And the final score reads Miami 99 and Charlotte 94. For the Miami Heat, a little bit of a change with Chris Bosh down with a cold. Dennis Haslam moves into the middle. Shane Battier moves into the starting lineup. Chalmers gets deep, fires it out. One hand pass from LeBron to Udonis, who drops in his first shot of the night. Yeah, the Heat may need him to make those J's, just like Chris Bosch does from mid range. LeBron James cleaning up the miss, up and down with two hands. When there's a loose ball on the floor, you got D Wade, you got LeBron, and Udonis Housing. Swain Wade moving, rotating, getting the ball to LeBron James. Jump shot. And LeBron James has scored 5,000 points with the Miami Heat. He's the ninth player in Heat history to reach that mark. And, of course, he's the fastest. LeBron James elevating. Hitting absolutely nothing but the net. LeBron James now three for three, six points. LeBron James with the make there. No question about that. He's at four, five, eight points. He had that 10-point lead. One point now with a buck 20 to go. Cole, up and in. That's a lot more confidence in that, Jay. Looking the other way as he passes, almost knocked away by Douglas, but back over to LeBron. Five seconds remaining on the shot clock. Good Got fake. Patterson up in the air. He's been watching D. Wade. <laughs> no question about the harm and the hoop there. LeBron James going to the line to try to complete the three-point conversion. Went right at Parsons. The foul was on him. <laughs> Missed by Parsons <laughs> from the edges. LeBron working on Harden, and it's the NBA's fourth leading scorer, scoring on the NBA's fifth leading scorer, and here comes more scoring, except it's a miss by the big man Patterson, and here comes LeBron James the other way. LeBron scored with the left hand at the other end, and then he came down and got a rebound, and then led to the assist at that end. Boy, it's the uh, LeBron James show. It's his world, baby. Why not? Dwayne Wade smothering, getting it up to LeBron, off to the races. Gets up the throw down, and he wants a little action on the contact after, but won't get it. So the Miami Heat close out the first half on a 20 to six run, led by defense, just like that. You know, the other stat that was, I'm sure Coach Bosco liked in that first half, he had 14 assists. You know, when the Heat have 25 or more assists, they're 11 and two. I think he's gonna like that one as well, Coach, as LeBron launches and converts. There you go, five guys touching the ball from one side of the court to the other. LeBron catches it in rhythm. Buries two threes in a row, puts the heat up 15, just like that. All right, Ricky, I know you've had a busy offseason. You and John Carlos Stanton are friends. Tell us, uh, where'd you go in, oh, this summer? Oh, yeah. We, uh, we went overseas to um, London, um, Spain, and um, Paris. So I've never been out of the country. Um, it was fun. You know, good time to relax after the season. Great in it when you're 37, 38 years old, and you're old in the in, in, in professional sports. Another three. I believe the last four baskets by the Heat have come from the three-point line. In it, launched to LeBron, up and in. They've done it again. <laughs> Through the air. How do you dare stop the connection between three and six? How about you get a touchdown pass off of a jump ball? The ten-point game, your Miami Heat, the lead is real. Tries to expand it from three and does. Harden flying as he does, loses the rock. Here comes LeBron James. And he will go to the free throw line. Douglas, right by LeBron. But LeBron came back, didn't he? That one falls short, as do the Houston Rockets on the backside of this back-to-back. -back. First game of our doubleheader starts off in Miami, Florida.
and a sold out American Airlines Arena, home of the NBA defending champion Miami Heat, who sit atop the Eastern Conference this year with a record of 32 and 14 as we head toward the All-Star break. But they've got a tough foe here as Chris Paul returns to the lineup. The LA Clippers in their only regular season visit to Miami. Paul finds Butler. Deron Butler, one of the better three-point shooters, has it swatted by LeBron James. James, rifle pass, Chalmers knocks down the three. Do you know how hard a pass that is? James hits a three. He's been shooting a career-high mark from three-point range this season. Been pretty incredible, 41%. James comes up with a rebound. James drives past Butler. Oh, the quickness, all of a sudden, the burst of speed. Love that strategy, Jeff. It's, he says offensive players, especially shooters, they don't like contact. I'm surprised you didn't say that's bad sportsmanship, that he, <laughs> he would take a purpose foul. Paul slices and dices in, blocked by James. And a 24-second violation, his second block shot of the game. Paul, ball poked away, picked up by Chalmers. Good hustle from Mario Chalmers. Couldn't get it to Lewis. James does, wide open. Rashard Lewis, 7 of 12 from downtown. And the lead is ballooned to 13. Paul, a couple of crossovers, gets free from Chalmers. Shot won't go, Anthony the rebound. 12-point game, just under four and a half remaining. A bullet pass again. Chalmers for three. James guarded by Butler. Couple of jab steps. LeBron James, four for four from the field. James the drive, the finish, the foul. Five for five from the field. The lead back up to 16, and we'll have a timeout. And the Clippers haven't taken away anything. They've given up layups, they've given them free throws, they've given them threes. You gotta take away something and stay disciplined even when a guy like James is going to work. He is going to work, all right. Six for six now, he remains perfect. Butler double, great defense from LeBron James. Ball ricochets into the crowd. They're 23 of 33 from the field. Come on, give me the ball, we gotta play. <laughs> you know things are going well when you can relax and have a little fun during the game? See, that's great. Fans pay a lot of money to come to these games and make them happy. He's got his jersey on, too, so he's rewarding the fan for buying his jersey. <laughs> this time a three. Hits it and a foul. Well, he recovers from his shooting slump to hit a three-pointer and a chance for a four-point play. He was asked this morning about... Could he have one of those, you know, 80-point games like Kobe Bryant? And he said, not the way he plays. He says his style, he goes, if he sees an open teammate, he has to pass it to him. He said, but if his teammates told him we want you to have a big game, he thought maybe he could get six, 60 or 70 in a game. Clippers trying to hang around on what has been an offensive explosion for the Heat. James again. Another three-pointer. He's three for three from downtown, and Del Negro wants timeout. The lead right back up to the largest of the night. Chalmers in and out and in again. What a show the Miami Heat are putting on here tonight. Battier for three. 12 of 18 from downtown, and they're now shooting 70% from the field. These are otherworldly passes. Going left, the strength to throw it cross court across your body on target that's special I mean, wide open looks because you have to you have to guard the roll man and if you're going to put a second defender on james as he rolls to the as, as he comes off the pick and roll you've got to rotate to the roll man so you are going to leave the person farthest away from him open and yet he has the unique ability to spot that guy. Chalmers, bang, it just continues. A shooting clinic here in Miami, 84 to 57. It's a 20 to three run. Griffin stripped, a lot of contact there. James 
knocks into Paul, and Paul is red hot. Paul is going to get a technical. He better be careful. He might get thrown out. He got crushed by LeBron James pursuing that loose ball and gets hit with a technical foul. Again, the Heat here at home, they're 20 and 3. The three losses, ball picked loose by Paul, were to the Knicks, to the Bulls. They get it right back and to the Warriors. Chalmers, James rips down the rebound, back up block, but a foul. And the only teams to beat them here in New York, Chicago and Golden State. And James getting a standing ovation. James spots up for three, puts it in. Four for five from downtown. He's now with 30 points, half of them here in the third quarter. A uh, brilliant performance from the Heat. They win their fourth in a row. They shot 63% through the first three quarters at 93 points. It was blowout after that. LeBron James, another... An amazing game, 9 of 11 from the field, he had 30. Welcome to Miami, Florida, and the second game of our NBA Sunday Showcase. A sold-out American Airlines Arena has the Heat welcoming the Los Angeles Lakers to town. World Peace, aggressive offensively, can't get it to go, ball tapped by Haslam. Here comes James. Here's where the Heat obviously excel, and James just barrels his way right into Nash. He didn't stand a chance there, took a shot in the face, and James will go to the line. James left open, and there's his first shot of the afternoon. He has just been on an unbelievable tear. He's now 44 for his last 60 shots from the field. James on the drive. That's good shot selection right there, as the Heat have tied it up. James, bullet pass to Chalmers. Eric Spolster, who got his first NBA championship last year, and what a job he has done. When his team was down both in Indiana, in Boston, and in Oklahoma City as Paul hits the corner three, he got his team to rally and find an inner strength to get an important and necessary road win. The Earl Clark, a rare good field story for this Laker team. He was kind of a salary cap throw in on the Dwight Howard deal now he's a starter and he's playing really well James goes right at him however and it puts it up and in LeBron James starts three for three again but how does Mario Chalmers shoot it get his own rebound I mean and these are the possessions if you're the Lakers that you can't make mistakes on James spinning against Nash Excellent outlet for Mario Chalmers right away, and that led to an easy two for James, who's four for four from the field. Bryant, a couple of fancy moves, ooing it on the crowd, forces it up, nearly banks it in. Howard keeps it alive, comes down with it stripped and taken by James. James to Battier for three. Tie game. Nash tied up. Ball deflected into the hands of James. James goes past Bryant, draws the foul, and one. And Nash and Howard getting into it about... Nash was telling him to move. Howard said he's wide open. Remember when, when LeBron James first came? Whose team is it going to be? Who's going to take the final shot? And that has all gone away. It's obvious LeBron James's team and Wade has just... He's been so unselfish in his acceptance of that. And he probably hasn't liked it a lot of times. You know, because as James hits it. James backs it in. All right, so of his last, he's now hit 50 of his last 68 shots from the field. Shot clock down at four. James drives to the rim, count it, and a foul. Eight for 11 from the field, 21 points. World Peace. Blows by him again, and fouled again. This time it doesn't go in. Another deflection, another offensive rebound, and a three for LeBron James. Well, oh, that one hurt the Lakers. James finds Norris Cole wide open. Bryant. 
Wade with the steal. Nash back to James. Timeout, Lakers. Well, turnover, and then no one getting back by the Lakers. Great pass by Cole to the sprinting LeBron James. Miami with their largest lead, up seven, with 5.56 to go. As James gets the steal. I think Chalmers got a piece of it, the deflection. James to the basket! Throws it down, and the lead is nine, largest of the afternoon. Wade finding some room. Shot clock down to three. James pull up two-pointer, puts it in. 32. And the Heat by a dozen. And that would should pretty much do it. So the Heat will win their fifth straight game, improve to 22 and 3 here on their home floor. LeBron James, another 30-point game where he shoots 60% or better. That's five consecutive. They sweep the season series against the Lakers. South Florida, Heat Nation, and NBA TV. Welcome to another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Second and final matchup this year between the Heat and the Trailblazers. And Chris Bosh opens the game with a mid-range splashdown. And LeBron opens the game with an assist. LeBron with a steal on the Batum pass. Here he comes, racing by Batum, and right to the bucket. Pass Lillard as well. You can see they were in trouble as soon as LeBron made that steal. He can beat people one on two, one on three when he gets a full head of steam. Wade rejected, but a goaltend on Batum. So Dwayne Wade gets his first score that way. Lobs it for Aldridge, deflected and stolen by Chalmers. This is LeBron for Dwayne, jams it home. <laughs> LeBron's got three assists already. He gave it to Dwayne exactly when he should. So LeBron now has had a, a hand in eight of the Heat's ten points. You Dennis. You did it. Dennis has him very quietly, Coach, starting to make more and more of those shots. Matter of fact, in the last 12 games, he's hitting 66%. Getting yeah, his rhythm back. Now LeBron's got four assists and a basket in the first 12 points for the Heat. And here comes Miami with a seven-point lead, making their first six shots. Number seven, that drops as well. How about LeBron? Five assists and a basket. Has a hand in 12 of the Heat's first 14 points. The Heat is seven for seven with five assists. Total. This is LeBron against Wes Matthews. And the Heat lead yeah. down to three. He got just what he wanted. No double team came, and LeBron just ripping through the defense of Wes Matthews for his second school. And a 9-2 run for Portland. Wade with a baseline jam. Six points for Dwayne. Miami leads by four. By the way, you, you gave the NBA the greatest rivalry in the league for about a four or five year span as LeBron scores with the left hand. And having your jersey hang right next to Alonzo Mourning for future generations of Heat fans for years and years, uh, it's fitting to see you guys still up in the rafters side by side. <laughs> and it's it wonderful, like? Tony, that they're both still involved with yes. the Heat franchise. And what was it like having a guy like Zoe to throw the ball to? Who do you see as Miami's top competition in the East? Oh, man, you know New York, of course. They they, they looking very good. Chicago Bulls, uh, if they get Derrick Rose back. Uh, and then you got, um, um, yeah, you got Indiana. You know, Indiana's just right there, just, just playing well. Hickson finds a wide open West Matthews, who misses on the three, and Bosch able to pull it down. But they got a wide open look for a good three point shooter. West Matthews probably shoots better with a guy in his face. LeBron brings him right to the paint and dunks it home. That's about the, the overpowering LeBron James, the best in the paint scorer this season in the NBA. LeBron with a steal. Here he comes. Defense again, Eric. That's how he get back into the game here after being down 14 with about 4.45 left in this half. LeBron got fouled, and he'll go to the line for two. And Eric, he, he, not only is he going to get to the line and have a chance to cut the deficit to one, but he did it with 1.6 seconds left in the half. Well, Pat, obviously he's our orchestrator. He's our leader. And he still is behind the scenes. You know, orchestrating everything. You know. Remember when Jamal Mashburn came to that first practice? Right. You had a little twinge in your in your hamstring, I think it was, and we went two hard hours. And I asked you afterwards, why did you do that? Well, we had to show him the Miami Heat culture. Exactly. And it was a culture. You know, and it was a contagious culture because we wanted all these guys coming into 
our system to understand what it's going to take for us to be successful as an organization. Tony, as we, uh, excuse me, Joe, as we look at Shane Battier, reminds me a lot of the role that Dan Marley played oh, yeah. on your great team. All the little things on the court, some of which that the stat sheet. So the Blazers, Tony, they're a team that can take a punch. They're hanging right in with the heat. LeBron flips it to Allen, corner three. Kaboom! A line drive triple for Ray Allen, who is two of three from downtown, has nine points, and puts the heat ahead by nine points. Brown against his former Cleveland teammate, Sasha Pavlovich, with a shot clock at four. Drives in and scores. That was pretty. Wow. You tell me. We don't have the game. You can listen to Mike Ingles on 790 to ticket. Oh my! What a chase down block by LeBron James, who could not hoover the ball back up after he blocked it, but he just saved two points. Oh my. He called it that chase down. Oh, that was goaltending. The ball hit the backboard first. By the way, the Blazers are very good in close games this year. They're eight and one in games decided by two points or less. LeBron, wham, with both hands, oh, dunking on Pavlovich. Wow. 29 for LeBron. Look at Lillard fly in. LeBron with another spectacular block. Heat by six. Here comes Wade. Chalmers for three. He waited with another assist. That was the Heat's eighth block shot of the game. There's another. Allen on the breakout against Lillard. Back to LeBron. Oh, my. There's the 30, baby. Going to be the first player in the history of the NBA that There's six straight games scoring 30 points or more and 60% each game. Well, the Heat closed the game out on a 16-2 run, though. And the season series with the Trailblazers. One win apiece. The win streak lives on. Eight straight at home. Six wins in a row overall. And the night the Heat had the finishing touch in the fourth quarter, closing out the game with a 16-2 run. A great night for the Heat's three superstars. On a mild 54-degree day in Oklahoma City, it will be the usual packed house and great atmosphere. Better than 18,000 making their way into Chesapeake Energy Arena. Game one of our Thursday night doubleheader featuring two of the premier players. LeBron James going at a record-setting level. And Kevin Durant, the three-time scoring champion, looking to make it four in a row. The NBA on TNT is being presented by State Farm, and tonight a matchup of the two teams that met in last season's finals, the defending champion Miami Heat facing the Oklahoma City Thunder, two of the best in the NBA. And he gets a down low, they double up on James, Wade gets the roll. Mark, you talked about turnovers, ball management is going to be key in this game. The steal Bosch with Wade in front, here's Wade giving it right back and James puts it down. You can't turn the basketball over. We talked about Dwayne Wade and LeBron James, excellent finishers in the open court. Again, Chris Bosch leading that break. LeBron James gave Scott Brooks and his staff fits during last year's NBA Finals when he averaged 29 points and 10 rebounds and earning the MVP. Preparing for this game, Brooks said he went over all sorts of videotape and computer analysis trying to come up with some defensive wrinkle. A zone, going small, going big, double teaming LeBron without the ball, he considered them all. He said his conclusion, LeBron's individual greatness surpassed only by his commitment to play for the team. He says he is the most versatile and hardest player to defend since Magic Johnson. I think this is a bigger game for Oklahoma City than it is for Miami. Reggie, I don't know how you, how you feel, but just from a, a psychological standpoint, they've lost five in a row. This is their last meeting this year. LeBron's going to get fouled going up. Oh, what, do you, what do you think? Look, the Heat are the champions. And they've shown that they can beat this, this younger team. Well, Miami's defense is active like they've been so far tonight. I mean, they're, they're basically unbeatable because they've got so much better offensively with their spacing and their individual play. Look at that oh, pass. Beautiful oh, pass oh, from James. And Scott Brooks wants to talk. Shot clock down to five. James. And that's a two. Had a foot on the line. What a beautiful fadeaway move to free himself up. That's the fourth Oklahoma City Thunder defender that's been on LeBron James in this first quarter. Off the steal, here comes LeBron on the hop for Wade, and Wade able to lay it in. Lethal, <laughs> just lethal. Uh, here is Allen for three. 
shooting fish in a barrel out here now. I mean, with LeBron James running point, being able to see over the defense, so much attention. Correct me if I'm wrong, but MJ only had one title at the age of 28 also. So, I mean, it, there's a long way to go with this guy. The one thing we do know is he knocks down another three is that he's playing at a level very few players have ever reached. He's at the peak of his powers, both physically and mentally, and it's just incredible to watch him. James to the step back. Oh, oh yes. my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> He will become unguardable if he hits that shot on a consistent basis. All right, here's James again this time in the face of Cephalosha. <laughs> he stared over at us a little bit, too. How about this matchup? Oh, Lord, someone needs to send help immediately. <laughs> James immediately. <laughs> Buckets for three. There's no way. I mean, LeBron James is doing that against Kevin Durant and Cephalosha, but when you get Kendrick Perkins isolated on an island right there, 9-1-1 in a heartbeat. Miami 35 and 14, best record in the East. Three and a half in front of the Knicks who've been struggling. As of late, as Chris Bosch gets right to it, he has 14 points. Four minutes gone by in this third quarter. Chalmers for three. Westbrook keeps cheating. You know, he keeps going underneath the screen trying to beat Mario Chalmers. And Chalmers is doing exactly what he's supposed to do. He reads the defender. Step back, and it's a wide open three. James, yes. And all what that was was a series of jazz steps. Bosch, wide oh. open. Oh. LeBron right there. I'm going to follow LeBron James. Had the headband not free, but able to pick up another two. 27 points for LeBron. Oh. Durant had it knocked away. Here comes LeBron, and he puts it down. Lewis, shot clock, rolling down, it's down to one, James again over the pad out. <laughs> the Heat with a three-pointer. And they're on their feet in Oklahoma City. Very quiet, understandably, in the first half. Battier open for three, and Miami continues to hit the big shot just when it appears the Thunder is on the verge of trimming it to single digits. The lead for James, so LeBron on the lob. He now has 35, along with 12 rebounds, seven assists. Shot clock to five. Now Ibaka defending on James. One on the 24, and James hits. That was Dirk Nowitzki-like right there. The one-footer. It is a 10-point Miami lead as they go for their seventh straight win. Oh, it's James off the inbounds. The Thunder catching the heat. LeBron James puts it down. He now has 39 points, and the Thunder calling for time. And Steve, how does this happen here? I mean, Westbrook allowed him to get to his left, and here, just thrown out the way, LeBron James, monster effort once again. Although they can just hold the ball in the game. So if LeBron is at 58%, <laughs> 14 you, for 24. You, you want him to run yeah. down and get a basket well, just he to has get it this in his head. <laughs> so that yeah. amazing streak will end as he scores 39 points, comes up with 12 rebounds and 7 assists. And he shot only 14 for 24 <laughs> for the 58-9. What an off night. There's LeBron. the final. Miami 110, Oklahoma City 100. On your Miami Heat, you know this lineup. The co-captains, they're there together. Haslam back, LeBron, Bosch in the middle, and guess who's in the Sun Sports Spotlight, number 1-5. Well, the Heat wearing their road red uniforms tonight in Atlanta. First of three straight on the road for Miami in Chicago tomorrow night at Philly on Saturday. Kaboom! Mario Chalmers collecting his 70th triple this season. The steal by LeBron is second of the quarter. And here he comes right at Horford. And Horford with a block. Haslam missing in the foul. Oh, um, Haslam missed the layup. That's Horford's second block here in the first quarter. And here we go again. Heat are doing a good job on the defensive boards. They're doing a good job defensively stealing the ball. Finally results in a basket. LeBron to his right and went right past Johnson easily. There's no way Johnson can guard him on the perimeter. Five points for LeBron James. LeBron gets past one defender, draws a foul on the other.
Ivan Johnson picking up his first. LeBron James will go to the line for the second time here in the first quarter. Good use of the screen by LeBron. That he for three. Ten straight games with at least one three. LeBron comes back into the game with seven points. And draws foul. Josh Smith committing the foul. That's the second time he got by Josh Smith and drew a foul on the secondary defender. A steal by Wade. He's got LeBron there off the glass. <laughs> and down the road. All right, that woke up the crowd. <laughs> That's what they did in the All-Star game. Wow. That's the first time I've seen that in a game this season with, with the two of them. Dwayne, good job avoiding the sideline. Sees LeBron coming. And since he practiced that in the All-Star game, he had it down. Kaboom. LeBron James with his 73rd triple this season and his first of the game. About shooting 42% from downtown. Good story, Jackson. Remember, that's how Eric Spolstra began his NBA career as the Heat's video coordinator. I love what Fizz did there. Dan Craig is a guy that's worked with Norris Cole from day one. And he does a great job as the video coordinator for the Heat. Really works hard. 19-5 run. And a four-point lead, actually a six-point lead now. 20 to five run. Oh, that's good. The three counts. Oh, man. <laughs> a little hop of the jump for Shane Battier as he heads to the locker room. And a smile from Dr. J on the LeBron three that gives him 19 first-half points. Wow. You talk about knowing the clock, being able to seize the moment, shooting an over Horford. It's out of his hands. All net, baby. Another three for LeBron to end the half. He'd only down three instead of down down four. Uh, down three instead of down six. Hawks by five. Here's LeBron stopping and scoring. 20 points for LeBron. Eaton Bulls, remember the Bulls beat the Heat 96-89 in Miami back on the 4th of January. Still no Derrick Rose for Chicago. He may or may not come back this season. Nice move by Chalmers, who apparently is shaking off the sprain right ankle. Corver's 12 points are big. Allen got inside of Corver, got the score and the foul. That's the third time tonight that Corver was fronting in the low post. Wade got him twice. And right there, Ray Allen got him on a gorgeous pass from LeBron. Cole knocked it away. Here comes LeBron. Battier for three. Come on. Yeah, baby. He come right back. Corver for Horford. He missed it. And LeBron off and running with a rebound. Heat up one. James blowing by Corver who commits the foul. Corver had no shot right there. Does anybody? <laughs> Not really. Six on the shot clock for Miami. Allen squares for three. Come on. That is the ninth triple of the game for Miami and the first for Ray Allen. Excellent use of the screen. Another assist for LeBron. Nice oh. play. LeBron with a gorgeous feed. Ray Allen lays it in. Tony Ray Allen has come to life in the fourth quarter. He's got ten points. Miami has five players in double figures. Including Battier and Allen off the heat bench. There's Bosch. That's good. How about your first field goal? Coming with four minutes left in the game after missing on your first eight shots. Well, we talked about how strong-minded he is. That doesn't phase him. His next shot's going in. That's what he thinks. There's a steal by Wade. Uh-oh, here comes LeBron. <laughs> you see it coming all the way. Well, the Heat Nation alive and well here at Phillips Arena in Atlanta. LeBron comes baseline. Allen, a corner three. Come on. Another assist from LeBron. Wow. Ray Allen, you said it, Eric. Best three-point shooter in the history of the NBA. Coming alive in the fourth quarter. LeBron surveying the defense. Has 24 points, nine assists, and five rebounds. And there's another assist. His tenth assist. Finds Dwayne Wade underneath the bucket. Wade with six of his 18 points here in the fourth quarter. How about the Heat with 12 assists in this quarter? It'll be an interesting game tomorrow night, Eric, because Chicago doesn't play tonight. And the Heat do. They're going to get in about 2, 3 in the morning. The uh, Heat win their 37th game. They go 3-0 and against Atlanta this year. 
with one more game remaining March 12th in Miami. On a bitter cold 24 degree day in Chicago with snow expected later tonight. It's the usual sellout crowd, better than 21,000 still making their way into the United Center. The NBA on TNT is presented by State Farm. It's the defending NBA champion Miami Heat facing the Chicago Bulls in game one of our Thursday night doubleheader. Great matchup tonight, Marv. Teams with really contrasting styles. Miami with the big three. Probably the most efficient offense in the league. Chicago relies on its physical front line and its defensive rebound. And Chris Bosch coming off the two for ten, preceded by what has to be considered a forgettable All-Star game, is able to knock down the first field goal of the night. Knocked away from Noah Chalmers, putting behind the back as you put it over on Hamilton to set it up for James. Well, a pass thrown by Noah, picked off by James. Three on two for Miami. Here is LeBron going right at Noah. And this is the problem. And if you're Tom Thibodeau, I mean, you, you just can't turn the ball over against Miami. Chalmers from deep. And LeBron James with the follow. Jimmy Butler on the miss. I like the pickup today by the Thunder. Uh, trading as James knocks down the three. Chris Anderson, who was a question mark for tonight with a sprained left foot. In fact, last night left on crutches and he's still working his way into a proper condition as Chalmers gets the roll. Bulls scored us for the last three minutes and 20 seconds. Miami with 10 unanswered points. And they've taken the eight point lead. Here's Robinson. Attempting a three. The scary thing for Chicago, Marv, is most of that damage was done with LeBron on the bench. So now he's back. Whoa! <laughs> what a spin on that shot by LeBron going in with the left hand. He's five for five from the field. 11 points. Chris Bosch. Nice pass. And Wade with the finish. The assist. To LeBron James. Remember, Chicago to, to beat Miami, you know, they have to pound the heat on the glass. The only way to do that is Boss scores off the set play from LeBron. James on the drive. That counts in the foul. He just went right through Marcus T. Like he wasn't even there. But uh, this is the Bulls style. They try to get the opposition also involved in the same way, but Wade hits again. Hamilton picked up by Haslam, has Noah. LeBron James. Little head fake. Cuts to his left. He's seven of nine from the field for 16. The other guy is LeBron again. <laughs> they, they know what they're doing against Miami. They, they're trying to move it side to side and avoid pick and roll situations that get congested. Shot clock to two, James over Noah. Did not have the move. Noah all over him, so went to the step back, and LeBron is now 9 of 11. 20 points, 8 rebounds, 6 assists. You just run out of ways to say how good the guy is. LeBron James. And uh, you are familiar with the defense of the Bulls, which was spearheaded by the combination of Michael Jordan and Scotty Pippen. Oh, nice pass and Wade with the reverse layup. Well, Miami reminds me a lot of those Chicago teams defensively because of the versatility on the perimeter, the ability to switch. The other thing I remember about that Jordan injury and the subsequent uh, discussion with Bulls management is LeBron knocking down another long jumper. Miami able to break it open with a 15 to 1 run in the second quarter. And the Bulls not able to get any closer than. A seven-point margin. Your Miami Heat, Chalmers, Wade, Bosch, Haslam, and the finest player in the world. Sixers have made four of their first five shots, and they lead it nine to four. Nice pass by LeBron. It counts for Dwayne Wade plus the foul. Another laser beam delivery from LeBron James. LeBron all the way through. First score for LeBron. And the Heat trail by three. The water's just parted right there as he went through the lane. Just under five minutes left. First quarter, Wade has scored again. Dwayne Wade has just reached 16,000 career points, all of them scored in a Miami Heat uniform. 
Actually, Wade does not have the 16,000 points yet. He's only got seven. My mistake there. Yeah, he needs two more. What a pass by LeBron there behind the back to a cutting Chris Bosh. Holiday with the escape dribble, but lost the ball. It does bounce to Turner, who misses the jumper and the rebound track down by LeBron. Excellent defense by Chalmers that time on uh, Holiday. Chalmers with a nice reverse, and he put it in over the top of a seven foot one shot blocker. Eight seconds left in the quarter, four on the 24. LeBron lost the ball, got it back, and delivered. Speaking of hockey, the Philadelphia Flyers beating the Winnipeg Jets in an afternoon NHL tilt in this building. And was it ever a scramble for the crew here at the Wells Fargo Center to convert this building over for basketball? The Jets lost again? Oh, that's a cheap shot, Coach. <laughs> Chris Bosch with a splashdown. He has six. Doug Collins was the first pick out of Illinois in the 1973 draft by Philadelphia. Played eight years in the NBA. And remember, he did have that hiatus from coaching last coaching the Wizards in the 0203 season before coming back three years ago. Oh, my. Great execution. A Ray Allen three out of the corner. And Allen just recently had a 22 rebound game. LeBron James knocking in the three. Wade double team. Good ball movement for a Rio three. Kaboom! Mario Chalmers with his second triple. Bosch from LeBron. And has them batch it out. Back to James with a fresh shot clock. Oh, look at the ball movement. Udonis does it. Oh boy. How good is that, Eric? Eight assists for LeBron. Seven on the shot clock for his excellence. Yep. He heard you. <laughs> now five points in the first half and five points here in the third quarter for LeBron. The Heat have pumped their lead to 15. They've scored nine unanswered points. Ninth, ninth rebound, right? Yep. So he's one assist away from a triple-double. Oh, there it is. Reverse by Chalmers. There it is, right? No. No? LeBron has 10 points, nine rebounds, All right. nine right. assists. Now he needs a rebound. LeBron for three. And Udonis with the offensive rebound. LeBron, nice dish, and wham with both hands for Chris Bosh. Now what do you do with LeBron? <laughs> you think you got him all bottled up, turns it into a basket for his teammate. The steal from LeBron. Here he comes. Finds Allen for a three. Kaboom! There it is again. Two defenders go to LeBron. He gets tied up, and he knows exactly where his teammate is. Look at that! Oh, my! The Whirly Bird maneuver from LeBron James. He has 12 points now, seven of them here in the third quarter, and for the second time here in the period, the Heat are up by 20. And what's happened a lot of late, Eric, and there's a steal from LeBron. Here comes a dunk. This should be fun. Yes. Look out below! Oh, party time for the Heat Nation here at the Wells Fargo Center. Amazing the amount of Red Heat jerseys that just sprang out of their seat. Chris Anderson with a block of Turner's shot, and LeBron does get the rebound. Let's see if they give it to him officially. They should. Yes, he has his third triple-double of the season. With 11 minutes left in the game. I think he wants some points. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted to score there. Nobody was stopping. There was four white shirts around him that time. And when you say nobody, <laughs> you mean nobody. Well, happy times continue for the defending NBA champions. They defeat the 76ers for the 12th consecutive time. They win their sixth straight game in Philadelphia. They win their fifth in a row on the road. The Heat are red hot and rolling the defeat the 76ers by 24 points. Oh yes, it is great to be back in South Florida. Inside the Heat's house plays a team with a second best record in the NBA. And that Miami Heat team also is tied for the second best home record in the NBA. Tonight that home record will be tested. The Heat are 23-3 here, and they'll go against one of the best young point guards in the world in Kyrie Irving. And both teams played last night. The Heat winning in Philadelphia. The Cavs oh, just got a LeBron James facial open the game for James, his 91st dunk of the season. Not a bad way to start the game, get the crowd in the game. Shot clock at four for Tristan Thompson. 
Big power forward out of Texas comes up short, and Bosch with his first rebound. Chris Bosch only had one rebound in the game last night. Nice pass. Wade dunks it home. And LeBron looked left, knew that Wade was cutting baseline, and then threw the pass to the right. Another terrific assist for LeBron James and the first score of the game for D. Wade. Look at that! My goodness! Wade put it in the sky, and LeBron went wham with both hands. LeBron with the steal. Here he comes! Get out of the way when he goes to the basket. Boy, how about you see the quickness, the athleticism, the anticipation with the steal. He runs along the sideline and finishes it strong. Wow. All three of LeBron James' baskets have been ferocious slam dunks. Allen for three. Come on! It's raining threes in Miami. LeBron rejected by Zello. And LeBron will go to the free throw line on his second opportunity. Zeller picks up his third foul. LeBron into the lane for the fadeaway. That's good. Well, he likes that move. 12 points for LeBron James. The steal by Udonis. Chalmers has help and uses it. Four well, dunk for LeBron. Back to Waiters, who flips it up errantly, and Bosch outlets to LeBron. Here comes the freight train. Uh oh. <laughs> With the left hand. Again. Freight train James does it again. 16 points. He puts the heat up by 14. He's another one like Wade. They don't predetermine their move. They take what the defense gives them. Seven straight points for the Heat, and they're hungry for some more. Chalmers, corner three. Come on. Say it with me, Heat fans. Miami actually eight of ten from downtown. Oh, they made another one. Snuck one in on me. Oh, the Ray Allen one, that's right. They made eight. Here's LeBron. Gorgeous court. Oh, my, is he fun to watch. 18 points for James. 12 points in a row for Miami. Nice move by Bosch. Very deliberate. Bosch, who's shooting 57% in the month of February, has seven points in this game. And the Heat have equaled their largest lead at 20. Zeller missing. Haslam with his 10th rebound of the game. Six double-figure rebound game this year for Udonis. And there's LeBron. 20 points. And he's done it on 8 of 11 shooting. Also, G for three. He missed it. And Schammer is able to gather in that rebound. Here's Dwayne on the baseline. Going right at Waiters for the score. See how fast he got that ball up the court. Chalmers for three. Kaboom. Mario Chalmers, four of five from downtown. He has a dozen points. Cavaliers won 21 games a year ago in a 66-game season. They're 18 and 37 this year. But they've won seven of their last eight against Eastern Conference teams. Oh, another three. Shane Battier with his second triple of the game. Here's Battier. Good catch by Dwayne. But the block shot by Thompson winds up with LeBron, who hits the hook. Five on the shot clock for Miami. LeBron, nice pump fake. Look at that. Oh, my. Scoop du jour. LeBron against Irvin. Inside Wade laid it in. What a fourth quarter for Dwayne Wade. He had nine points through three quarters. 11 points here in the fourth quarter. The heater down one. Timeout Cleveland. I'll tell you what, we're going to remember Dion Waiters the next two times we see this club. Waiters finishes with 26. LeBron 28. Wade 24. But 15 of Dwayne's points came in the fourth quarter. He is your hero tonight. So the Heat win at 109 to 105. That's for your Miami Heat. Chalmers, Wade, Bosch, Haslam, and the reigning Eastern Conference Player of the Week, LeBron James. And both coaches said the same thing about Isaiah Thomas. Spolster of the Heat, Keith Smart of the Kings. Isaiah Thomas always plays with a chip on his shoulder. He's always trying to prove something. Chris Bosch, the third different Heat scorer on their first three field goals. 540 left, first quarter, 16-8 Kings. LeBron's first shot. 
a nice kiss off the glass. Ball went over the head of Cousins, saved in by Thomas. And the steal by Bosch. Fees LeBron, who sends it to Wade. That's nice. Three All-Stars running the break. Eric, you mentioned the, uh, the game in Sacramento. The three All-Stars did not play in the fourth quarter in that game. Four-point lead for Sacramento. Jumper for LeBron. He's two for two. Backdoor cut. LeBron with a throwdown. Nice delivery from Chalmers. Oh, my. Anderson from behind rejects the shot of Thompson. UD got his second foul, I believe. Oh, no, the ball, ball on LeBron. LeBron got the block. And Haslam did, uh, actually, looked like Haslam did commit the foul, even though they gave it to LeBron James. Chris Anderson with a rebound. Marcus Thornton got the first, missed the second. LeBron sets up Lewis for three. Kaboom. Miami's first triple of the game, number 29 this year for Richard Lewis. Thornton's miss, rebounded by Norris Cole. LeBron lobbing it, Anderson stuffing it. Four assists for LeBron. Tony, does it bother you that the Heat have not gotten a single free throw attempt yet? Yeah, it probably means that they're uh, they're getting fast break points or they're taking jump shots. He's going down the line right there. I was just about to say it. Meanwhile, Eric, I wonder how many Heat fans can tell us who had the first triple-double in Heat history without looking it up. LeBron bouncing it for Udonis. Udonis knocking in his second shot of the game. Fifth assist for LeBron. Off the leg of Haslam, gobbled up by LeBron. And he will go to the free-throw line, the foul on Isaiah Thomas, who got pancaked. Chalmers for three. Kaboom. First score for Rio on his 78th triple of the season. Six assists for LeBron. Cousins against Bosch. Rebound Evans. Trickles off. Tip missed by Thompson, and here comes Dwayne. Chalmers, three on the way. Kaboom. Now you got LeBron leading the break. You got Wade on the right side. Chalmers spotting up for three. It's going to be a phenomenal year. And I mean, you know, being a partner of, uh, of the champions, the greatest team uh, in the world at the moment, I mean, we're so honored. We talked about the event tomorrow. The great Motown review presented by Hugh Blow. A great event tied to the Mary Heat Charitable Fund. Fox with a steal. 7.05 left in the third quarter. Miami has a five point lead. LeBron on the fade for the score. Made it look easy, didn't he? 14 for James, seven-point lead for Miami. Underneath LeBron, catching the lob from D. Wade and then scoring. Cousins powering it up, but Lewis clears it. And the Heat have a chance to run. LeBron tied up by Evans. Actually, it was Thornton, but LeBron able to finish. Anderson sets the screen. LeBron down the middle, scooping it in. Remember, the Heat were down eight Sunday to Cleveland with 5.16 left, and then they closed the game on the 20-8 to eight run and won it 109-105. to And they're following a familiar route. Allen for three. Kaboom! 13 points for Ray Allen, and the game's three-point king is three for five from downtown. LeBron, ninth assist. Patrick Patterson missing the wide open wing jump shot. LeBron affected that shot. Good closeout. LeBron James with 20 points and nine assists. Drives in. Got it. And the foul. Well, he's just like D. Wade. Eric. Coming off that high screen, he can maneuver himself into the back to the rim. Nice reverse by Dwayne Wade. Indiana's now 24 and 5 at home. Somehow, LeBron able to catch that in the crowd. Allen for three. Oh, my. <laughs> Off balance, but on the money. LeBron banks it in over Salmons. Just too strong and too big for Salmons. In the wave. Five seconds left. Three, two for the win. We go to overtime. Isaiah Thomas. That's Cousins. Missed the jam. Rebound the box. Wayne Wade came over to help on that. LeBron behind his back. Yes! And a foul! 
Now, Eric, he didn't intend to put it behind his back. He had to do it to avoid getting the ball stolen. That's what we talk about with Wade and LeBron. They don't predetermine this. Watch it again. The, de the defender tried to steal the ball. That's why he put it behind his back. So strong-minded, Eric. He's not having a good game. You mentioned two for 11, and he, he just has so much confidence in the next shot. Pass wide open. Bangs it down with both hands off the dish from LeBron. And the Kings switch. He'll put Jason Thompson on the inbounder wave, making a tougher entry. Bosh, good if it goes. We go to double overtime. Uh -huh. Bosh. Back to Rhea with seven on the shot clock. LeBron with the offensive rebound. Late it in. Steal by Chalmers. LeBron ahead for Dwayne. Jams it home with both ends. LeBron cross court. Chalmers had to go way up to catch it and then threw it away to Thornton. The chase is on. Wade with a block. Oh, what a great block by D. Wade. Wow. Incredible. LeBron for three. Come in. Oh, boy. Thornton thought he had the reverse layup. D. Wade blocked it. That was a good block. He got it before it hit the rim, uh, backboard. Here's LeBron. That's good. Five points in a row for LeBron James, and the Heat lead it 133 to 127 with 215 left in double overtime. LeBron's not even breathing hard. He played 46 minutes tonight. Just buried two Jays. The steal by Wade. LeBron, too far, but he catches it and got fouled by Thornton. <laughs> Look at Wade. Wade's resting at half court. Bass, Wade with both hands. LeBron knew he could do that, Eric, from the play that happened before. Cousins stepped out. Chris Bosch wide open. LeBron gets his 15th assist. Minute five left in double overtime. Five on the shot clock. Wade attacks on the baseline and scores. Dwayne Wade with 39 points. Tony, how about LeBron James and Dwayne Wade combining for 77 points tonight? I think it's the most those two have ever totaled in the same game. It might be the most points ever by a Heat duo. LeBron drives in and draws the foul with six tenths of a second left on the shot clock and 25 seconds left here in double overtime. That's all she wrote. Thornton missing the three. Wade with a rebound. And finally, the Heat Nation can exhale. Evans just took the ball away from Wade and missed the layup. And Wade will just put the ball down and stand on it with three seconds left. So LeBron gets 40 points and totals a career high 16 assists. And a sold out American Airlines Arena. It's the Miami Heat winners of 12 in a row, led by LeBron James against the Memphis Grizzlies, who have also got their own winning streak at eight straight. James is being guarded by Tayshawn Prince. They've had their battles when Prince was in Detroit. James for three. Knocks it down as the shot clock expires. Shooting a career high 41% from that distance this season. Here's Prince playing in his 12th game since the trade. A longtime Piston. A rare off shooting start for Miami. They're one for seven. That's more like it. And I'll tell you what, you know Atlanta, with all their changes, Larry Drew and his staff have done a miraculous job with all the, as Wade, nice cut and left-handed dunk. And I think the guy they just featured there, Paul George, should be given real consideration as Defensive Player of the Year. James. Looks for an open man, it's Ray Allen. That's good, and that one will count. He back within one. Tony Allen's shot won't go. James throws it ahead to Wade, and lays it in. What a perfect pass, and Wade releasing. Conley had his back to the play and couldn't recover. James drives. Battier connects. Shane Battier puts Miami back up by one. Randolph, way short as well. 
James throws it ahead to Cole. Cole, nice ball fake. Alley oop! And there's a bucket with an exclamation point. And timeout Memphis as that fires up the crowd. And James goes high to throw it down. He's just two of ten. Well, this one puts the heat up by four with 9.17 remaining here in the fourth quarter. Anderson on the floor as well. Rifle pass to Battier. That's a three. Shane Battier, three for three from downtown. That's good. Darrell Arthur. And pre-injury, that was Darrell Arthur's game. Catch and shoot, 17, 18 foot shot. Oh, what a pass. Bayless had his back turn and got burned as Wade. And James made eye contact. And LeBron James with his eighth assist. Wade gets it inside to James. His floater. And this one rolls in and he's in double figures. So the streak continues. Now 475. Nice pass. James is ninth assist. And Ray Allen in double figures once again. And a great back cut by Allen. Conley swings it. Tom Dexter. Can't connect. James. Three on one. Wade. Inside and throws it down. The lead is five with two minutes remaining. Timeout Memphis. James for three. Bang! Dave fires up the three. And that will do it. A hard fourth game tonight. The Heat emerge and win their 13th in a row. 98-91 the final. Welcome to New York City in a sold-out Madison Square Garden as we begin our NBA Sunday Showcase doubleheader. It's the defending champion Miami Heat, winners of 13 in a row against the New York Knicks. And you see the Knicks do more switching than most any team in the NBA as Haslam makes the baseline jumper. That's a unique aspect. Three on two the other way. Smith floats it into Felton. Bad pass stolen by Bosch. Knicks with their second turnover. Alley-oop to James. And the Knicks just outraced down the floor by James. His own teammate, Dwayne Wade, off the planet right now. and Not even the best basketball player on the planet. He's surpassed the planet. And then you look at some of his colleagues. I think he's figured out his game in terms of what he wants it to be. Uh, just sensational from Kobe Bryant. Steve Nash as well. Scary. No one's quite played the game the way he's playing it as consistently. And then Greg Popovich, one of the smartest, most instinctive players that there's ever been. That's some high praise from some pretty high basketball people. It is. And do you think Dwayne Wade thinks there's a basketball league not on this planet? Do you think he believes in the extraterrestrial? I do. I do. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Meanwhile, counted at a foul. The first time they played was actually the season opener for the Knicks. Alley of James throws it down. Wade throws the perfect pass. And who's from the crowd, even the Knicks fans. Well, when James gets a running start on this cut without any body contact and any weak side help, it's just too easy. He's too good an athlete. J.R. Smith should have had a body on him. Stoudemire should have rotated over, but... Eyes on the rim, even that high. But you have to hold yourself accountable because when you're so good offensively as James gets another easy layup. Way the drive. James to the basket and finishes strong. Wade has really passed the ball well tonight. Anthony left wide open. Not that time. Shumper tips it out. Wade with the deflection. And Bosch, excellent job. Chalmers ahead to Wade. Wade goes right at James White. Misses James right there on the follow. Once again, there's the all-out hustle from LeBron James. And I'm going to say, if you're going to play against James and they're going to throw these lob passes as he knocks in a jumper, you better go up and make it hard on him. James, nice pass. No, we, we spent three minutes <laughs> talking about five seconds. Yeah, but five seconds can mean the difference between a win and a loss for a team. As James hits the shot. And it can make 500,000 people switch the channel. Stoudemire out to J.R. Smith for three. It's from downtown, 7 of 24. They had that one hot stretch in the second quarter. Battier will try a three. Battier puts it in. And the lead is cut to four again. Smith almost daring James to shoot it. He does and puts it in. LeBron James from downtown. His... First three-pointer of the afternoon, and it's cut to three. 
Kidd back to Stoudemire. Triple team blocked by Anderson. Second rejection. Ray Allen chased off the three. Way off on the mark. Ball batted back out. James for three. Ties the game. Timeout New York as LeBron James with back-to-back -back threes and we're all even at 79. Felton, it's knocked to the ground. He wanted a call. Chris Anderson looks exhausted. Battier and the Heat have their first lead of the second half. How about Shane Battier? Four for four from downtown. And again, switching. How many centers can switch on to Wade and James? James inside to Bosch. Poked away, gets it back. Good second effort from Bosch, who has 12 points. Chandler inside, blocked by James. Wade picks it up. Wade out to Battier. Chalmers right corner three. James the follow, it's good. And the Heat are up by four, timeout New York. LeBron James at both ends of the floor. A sensational block on a seven footer. Anthony is on James. Chandler looking to pick him up. Bosch got away and Anthony didn't switch. Chandler was telling him to switch. Anthony didn't move down and Bosch gets a layup. J.R. Smith fires up a three. Way off the mark and James the rebound. James puts his head down, drives, lefty layup, banks it in, and it's back to four. 27 now for LeBron James. Stolen by LeBron James and flushes it down. Back up to six is J.R. Smith with a costly turnover. And that just may end the Knicks' hope. Miami will tie a franchise high with 14 consecutive victories. As they come back from 16 down in the first half, 14 down in the second half to win their 14th in a row and six straight on the road, Jeff. LeBron James, the reigning Eastern Conference Player of the Month. In fact, he has won that award four times this season. A fantastic year. Dwayne Wade, not exactly chopped liver, Jim, especially in the month of February. He was great, as I said at the top. He probably would have been the Eastern Conference Player of the Month had it not been for how well LeBron played. Minnesota has to be on point they have to be absolutely perfect as oh. lebron james goes right there with the lob pass to deep raid they make it look so easy yeah, that's they? a tough cover for luke rittenauer because he's so undersized when you try to deny him to catch on the wing he just sets the hook and goes back door and lebron puts him right in the money empty trip for minnesota wade behind the back for lebron who throws it down ricky recognizing the shot clock but lost the handle and they're going to play on as the Heat came away with the basketball. Inside for LeBron. And it's been the LeBron James and Dwayne Wade show, as you might have expected it would be here early on. Dwayne Wade makes it look easy. Just a, just a complete physical mismatch with Luke Ridnan. And Dwayne Wade up to eight points on four or five shooting. Jimmy's been shooting it at 60% the last six games. LeBron puts it up with the left hand. Again, trying to keep Ricky on one side of the floor. And Ricky does a good job of escaping and then attacking again. Ray Allen trying to keep him on this right side of the floor, not able to. And Ricky just drives that seam. LeBron doesn't close down that driving lane, and Ricky cannot complete three point play. LeBron takes it right into the paint and knocks it down. Rubio has it knocked away from behind. Wolves will retain possession. Berea. Bosch got a piece of that basketball, and Miami finally comes away with it. Berea just one of six from the field. Ray Allen, the gift for LeBron James. And LeBron now in double digits up to 11. You know, it can all change so quickly, and Timberwolves fans, I know it's been a long stretch of this team not being in the playoffs but remember just two years after the heat won their title in 06 they finished 15 wins the two years later yeah so i mean it, it can be cyclical it can get good in a hurry it can get bad in a hurry Timberwolves fans saying well when is it our turn to get good in a hurry it is amazing how it can change for a lot of people owners fans players dwayne wade lebron james got up the floor in front of everybody and you saw that coming a mile away Miami a slight edge on the glass thus far, 23 to 19.
an area that the Wolves dominated in that first meeting down in Miami. James again for three, this time knocks it down. And that is career three-pointer number 998 for LeBron James. Jim, you know all about guys getting into players' heads. I mean, I'm sure back in the days with the Houston Rockets, the Twin Towers you played with did that to a lot of guys. And how about that feed? LeBron James putting it on the floor to Dwayne Wade. Ricky Rubio, four steals, two off his career high. But he is fantastic pretty much in every facet of his basketball game. So is that guy, LeBron James. Just makes it look so easy. Well, bear in mind, the Timberwolves now down to a total of eight players with J.J. out of the mix. And lost in all the shuffle, Jim. LeBron James with the follow slam. Ridenauer gets the high screen, takes it right inside. Both Bosch and LeBron were there, and now Miami comes out of there with the basketball. Eric Spolstra going to set a new franchise record here tonight at the helm of a 15-game win streak. Just two off the longest win streak of the season in the NBA. Clippers won 17 earlier this season. Alexi Speck gets it away off the heel, and that will do it. Game number 59 of the NBA season for the defending NBA champs. Tonight they'll seek a 16th consecutive victory and a 12th in a row at home. Miami's second meeting this season with the Magic. They beat Orlando in overtime on New Year's Eve day. LeBron, first shot and his first score in his 200th game as a member of the Miami Heat. Tony, the fact was J.J. Redick was going to be a free agent, and the Magic obviously did not want to pay top dollar for Redick. And when you think about it, they've given up Ryan Anderson and J.J. Redick, guys that would be good players. Nice play by yes, Anderson LeBron. I pass. Both Redick and Anderson would be contributing players on a good team. By the way, the Hurricanes with a 9 p.m. tip against Georgia Tech tonight here in Miami. Anderson got the field goal. Bano Udrich hit with the foul. Oh, that was a soft touch inside. Good pass from uh, uh, LeBron. And Hartless pass picked off by Wade. Here comes the freight train. LeBron James ripping through. That would have counted had it dropped. Wow. Well, if you're going to foul him like that, <laughs> you better make sure you wrap him up. Jameer Nelson looked like a gnat. Hitting a freight train. Bosch tipping it ahead for LeBron. Three on one break. Here it comes. Oh my. Elbow above the rim. And then Lamb with the right hand. Fans now anticipate that, Eric, after seeing him play for two and a half years. When LeBron gave it up, you knew he was getting it back for the lob. Maybe the most entertaining fast break in basketball when D Wade and LeBron are on the fast break. Highlight machine. Tobias Harris comes back with a score. Harris has all six of his points in the second quarter. And LeBron draws a foul on Tobias Harris, and that's number three on the 20-year-old from the University of Tennessee. Chris. And let's go back to the last highlight-making machine, the LeBron D. Wade fast break hookup. Chris Bosch started it. D. Wade and LeBron ended it. Look at that. I don't know if there's anywhere you can throw it where he won't get it. He's probably got to watch... Hitting the head on the rim when he goes up. With Might be my favorite element of Heat basketball this year. The <laughs> elbow above the rim salute. Here comes LeBron. Look out. Oh, my. Another wham with the right hand for James. LeBron. Kaboom. First three tonight for James. Number 82 on the year. LeBron arriba el primer de tres. LeBron buscando pase a las manos de Wade. Wade abajo de bandejita. Lanza en sexta alto contra el pista. Qué tiro de bandejita de Dwayne Wade. Wow. Heat going with Chalmers, Anderson, Battier, Wade, and LeBron James. Who cuts and scores. Great pass by Battier. Yeah, good cut by LeBron. He was being overplayed coming high and went back door. I'll tell you what else works. Nick Vucevic works. Tied his career high with 25 points. Also has 20 rebounds. LeBron was fouled inside. Tony, the Heat have been outscored in the, in the second half. This is hard to believe. 51 to 32. Nelson with a hook come up short. Rebound to Battier falling out of bounds. Saved it in the box. LeBron got fouled. Two more free throws ahead for James. And the foul will go on. Nick Vucevic. And that'll be his fifth. Well, neither team has a timeout left. The Heat will go with Battier, Allen, Bosch, LeBron James, and the inbounds man will be Dwayne Wade. 20,000 Heat fans, none of them using their seat right now. No timeouts left, so they got to go. LeBron yeah. with 10. Guarded by Daquan Jones with eight. 
with seven, with five, on the drive, lays it in, and the Heat lead by one with three seconds to play. A follow at half court, Heat ho! Miami wins! Miami wins! And the winning streak lives on to a sweet 16! A victory would also put Miami in the playoffs earlier than any team in the NBA. Be the first time ever the Heat could clinch a playoff spot in their 60th game. Turner's miss brought down by LeBron. The hit ahead for Dwayne. The catch and the finish. We talked about guys moving without the ball. D. Wade and LeBron looking for each other. And there's another example of it. Shot clock at five. LeBron for three. Kaboom! His 1,000th NBA <laughs> triple. He knew what the shot clock was, Eric. He, these guys are always aware of how much time is on the clock, and he buried the jet. LeBron, great post-up position. Wade saw it, and Evan Turner had no choice but to take his first foul. That's great work by LeBron, Tony. He sprinted to that spot and established some great turf down we there. We talked about when Alonzo Mourning used to do this, when Tim Hardaway was handling the ball. That is a very difficult play to play against. Those guys are so big and strong, and you got to get them the ball right away so you don't get a uh, There three he is seconds. again. 108th dunk of the year for LeBron. He's got five. Miami starting to creep back down by five. Holiday missed it. Hawes missing on the tip. And this is Norris Cole for LeBron. Underneath Wade. Battier for three. LeBron. Third time the charm. <laughs> he got two rebounds out of it. Shooting percentage goes down. The rebounding total goes up. Oh, LeBron. He is on a rampage right now. He has the Heat's last seven points. And Miami has now cut that earlier seven-point deficit down to one. How about LeBron with nine points, five rebounds? Evan Turner, the 6'7", third-year swingman from Ohio State. And his shot blocked twice by Chris Anderson. And here they come. Cole back to LeBron. You can see him coming all the way. Started by two block shots by Chris Anderson. Allen for three. Come on. 28-24 Miami. Well, they force the Heat into 10 first half turnovers as LeBron, with that stutter step, draws a foul and will go to the free throw line. Spencer Hawes. Wild flip on the hook. Quick outlet to LeBron. Here's Haslam. Got it! Oh, what a nice play. LeBron hitting Udonis in stride. And the Sixers call timeout. Their lead is down to two. Now the rebound to Haslam. He haven't led since two minutes gone by in the second quarter. They've tied the game at 62. LeBron James now with 16. 11-2 run. Lob in the weight against Evan Turner. The spin and the score. That was pretty. 16 for Dwayne. Miami's up three. Kaboom. Shane Battier. Well, his third triple tonight. And Darrell had two dynamite years in a row for Golden State two years ago. 194 triples and averaged 16 a game. That was a big time three in the third quarter for LeBron. 76 is on the road. As that, oh. that same movie won the game with the other night for LeBron. Six is on the road going into the fourth quarter behind 0-20 this season. Wow. Hawes is guarding LeBron now on the perimeter. Chance to foul Hawes out. LeBron on the drive. Got it! And the foul! If it's Hawes, he's done! This is Damian Wilkins. And look at that man-sized rebound for LeBron. His 10th rebound, giving him his 30th double-double. Here he goes! He can fly! Oh, but then he split the defenders that time, boy. When he comes down on the break, he always knows what he's doing with the ball. Coach, they're on their feet, celebrating a 17th win in a row. The Heat have equaled the Clippers' longest win streak in the NBA this season. Miami's also tied the 59-60 Boston Celtics for the third best winning streak ever by a defending NBA champion. On a beautiful Sunday night in Miami, Florida, it's game number 61 for the defending NBA champion Miami Heat. And I really believe that this very well could be the most anticipated matchup 
of a 25th regular season for Miami. They go against a team they beat in the second round of the playoffs, Indiana, but a team that has defeated the Heat twice this year and held them to 83 points a game. That's Chalmers defending George. The deflection and a steal by LeBron, racing with Hill. And George Hill drawing the foul. Pretty good defensive job, though, by Hill. Staying in front and on the move with LeBron. Started with Mario Chalmers playing good defense. Chalmers batting his own miss. Back to LeBron. And Wade hits. Second chance points for Miami. And the first points of the game for Dwayne Wade. That's the mid-range shot. D. Wade's been hitting with a lot of regularity the last month and a half. Good double team. Miami wanting to extend the minutes of the dominating defense as Bosch hits another jumper. Well, an equalizing factor to Indiana's size. The range of Bosch, if Hibbert doesn't come out to play him, it's Splashdown City for Chris Bosch, who has nine first quarter points. 2.35 left in the quarter. Miami's up eight. LeBron from the baseline. It's good. First field goal for LeBron James. The Heat lead by 10, and it's a 16-2 run for the Heat. Allen got his first points and will have a chance at a three-point play against Indiana. And you know, a guy like Allen, he gets that first basket. You get, there's many more that usually come. This is not a good matchup for Indiana right here. Hansbrough guarding LeBron. The turnaround is right there. Six points for LeBron James. Miami by 11. Shot clock at five. LeBron drives on Hibbert right by him and wham with the right hand for LeBron James. LeBron's getting upset, Eric, because he thinks there's a lot of physical play going on defensively by Indiana, but no calls by the officials. Wade's third steal. And the score to end the first half on a high note for the Heat. Haslam looking for LeBron. Mid post against Paul George. Bosch for three. Got it. 11th triple this season for Chris Bosh. He has 14, and Miami matches its 12-point lead of the first half. LeBron passed two defenders and finds Bosh in the crease for two. LeBron against Stevenson. Get the feeling he's hungry. Man's got to eat. Yeah, a lot of physical play right there. LeBron's getting physical back. Six on the shot clock. Two on the clock. And LeBron beats the clock and the Pacers defense. Beat the clock. 323 left in the third. Nice pass. Battier with his first score. Terrific laser beam feed by LeBron. And another turnover. Stevenson took it away. LeBron with a chase down smackdown of Paul George. You can see that coming. LeBron hands it off. Anderson slams it through. Yeah. He had Hibbert going at LeBron to block his shot with Hibbert up in the air. It left Anderson wide open. Seventh assist for LeBron. Well, mission accomplished. Miami defeats a rival. Miami extends its winning streak to 18 straight. They take their 14th in a row at home. They have Dwayne Wade in his house. The Heat have been the best home court team in the NBA at 28 and three. And Tonight, they're not only trying to win a 19th straight game, but Tony's urge Folster said, we just want to try to improve every game and not waste any opportunities as we get ready for the playoff. Underneath LeBron. Oh, one fluid motion, the catch and the reverse flip. D. D Wade, a great pass inside. They've had, a, had an up and down season, as you mentioned. There's another assist there by LeBron. Perfect timing on the pass inside to Chris Bosh. The miss by Smith, the rebound for Haslam. He goes long. And LeBron makes an incredible oh. play. Oh, my. <laughs> LeBron oh. James from the floor set up Dwayne Wade. Uh, that's why you watch every night. Tough matchup for Dante Jones. LeBron gets right to the paint. Missed the layup. Good D by Smith. And LeBron draws foul. Boy, is he a low down there. Dante Jones with a foul. Yeah, he lost it on the way up when he got positioned inside. But then he got right back after it and drew the foul. What was the experience like for you having to sit out and watch game six and seven? It was very difficult. I mean, it's in that hotel room like I was in there, a game like, like instead of two hours, it was like six hours. And uh, I want to be on the floor with my teammates. It's, just, it's like a family reunion, man. That's you know? just what it is. <laughs> 3.47 left first half. Miami with a 46-40 lead. Here's LeBron hanging and hitting. Excellent pass by Chalmers. Uh, players like you and, and Udonis, uh, numbers 
can't tell the story. You do so many things. You were a big part of the, all the winning that, that took place in your years here. Yeah, the Pacers bench did not play well against the Heat in that series. First score by LeBron in the second half. He has 13. Miami's up nine. Ivan Johnson missed it. Bosch retrieves it. Bosch, 20-footer. That's yep, good. Caught it in rhythm. Good pass from LeBron right in the basket where he can shoot it. Shot clock at six. This is Dante Jones missing the long two. 11th rebound of the game for Haslam. Chalmers for three. Come on. Oh, he called for the ball. He wanted that. LeBron gave it to him. LeBron gets his fifth assist to go with seven rebounds, 13 points. Jeff Teague, who had recent games, 26 points, nine assists at Boston, 27 points, 11 assists against Philly. Dwayne Wade comes back. His first score of the third quarter. Wade has 15. Steal by LeBron. Well, how much room did he make up while that ball was in the air? Wow. That's his second steal of the night. Chris Anderson, wham, with both hands. And the Heat lead by 16, biggest lead of the game for Miami. LeBron waited that time when he could get the better angle on the pass. Now, Coach, the Heat are going to go to 48 and 14. They will be 30 and 3 at home. 19 wins overall, 15 in a row at home. Miami does it by 17, and the win streak lives on. Next stop, Philadelphia. Welcome to Philadelphia's Wells Fargo Center for the 63rd game of the season for the defending NBA champs. Here's our opposition. You just saw the Cleveland Clinic starting lineups for the 76ers for the Heat. The backcourt of Chalmers and Wade. The frontcourt of Bosch, Haslam, and LeBron James. Chalmers with the steal against Drew Holiday. LeBron, look out! That's always there, though. How about... Mario Thomas with the quick hands, the anticipation, did it last night against the Hawks, doing it again tonight. This is Young again. Nice D by LeBron. Wilkins with the offensive board. I think LeBron got a piece of that, though. One and a half minutes left, and LeBron with the prettiest bucket of the first quarter, other than his dunk. So four points all coming in the paint for LeBron James. He evens this one at 10. LeBron taking it right back at Evan Turner. Well, all six of LeBron's points have come in the paint. He's got that drop step at that time from the uh, high post. The lob for Anderson. Nice connection between LeBron and Chris Anderson. LeBron can feel when two defenders come to him, at least Anderson open, because his man is trying to guard LeBron. LeBron for three. Kaboom. 85th triple this season for LeBron James. He has a nine-point first quarter going. Chalmers misses the three. Battier to LeBron. His second dunk of the game gives him 11 points. Wayne Wade was the leading scorer in that team, uh, the, the games in, in Beijing when they won. And coming off the bench, he had, I believe he had 27 in the championship, in the uh, gold medal game against uh, Spain. He made the big three right at the end of the game to secure the medal. So he accepted his role. And uh, I remember uh, uh, Coach K talking about what a professional Wayne was where he just accepted his role. Well, that was some... Dazzling work off the dribble for LeBron James. He will get two free throws waiting for him when we come back to Philadelphia. The other thing Miami, I know this team would like to accomplish this. Nobody's talked about it yet, but they could conceivably finish with the best regular season record in Heat history. They would need to finish the season. There's 20 games left. Miami would have to go 14 and 6 to finish with 62 wins. One more victory than the 96-97 team. Hashim Battier with a corner kaboom. His 104th triple this season. Half a second on the shot clock. And the breakout for LeBron James. Wow. Good His defense. third dunk of the game. Good defense by Chris Bosh knocking that lob pass away. Thaddeus Young back rimmed it. Ray Allen down with a rebound. Seems like Philadelphia now settling for the outside shot. And it's not falling. LeBron breaks through. Look out! Wham! On the reverse with both hands. That's already his fourth dunk of the first half. He has 18 points. He'd have 11 unanswered points. And they knock it away from Drew Holiday out of bounds. And a timeout here in Philadelphia where they're ooing and eyeing over the defending champs who are explosive. The Heat on an 11-0 run right now to take the 10-point lead. 
Here's Udonis. Got it. A perfect baseline jumper on his first shot of the game. UD gets his first two points. Nice cut by Wade. The perfect assist for LeBron. Tony, that's one of the kind of plays Spolster was talking about on the reinvention of Wade. LeBron, straight line drive, sets up Udonis. You did it. Four points on two shots for Haslam. The Heat lead is 10. LeBron picking up his fifth assist. Oh, off the timeout, the Heat execute for a Chris Bosch layup. LeBron James, who has 20 points, only two in the third quarter on free throws. The spin and the score. I was going to say, hold that thought for a second. <laughs> Nine on the shot clock. Wade for LeBron in the paint. He drew the foul. There's six seconds left on the shot clock. LeBron got inside, drew the foul, and will get a couple of free throws. LeBron, Bosch, Wade, Allen, and Chalmers on the floor for the Heat. Here's Allen's three. Kaboom! A big bucket for Ray Allen. His second triple tonight. He has 12, and Miami leads by two. Bosch with five on the shot clock. Gets by Hawes for the lay-in. Well, two trips in a row, the Heat getting a much-needed basket. Holiday on the drive. This is Young. Leans in, blocked by Bosch, taken by Wade. The hit ahead for LeBron. The winning streak survives the Philadelphia 76ers. 20 wins in a row for Miami. Next stop, Milwaukee. Yeah, baby. Yeah, no question. It's an exciting game, and, you know, the team that's trying to break the streak, they love it, but you know the team that's at the top, Miami. Everybody's after them. This is no different than any other game for the Miami Heat, but for the Bucks, this is going to be fun. Miami spreads the floor very well, so they can do just that. Chalmers on the takeaway, up for nothing. All right, and right away, that's what we talked about: limiting your turnover. Something the Bucks did very well in the last meeting. Bosh has four. Julian Silva for three. He let Haslam fly by. Sanders in a crowd taking the rebound, and now Jennings drives to the free throw line. Bucks do a good job showing LeBron James a couple of bodies, but Bosch hits the jumper. He has six. That's a tough shot. No doubt. Helios Silver hits it. He has four. You know, I always tell young kids, if you're playing against a shooter, the last thing you want to do is let him shoot. There's no help for that. I can't help you as your teammate. And you probably can't help with that either. The spin by the king. <laughs> yeah. You know, if you look at the Heat team, they're really small right now. Chris Anderson is there in there at the center. How about Anderson as a pickup on a reigning championship team? LeBron James fades away and has six. How about that shot? <laughs> Great defense by Marquise. Marquise had the first move, shut down. LeBron went to his B move and then his C move and still made the shot. Their star power, you need guys to fill certain areas. You can have players like that on a team where you have such talent at three spots. Not to mention individual color. Chalmers from the top of three. LeBron James found it. Three. Marcus Daniels. 11 points in the first quarter for Marquise, subbing tonight as a starter for Luke Richard Bob, who's out again with turf toe. Yeah, and that's, a, and that's a big shot because, you know, Marquise is a little bit better than Bob Mute at shooting that three point. He can extend it there, and he's been hot tonight, so why not make that three? Make Miami come out and play him. Well, he has scored 11 and given up eight to LeBron James. Oh! LeBron James, two, and a foul. F.A. Udo with the body. It's his first and the first on the Bucks in the second quarter. The Bucks very active, very hey. aggressive on this end. That's what we were looking to see. Rebound, LeBron James running with Norris Cole and Ray Allen. Allen for three. You know, hey, I, t I tell you what, the Bucks did a great job of getting back and stopping the initial guy, which was LeBron James. Reddick dancing in and out of the paint. Jennings the same, Dunleavy from the top. They can't stop LeBron James. Henson went with him, 13 for James. Uh, that's what I was talking about before. You don't want to be late to help LeBron. He because, can make you look like a rag doll. Yeah, that's what's going to happen. You have to really get him before he gets to his launch pad. Clear out for LeBron. Jennings trying to help. He watches Chalmers cut through the paint. Four seconds, three seconds. All night long, right? Yeah, well, hey, you know, as I said, Marquise plays some good defense. The guy has to go to a second and third and even fourth move on that one. And he just rises up, elevates over you. James and Bosch, 28 points, 28 of the 46 for Miami. Wow. First two second chance points. Now they had a couple offensive rebounds on that trip, and they hadn't had any until then. 
Ellis doesn't argue. There appeared to be contact. And now a technical Jim Boyle. Boyle, he was going after the officials for what Ellis walked away from. Ilyasova was right there. Bosch hits another deuce. 22. Oh, wow. And a foul. Three-pointer. Foul on Ilyasova. Miami going with Wade. LeBron James, the Spurs, with an assist to Chris Anderson, Ray Allen, and Shane Battier round out the five for the Heat. Wade, over plays, picks it, and assists LeBron James. Well, need to be said again, that's why you don't want these guys out in transition. LeBron James does that so well. The skip pass to the weak side, this time to Battier for three. Well, his first three. Wait. James. 23 for LeBron James. Reddick puts up the three. It is Soba. At it for a moment. That's it. 107 to 94. Miami has won 21 consecutive games. The third longest streak in NBA history, and they bumped the Bucks out of a tie for the third longest. As for your Miami Heat, James Haslam Bosch. Oh, he's back in Toronto again. Wade and Chalmers. LeBron to the lane. Amir Johnson switches off. LeBron shoots the jumper and strikes for two. Three. Got LeBron three. James with a triple there. It's 86 triple this season. Three to shoot. And LeBron knocks in another. The net barely moves. So on two shots, LeBron has five points. LeBron driving past Gay for the score. Well, LeBron James, as always, ready to rumble. Seven points on three for four shoot. And Cole lost tail fair and hit the reverse in a terrific dish from topside by LeBron. Yeah, excellent pass. Good cut. What you usually do is you fake coming high to set up your man like he did right there. See, he set him up by giving a little fake toward the pass and then went back door. That was ideal. Did it again. Cole hitting the hook. So two buckets in a row from in the paint for Norris Cole. Miami now on a 14-4 run. Miami up by 14, and it's Landry Fields defending LeBron. Takes him right to the paint, draws the foul, and will get a couple of free throws here. And LeBron, seventh in the league in free throw attempts this year, averaging seven a game. This, these will be his fourth and fifth free throws of the first half. LeBron going against the rookie Ross. Oh, he just bullied his way to the free throw line. Using his body and his great footwork, Terrence Ross picking up his second foul. Maddie had great defense at the other end, but he gave up the offensive rebound, and there's uh, LeBron with another three. Coach, what's it take to be a big-time offensive rebounder? And you're, you're constantly moving. You're reading where, you're, where the shot's coming from. You learn your, your teammates where they usually miss it and how far out they are. There's a lot that goes into it, Eric. Haslam's first score. It's also his first shot of the day. Miami up 11. Lowry's three is short. And the rebound bounces to LeBron. They hit ahead for Dwayne. The catch and the finish and the foul. Oh, perfect. Pass by LeBron. These guys throw perfect passes to each other. It's amazing how they can make it pinpoint right to the guy cutting to the basket. D-Wade got a potential three-point play out of this. It is seven seasons with the Raptors. Bosch. Yeah, he played in 509 games with Toronto, their all-time leading scorer, rebounder, shot blocker, and the most minutes of any Raptor ever. And he just tripled for the second time to go. But Bosch with a career-high 15 threes this year. And just over five minutes left in the third quarter. Miami up 10, and he's still shooting over 60% in this game. Long two. Bring it up for LeBron James. His first bucket of the third quarter. He has 19 points, and the Heat lead by a dozen. The game is outscored LeBron 25 to 20. 22. Back is open <laughs> on, on a Sunday afternoon. He heard you, 22. LeBron finding Allen alone for three. Oh my. Well, you see how LeBron drew the defense to him, leaving a vacant area for Ray Allen, who has 10 points now in the fourth quarter. Ray Allen tightly defending Terrence Ross. Who missed the jumper? Look at LeBron fly through the air for his tenth rebound. That gets LeBron his 32nd double-double. 
the most in any season in his career. Ray Allen rattles down another three. Oh, man, three, three threes in like the last in, in the last three or four minutes. And four triples in the fourth quarter. Allen has 20 points, 16 of them in this fourth quarter. Yeah, it looks like it's just a countdown until the Heat win their 22nd game in a row. Shane Battier with a kaboom. And isn't it fitting? Shane Battier is going to be a part of two different NBA teams that will have won 22 games in a row. The 07-08 Rockets and this current Heat team. They'll coach another piece of NBA history for Miami. They have won their 22nd consecutive game. They are tied with the 07-08 Rockets for the second best winning streak in NBA history. The Heat going for 23 in a row. Here's their lineup. Mario Chalmers, Wayne Wade, LeBron James, Udonis Haslam, and Chris Bosh. Made the drive. Bradley got stuck under the rim. You got to make the easy ones tonight, Mike. No turnovers. Limit the turnovers. Inside, set up by LeBron James and those two who played so well as things got going last year, leading Eric Spolster and company to a title. Together, they're playing the best they've ever played. Well, there's great movement in Miami from the foul line down, Mike, on that baseline. Jeff Green rims out the three, and Bosch gets the rebound. We like to tell you, can you defend Miami, keep them off the foul line and out of the fast break? Like, like that. There goes LeBron in the open court. Fouled by Green. He's isolated on Green. And it's going to be important if you watch tonight. How often does LeBron get into the paint to operate? Can Jeff Green keep him outside and keep a jump shooter? Taken away by Chalmers. Back to James. Uh, I, I like what Bradley's saying here right now. He's saying he took three steps. There's Bosch knocking down the shot. Doc Rivers says best basketball I've seen Chris Bosch play over this 22-game win streak. LeBron circles back, this time guarded by Bass. He says, give me some space. So I'm going. Pitched it to Haslam as he drove, was able to draw the defense. And Udonis Haslam makes it a five-point Miami lead. Yeah, Miami hurts you in the corners. Down for the attention on LeBron. It leaves Mario Chalmers free for his second three after going 0 for 5 yesterday in the win in Toronto. I've met kids, you know, 8 years old, 6 years old, 12 years old, uh, that have gone through the procedure multiple times and smiling. And, you know, that right there is what, you know, keep me, you know, in high spirits because I see a little kid going through multiple heart surgeries and, you know, still smiling and still being themselves and that kind of, Keeps me going. Some of the inspiration Jeff Green has given and received. Just joining us, Kevin Garnett out tonight under the weather. James inside, Wade five times in a row. Hubie shot or the foul happening there in the paint. Seven times in a row. James inside. Jason Terry, good defense. Wade from behind takes it away. Chalmers, pull. James! Whoa! And a technical foul called on Miami for the taunt. Now it looked like he jumped out of the mezzanine to dunk this ball. I just watch as they lay it up there. Watch this. Woo. That's sending it down with some power. Ron James sizing up Brandon Bass. Pitched it to Battier. Knocks down the three. Now that's the first one that Battier has been wide open. Six tenths of a second. The difference in the game and shot clock at the end of the half. James attacking and oh. finishing strong from the left side with the right hand. The game that we did here back on January 27th was a double overtime. Boston win 100 to 98. So Miami didn't even get to 100 and they played two overtimes. Chris Bosch knocks down the outside shot. It's a four-point game. Wade on the dive, and we're tied at 59, and Doc Rivers will stop it right away as Miami scored the first six points of this third quarter. See that high Boston turnover number. LeBron comes to the rim, and the Heat 
back up by one. Impossible to guard one on one. EJ White was playing with the Shanghai Sharks. It was added to this Boston team. James on the outside. All right, the attacking it wave. Can't finish. Here goes James. Chalmers for the short corner. You have to be careful now. You do not want to play at the tempo that Miami wants. Lee blocked by James. Yeah, that was that was a great move by LeBron. He came from the other side of the lane to get to that. Here's split the pair after the second foul on Chris Anderson. It was fit in very well. He's been a very good part of this there Miami team. Is. Beautiful movement to free James inside for the layup. What I don't like about Miami, Mike, they stopped the movement. Yep. All that exactly. movement, foul line down, all that movement, foul line down, that was so good to them. You know, they're going now, they're isolating, everyone's going one-on-one. -on -one. Late clock, James hits the three, LeBron. See, they got the switch. They have Wilcox on LeBron. James takes him left, cannot convert. Dribbled off the foot, Wade gets it to James for the dunk. Yeah, bad, yeah, Jordan Crawford said my bad. It's absolutely right. Terry Whoa. fought for position, couldn't contain it, and James scores. Bill Sharman, one of the great coaches and players ever to play in the league. And never mind the team with Wilt and Jerry West, Baylor, and then Gail Goodrich. I mean, kind of an interesting group of people. Austin <laughs> needs to step up the defensive end. Green's coming to the scorer's table. You see, they got the automatic switch. James comes right across the lane, finger roll for 33 points. Yeah, and Bass got away with a bump, all right? That could have yes, been a three-point yes. play, no doubt about it. Clear. Oh, nice. Way found by James. LeBron assists 11. Yeah, Bradley fell asleep. Boss comes over from the weak side to block Green. Miami Kintyre takes the lead. James finds Chalmers for the lead, rattles it in. Mario Chalmers hits the three, and the Heat lead by one. Bradley free in the corner, can he hit one? Yes! Nice pass. Great pass by Paul Pierce. Allen to trigger. Oh my, you can't leave James. Got the second try, 35 points, all even at 103. That was unbelievable. 7.9 is the difference, game and shot clock. We'll see if they come back to James against Green on this left side. Green guarding clock at four. James steps into a jumper and rattles it in. LeBron James gives Miami a two-point lead with ten and a half to go. That LeBron knew that he would have difficulty going off the dribble. Green has played him well off the dribble, and even there, he was right up. You could not challenge better than this. Look at that. Right up on that shot. We saw James with his histrionics and his reaction. And that riled up the Boston fans as well. Inbound by Lee to Pierce for three. Off the rim, no. Wade couldn't squeeze the rebound. Now he's got it and he's fouled with 1.9 to go. And got a timeout before any foul call. Oh. Daddy threw it off of Pierce, gets it back, and the game ends. And the Miami Heat extend. They have the second longest win streak in NBA history, 23 consecutive games. How about a do-over here in Cleveland? <laughs> a game that was supposed to tip off a little after seven has been delayed almost 40 minutes, but we're closing in on game time. Here at Quicken Loans Arena. A little bit of handshaking, hugs and kisses for LeBron as he steps back on the court that was home for his first seven NBA seasons. And Tony, quite a difference in the reception this year as opposed to three years ago in his first return visit. Well, he's earning respect. He has earned the respect of everyone around the league. Everyone realizes he's the best player on the planet, and now he's reveling in that. LeBron's first touch. You hear the booze, a Chalmers three, kaboom. Number 101 from downtown this season from Mario. Cross off a pass from LeBron. This is Zeller, the rookie. Air ball brought down by Bosch. Hit ahead for LeBron, nice catch. Oh, what a finish. Nobody can finish like LeBron James. That ball was tipped a little bit, but it still got to LeBron, assisted to uh, Chalmers. Ellington. 
And Udonis comes down with his first rebound. Finds LeBron deep. And LeBron was fouled by Wayne Ellington. And what a job LeBron did, Eric. Again, we talked about Dwayne Wade the other day in the low post. LeBron waited for the ball to get over his head. He's kind of boxed his man away from the ball, away from the pass. Bosch against the smaller Ellington. Shot clock at seven. Good ball movement. Chalmers three. Kaboom. Well, two triples in the game for Rio. Largest lead for Cleveland. Oh, my! Wham with a right hand on a vicious reverse. Both his buckets have been slam dunks. That's Ellington. And Ray Allen comes down with a rebound for the Heat. Heat are doing a little bit better job now on the defensive boards. LeBron loves it. Anderson smashes it home. That's what happens when you double-team LeBron. Spates came over to help. He was in no man's land. He wasn't on LeBron, and he wasn't on Anderson. Nice catch by Bosch off a line drive pass from LeBron. 12 offensive rebounds for the Cavaliers, and a 33-15 domination on the glass for Cleveland. Yeah, he can't run if they don't get the defensive rebound. LeBron, crafty move, he tips it home. That's LeBron's first field goal since the first quarter. He trailed by 20. 3.20 to go in the third. Chalmers gets by Gibson for the layoff. Mario Chalmers, five points in a row for Miami and 12 points on the night. He's the Heat's leading scorer. Walton standing on the free throw lane as Gene misses the second. He can get this under double figures deficit. Down, down 11, LeBron finger rolls it home. The deficit is now nine with 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Five on the shot clock. The block shot there. LeBron down the middle. Off to Allen for three. Come on, baby. First wow. points of the game for Ray Allen. It's a six point lead for Cleveland. The Heat. The defending champs are back in business. Oh, C.J. Miles defending James. Three. Kaboom. First trip of the night for LeBron. His 89th of the season. It's a five-point game. This is the closest that he'd have been since uh, in the second half. And a steal by Allen. Hit ahead for Chalmers. Has LeBron. Missed it. Loose ball, LeBron makes it. It is a three-point game. Miles for three. Rebound, Chris Anderson. Oh, my, the Birdman took flight. Ah, uh, in traffic. LeBron, pull up three. It's good. And Miami has tied the game at 77. Oh, oh my. With a 37 to 10 run. Yes, you have to have heart for a comeback like this. Oh, my. LeBron James has 19 points, seven assists, six rebounds, two triples. Cold blooded threes here in the fourth quarter for LeBron. Here's another one. Yes. Three triples in the fourth quarter for LeBron, and the Heat have an 80 to 79 lead. Amazing. The Heat on a 40 to 12 run. Allen straightaway triple. Yes. Oh baby. Ray Allen, both his threes here in the second half, and the Heat lead by four. This is Miami's biggest lead of the game. LeBron drives on Ellington, and it rolls off. Bosh tips it up twice, but Ellington comes down with it. Okay, LeBron went to the basket, just like we said. He stole it. He got it to Chalmers, who drives in for the score. Oh, see, Chalmers learned from the last time. The defender went for the lob. Chalmers took it to the basket. LeBron against Miles. Four on the shot clock. Drives in. Finds Chalmers. Three on the way. Come on. Mario with his third triple of the night. He's got 17. Miami has 12 triples and a seven-point lead. Loose ball. Oh. Shot. LeBron got a piece of that. Good block shot by LeBron. Wade, another step back. Bosch with the offensive rebound. First shot clock. Allen's three. No good. Rebound, LeBron. Tip in. Missed by LeBron, and he drew the foul. You're talking about willpower meeting skill power, and a technical foul just been assessed to Sean Livingston of the Cavaliers. LeBron. How about LeBron James? Tony's got a triple-double. 22 points, 11 rebounds, and 10 assists. That man does not like to lose, baby. C.J. Miles on the catch with three. Rises up for three. Missed it. Ball 
game's over. The ball game's over. The winning streak survives. Win number 24 in a row. One of the most amazing comebacks in Heat history. Down by 27 in the third quarter, and they somehow managed to win the game 98 to 95. Our officiating crew, Mark Lindsay, Kevin Scott, and the man will toss up the jump ball. Ken Mallon, South Florida, and to the entire Heat Nation. Thanks for being with us, and off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Shot clock at three, Bosch. And the rebound tipped and taken by Singer. And here he comes, and the end, blocked by Bosch, taken by Monroe, and stolen by Chalmers. LeBron makes the catch, oh my! Hammer time! How many times have we seen that? LeBron with the ball up in the air, always seems to get it away from the defender and then finish. LeBron in the post against Singler. Set play after the timeout. Chalmers, kaboom! And that's what happens when you, LeBron's in that low post, a lot of good things happen. They always concentrate on him and other guys get open. Oh, Manny had three. I guess, you know what he does though, Eric, the, the old axiom, you don't shoot it as soon as you catch it when you come off the bench. You get warm a little bit. I think that's what Shane did just did. Oh, nice little step back baseline jumper for LeBron. He has four, and the slow start still plaguing Miami. Allen for the runner. Tipped in by LeBron James. Anderson, wham with both hands. LeBron with the penetration, drew defenders, left Anderson open for the dunk. Oh my, a rejection by LeBron. Goal by Calderon. One of the quickest, fastest guards in the NBA going right or left. Norris Cole takes the block shot by LeBron and turns it into two at this end of the floor. And the loose ball rebound claimed by James. Blows by Calderon, who wraps him up oh. with a foul. LeBron got hit hard by Kim English, but bounces right back up. Wow. It was scary the way his knees bent. Felt awkwardly. Bynum for English in the right corner. Shoots it over LeBron. Rattled out down the way. Looking long for LeBron. Who gets wrapped up and fouled by Kim Ling English, and LeBron got hit right in the back of the head. That's the third foul on English. It's amazing how many times he gets hit in the head. LeBron fouled by Monroe. Basket counts. First field goal, second quarter for LeBron James. Hey, concentrated after the hit. You got to be strong to take a hit from a center and then be able to uh, bury the J as you're fading back right there. Singler defending LeBron, who has 12 points. Give him 14. LeBron against Stuckey in the low post. Monroe over to help. Leaves Chalmers open for three. Again, low post leads to a three. Dwayne Wade, three of four in the quarter as LeBron measures it up and puts Miami in front. First time since it was seven to six back in the first quarter that the Heat have the lead. Yeah, the biggest lead that the Pistons had was 11. LeBron for three. Kaboom. LeBron James, his first try from downtown, his first splash down as well. Dwayne Wade, out of the tunnel, back to the Heat locker room, back to the Heat bench. Battier for three, and a foul inside on the Pistons. Yeah, Chris Anderson will get a free throw. He'll get one free throw on this. Drebka against Battier, stolen by Cole. He's got LeBron as a trailer. He's got him, and he's got two, and the foul. LeBron for the cutting, Anderson. Oh, the pick and roll has taken on a new form since the arrival of Chris Anderson. LeBron, 21 points, six rebounds, five assists. Bynum. Now threw it away, but a loose ball to Stuckey. Good D by Anderson. Stuckey sticking with it with a fresh shot clock. Wade with a steal. Back to LeBron. Ahead for Cole. Oh, my. Uh, give Anderson a lot of credit, Eric. I think he made a block on that first initial drive. Chris Bosch back in. Chris Anderson sits down. Wade in the post for two. 10 of 14. <laughs> well, Miami's now outscored Detroit in the second half. 36 to 22. They've opened up an 11-point lead. Nice pass. Bosch with a left hand. It counts. The eighth assist for James <laughs> and the first field goal tonight for Chris Bosch. Does he find a way to get that ball in there? Sometimes you throw it over the top. 
LeBron from Cole. Oh my! Defying gravity! Hanging in the air as long as he needed to. Shot clock at six. Shot clock at three. LeBron to his left. Oh my! Anytime he wants it, seems to get it. He's got 25. Miami leads by 12. LeBron! Oh my! A long bucket with Singler all over him. Four on the shot clock for Monroe. Battier, good box out and enabled Bosch to get the rebound. Good defense. He forced Monroe to go right and then played him when he spun back to his left. Peter looking for a 16th straight win at home. Another deuce for LeBron. Eight in the quarter, 29 on the night. Timeout Pistons. The Heat have equaled their largest lead. They're ahead by 16. El Tony, a familiar script. Slow start, furious finish, another victory. The winning streak moves along. 25 wins over the last 48 nights. Well, the Heat Nation and the NBA TV. Thanks for hopping aboard. LeBron just snapped it back to Chalmers. So officially, off we go on another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Kimball Walker triples. You like the fact that the Heat can come back from any deficit, but you don't like the fact that they're they're behind so much. You now seven straight points for Charlotte as we talk about slow starts. The Heat in another one. Miller, kaboom. Now Mike Miller, here it is. 50, 537th career start. He started off with two triples for Miami. Michael Kidd Gilchrist defending LeBron James, who hasn't scored yet. Only taken one shot. And Dick Pavetta makes the call. Foul is on Michael Kidd Gilchrist. His first, second team foul on the Bobcats. But the steal by Chalmers. LeBron the trailer. Oh. And LeBron will get two free throws on the Gerald Henderson foul. Yeah, usually he finishes that, but good hustle by Henderson. Mullins, straightaway three. And the long rebound of Ray Allen hits ahead for Chalmers. Now the Bobcats get back in a hurry. LeBron deep in the post. Nice pass by Chalmers. Boy, good patience by Chalmers. LeBron was streaking down the right side, but Walker was going stride for stride. So all LeBron did was step in front of him. LeBron following Chris Anderson down the floor. Drives in and banks it in. Well, LeBron James now has eight of the last 10 points. 10 unanswered for Miami. Here's Parko. For Jeff Taylor and the rookie, misses the three. Cole looking ahead for LeBron. Oh my! <laughs> An emphatic slam dunk on a perfect pass from Norris Cole. Yeah, LeBron was pointing. Throw it up, throw it up. Nice looking jumper by Chris Bosh. LeBron, nice post up. Oh, he got great position. I'm not sure where Jeff Taylor was, but it wasn't anywhere close enough to LeBron. Under a minute left in the first half. LeBron, nice pass. Oh, my. A reverse jam by Bosch. About as pretty as the pass that led it to him. But Biombo is getting really uh, uh, frustrated, Eric, because every time he tries to help, LeBron finds a teammate. The deflection by LeBron and the dunk for LeBron. LeBron with the steal. There was two points in that for uh, Charlotte because the, his, the teammate had a dunk down below and LeBron turned it into a dunk for himself. Michael Kidd Gilchrist on the other end now with nine points. That counts for LeBron plus the foul. Looks like he caught that with one hand and finished. So the 6'9 Biembo, the 6'2 Charmers, and look who winds up with it. Yeah, Charlotte didn't do a good job, obviously, on that jump ball. They're supposed to seal their man away from that area. Now, the best overall season in Heat history, the 96-97 team that won 61 games. He would need to finish just 8-6 to finish with the best record in Heat history. And Miami would need a 5-2 finish at home to have the best home record in Heat history. That currently held by the 0405 Heat that won 35 of their 41 games at home. So the Heat have won 16 straight at home, 12 in a row on the road, and the second longest winning streak in NBA history, the longest in the last 40 years. Look, I was an assistant on, a coach on that team, and you felt in the locker room, you just felt you were going to win every game, pretty much the way the Heat feel now. Turnaround jumper for LeBron. He now has 23. Anderson. And LeBron holding on to the rebound. Bobcats with a five rebound edge. James rolls it home. 
And LeBron now with 25 points, 11 in this quarter. This is Pargo on the pull-up. Oh, Adrian tried to rip it down. Loose ball to Battier. Nice play. Oh, a perfect pass. LeBron waited till just the right time to hit the cutting Chris Anderson. Oh, good catch and finish by Chris Anderson. Byron Mullins listed at seven feet, guarding LeBron 25 feet away from the hoop. Battier for three. Come on. Well, that's heat basketball executed to perfection. A three-point shooter in the corner. LeBron drives middle for the pitch out for another triple. Nice rebound for Adrian. LeBron blocked it out of bounds. Second block, actually the first block of the game tonight for LeBron. LeBron back to Cole. Long two. Right there. Yeah, LeBron James so good at drawing the defense in and then pitching it out to an open teammate. Adrian, the Taylor, good defense by LeBron. You talk about protecting your defensive basket. LeBron James just did it with both hands outstretched. Taylor guarding James, drives left. The pull up. Yes. LeBron James with a 14 point quarter and a 28 point game through three quarters. Now the Heat are looking for a 26th win in a row. They're on their way up by 16 through three quarters. LeBron James painting another on-court masterpiece. LeBron behind his back, through the lane, and to the line. Henderson. And the rebound to Allen. Bobcat shooting under 34% for the game. Heat on a 16-3 run for three. Norris Cole is 18th triple of the year. And Ben Gordon had a 40-point game against Miami in December 2006 when he was playing for Chicago and once averaged 25 points a game against the Heat in the playoff series. Ray Allen from downtown. Ray Allen with his third triple of the night. He has 11. LeBron for the cutting Anderson. Oh my, that's well done. Chris Anderson with another throwdown. LeBron with his eighth assist. The Heat cruising to win number 26 in a row. They're up by 24 and on a 24 to 5 run. Heat executing on offense uh, and shutting down the Bobcats defensively. Charlotte shooting under 34%. Miami's at 48%. Same play, same result. Oh, pick and roll to perfection here in South Florida. And yeah, LeBron's got his double-double now. 30 points, 10 assists, 8 rebounds. Heat up 26. Kimball Walker at his shot blocked. Taylor blocked by Battier. Battier got two block blocked shots. LeBron! A little Sunday night block party in the Heat House. Battier got two block shots on that deal. LeBron got one. Kimball Walker with 17 points. For the first three quarters, Anderson with a block. LeBron down the other end. Oh, man. You talk about defense igniting offense. Boy. A combustible <laughs> combination in Miami. Time winds down, and the Heat take another historic step toward the 71-72 Lakers. Miami wins their 26th game in a row. Welcome to an NBA Special Edition, presented by State Farm. As we continue to watch the Miami Heat Chase history, the sellout crowd, the Amway Center in Orlando, Florida. As the Heat and the Orlando Magic. Can Miami make it 27 in a row? They come down the other way with the Heat up by two. Again, the last four games, they've traveled by double figures, including last night. They played at home. As Jameer Nelson nails it. A three-pointer for Nelson. And the first lead for Orlando. They trailed by 11 against Charlotte and then wound up blowing them out with actually the largest margin of victory of the whole streak. Haslam to James and Miami back up one. The thing they're trying to do, and I, I give Rob Hennigan, their GM, credit. They're trying to find guys like Tobias Harris. I think Mo Harkless is a guy who has a good future. It's going to be interesting to see as they try to get more and more competitive going forward. Which of these guys can morph into a winning player? Shane Battier in the game. Pass to James. Harkless guarding him. James up and under. Count it and one. James with a chance for the three-point play. He's now three for three from the field. I understand why Miami's sort of going 
half speed right now, but you can't, you gotta play and get in the right habit as Cole hits a three. That reminds me of one of my favorite stories about Will Chamberlain's is Jones. Ball deflected, comes right back after him. We'll get back to that in a minute. Jones, a lot of contact there. No call. Laquan Jones, the rookie from Miami, thought he got hit. Now, one of the players that played with Wilt as Rashard Lewis knocked it down. They were on the road, and they had shoot-around. When he got back from the shoot-around, they go, what do you guys normally do on the road after shoot-around? Well, we go back to the hotel and wake up Wilt. Uderick on a pull-up, in and out. That went halfway down. They've gone cold. Woodrick is 0 for 7. Lewis for 3. Puts it in. And the Heat on a roll. 13 straight points to go up by 8. Harris. Pretty turnaround. He just can't get it to fall. He's had his last couple just go in and out. Still 6 of 10 from the field. As the Heat lead is 6. Each one more saying help. Lewis left open. That's a 3. 8 three-pointers here in the first half. 8 for 15, and the lead is 9. That's the largest. Haslam, good open jump shot. Well, the last time they played here in Orlando, these two teams, it was the largest crowd in this beautiful new arena. It's another sellout. Bosch makes it look easy. And it really is a beautiful arena. And Harris has been very coachable. From his dad and from George Gervin. That shot won't go. Haslam the rebound. Back to Chalmers. Goes past him to James. And James gets it to go. Nelson gets in the paint. Drives. Ball poked around and lost it. Chalmers to James. Throws it down. That's a way to answer. That's an energetic, forceful play. We got a head of steam starting at about midcourt. Here's Harkless. Harkless has become their defensive stopper. He guards the best opponent. James goes right at him. Unstoppable and one. And this crowd has come alive with this recent stretch as the Heat go up by four. Ray Allen for three. Misses both, gets the rebound block. Harris with the rejection, but they call a foul. Moore looking for an opening, throws it right to Battier. Cole, will he throw it to James? Alley up to perfection. Cole had a wide open layup, but he didn't want that. He'd rather have the highlight play. Ludwig's like, I'm not going to get whacked in the head again. He did, though. On the follow through, watch the ball. They simply don't lose when they hit three-pointers like this. 11 of 21, 52%! James to Anderson! Timeout Orlando as the Heat fans on their feet with several highlight plays here in the fourth quarter. Norris Cole for three. 12 three-pointers for Miami. Ray Allen off the dribble. Six to shoot. Magic trying to stay in it. They've fallen behind by as many as 19. Talk about a mismatch right there. James aggressively goes to the basket. Moore blocked by James. James spins, grabbed, shot won't go. Smart play from Nelson. Avoiding a highlight play and the crowd erupting again. Nelson flips it up and in and out. Bosch, the rebound, comes out of the pack. Here comes James, finds Ray Allen, puts up a three-pointer, bang! 17-point lead, that's his fourth three-pointer. James, another pass, this time Chalmers, another three. And that makes it a 20-point lead. 4-0-1 left, timeout Orlando. James, turnaround shot, puts it in. <laughs> I would say he's finishing strong. And the Miami Heat's winning streak continues. The race to history is now at 27.
six shy of tying the Lakers. Welcome to NBA Wednesday, presented by State Farm. And tonight, the NBA celebrates Noche Latina for a sold-out crowd at the United Center, home of the Bulls. And as these two teams meet for the third time this season, and Miami bringing in 27 consecutive wins, second longest winning streak in the history of the NBA. They have Dwayne Wade back in the lineup after missing the last two games. I don't think they've done a good job remaining diligent and focused. I think they've been bailed out against substandard teams after not coming into the game focused. So the fans can't wait to see Heinrich and Rose play together. James will try another three and hits another three. He has been shooting a career high 39% from downtown. Nice feed inside. Bosch to finish. James goes for the steal. Dan half step inside. Blocked by Battier. James, one man to beat. It's Heinrich. And he's going to take his second foul. And the crowd applauding the toughness of Kurt Heinrich. Butler guarding James. Bruiser goes to help. James gets away and draws yet another foul. He took a shot. Chris Anderson is in and immediately contributes with a bucket. Ray Allen guarded by Cook. James against Dang. James backs in and banks it in. Tough shot. Wade hesitates. Butler denying Bosch. James now drives inside. Power move from LeBron James. He has 15 of their 33. Shot clock down to seven. Boozer guarding James. Where's the help? <laughs> Crossover move to the basket. Layup is good. He thought he got hit. He is getting to the rim. Whenever he wants, no matter how many times he gets whacked. Shot blocked by James. Robinson gets it. Trying to find an opening. Flips it up. That misses. And a loose ball foul against Miami. Heinrich bank shot. That misses. Ball batted around and taken by the Heat. James and Wade. Two on one. Alley up to James. Up and down. And a lead of seven. Heinrich has it stolen by Chalmers. Back to James. Throws it down again. And it's a five-point game. Final minute, third quarter. James powers in once again. And we're tied at 66. James inside. Goes back door and Bosch found him. James again stays on Heinrich. Heinrich gets past him. Lefty layup swatted away by James with six to shoot. Well, well defended initial pick and roll. Heinrich gets a step on James. But tremendous recovery by James. His ability to make those plays without fouling. Heinrich gets inside, running layup, blocked by James. Fourth projection of the game. Allen misses Boozer. Not a smart pass stolen by James. James attacks the rim and throws it down. Back to seven. Now you can have, you really have to look for the three. Absolutely. James instead drives, goes inside, count it, and one. James with a chance for a three-point play and a chance to cut it to six with 27 seconds remaining. Daddy A, a Bosch, Bosch puts it up, that's a three-pointer. That makes it four with 5.5 remaining. They get it into Butler. Butler throws it ahead to Gibson. Gibson losing it. And two-tenths of a second, and that's it. The streak will end at 27. The Laker record is safe. So off the second longest streak in NBA history, 27 straight. It included, and a pretty good balance, included 13 road wins with 14 home victories for Miami. A lot of catch up late in the streak. Roberts gives it away. Good read by Dwayne Wade. And it's LeBron James. Over the shoulder, shot by D. Wade. So LeBron James talked about 32 in Chicago, but amazing what he did during the 27-game streak, averaging 27 points.
eight boards, eight assists, and, and that's basically what he's on the season at 27, eight, and seven assists. Yeah, he's in rare company putting up those numbers. I mean, every, every stat you look at, he's one of four players to ever do it, one of five players to ever do it, and the list is long. Roger Mason, Jr., oldest member of this team at 32, matching up with 37-year-old Ray Allen, LeBron James. Yeah, try to close on him. It'll go around you. It'll be James. Same result. It's an education for Darius Miller going up against LeBron James in his rookie season out of Kentucky. Good job shrinking the floor by the Hornets right now. That's his only option. If he's making that, you just lose the game. I mean, you as a coach, that's the shot you want him to take contested. And if he's making that, all you got to do is run back down the court. And... It goes again. LeBron James on the triple. <laughs> he is wow. really putting on a show right now. 4-4 four of four from beyond the arc, and he's got 18 in 13 minutes on 6 of 7 overall. And they just got another turnover. That was a handoff, and it was given right to Ray Allen from Lou Amundsen. LeBron. Man, is this guy hot. LeBron is amazing tonight. 23 points. He's hit all five of his threes. And... There's a call at the end of the play as he goes over and celebrates at the opposite end of the floor. And soft roll. Hometown rim, obviously, for LeBron James. Chris Anderson was up there. has been a nice fit since he was signed by Miami. Aminu and Anderson changed the shot. Anderson changed it. It'll be LeBron in rhythm. And another. LeBron James, spectacular wow. performance tonight. 8.20 and counting left in the half and a 20-point lead thanks to 28 wow. by LeBron. Perfect pass. LeBron James over the top to Wade. All in one motion. It'll be a block for Bosch. So an easy one for LeBron at the opposite end. That's when you know things aren't going well and Monty wants to talk it over. So still a 19-point lead. LeBron James leaving it off for a good look for Bosch. The dime for LeBron is his fourth. He's already got 30 points as LeBron takes away an easy one. Had the position. And it's Dwayne Wade on the, on the trail. So points off an easy takeaway. Wade very active. I mentioned six in the league and steals creates another opportunity. And Chris Bosch finishes it off. Well, LeBron took the game over. 28 of his 31 came in the first 18 minutes of the game. And a reverse is a beauty by James. Nobody quite like LeBron James. And he has put on quite a display this evening. This looks like a three. And he got it over Aminu. 6-8. What is he, 260, 65? Yeah, they, they got him down 250 to 270. Sure. <laughs> a 19-point win for Miami, but a dominating performance Miami from Miami from start to finish. Yeah, this is an ugly performance. Early, middle, and late. It was all Miami all night. Here's who starts tonight. Chalmers back in the starting lineup again for the second consecutive night. Mike Miller has been red hot from downtown, 15 of 25 in his last few games. LeBron back in the starting lineup, Haslam, and Joel Anthony getting the start tonight as Chris Bosch and Dwayne Wade sit this one out. Palmer's back out to LeBron James. Working against Damian Wilkins, and looks like he's got his rhythm still. But it just looked like nobody else was on the floor. He just said, okay, I'll go two dribbles right, spin move, fadeaway jump shot. Damian Wilkins, an excellent defender right in his face, didn't matter. Wow, oh. that's a deep three. No need to feel bad for that guy. There's James again, working against Wilkins. Goes quick and got the layup to go. <laughs> really? Oh, man, he is just cruising along Main Street, huh? Quick seven points for LeBron James. LeBron James, though, thought to be the front runner. For MVP, uh, not exactly going out on a limb there. LeBron again, oh, and the geez. same result. You said it earlier, JB. At times, it seems as if he's playing by himself out there. He's just doing exactly anything he wants. I mean, you know, you don't predetermine what you're going to do. Basketball is a reactionary game, but it seems as if he's at a level where he can just decide what he wants to do, and he's able to do it. He scored the last seven points for the Heat. Here comes two more. Oh. 
Makes the right play and Chalmers knocks down the three. Off the turnover. LeBron with the ball in his hands. Throws up the floater. Everything going in tonight took the hit too. <laughs> Making up for lost time. Uh, they don't do a good job on the defensive glass. They have a lack of size and they know that. And they have to gang rebound. Guards have to come in there. LeBron has to be a guy that gets his, what, eight a night that he normally grabs. Uh, so certainly it's a, an area of concern when you play the likes of uh, Indiana, right. or Chicago. Evan Turner has had a uh, up and down existence in his young career in Philadelphia. Yeah, he's got a good all-around game. He, he can pass the basketball, he rebounds, he can score a little bit. In fact, his numbers, he's one of six as Battier throws in the rainbow three at the end of the clock. JB, I'd like to see it come down to one of those deals like, uh, you know, you had the last day of the season and one guy goes for 73. And, yeah, as LeBron doesn't have to worry about being the leading scorer, although his team could end up with the best record in the league. And look back to Chalmers. Five on the shot clock for LeBron James. Working against Damian Wilkins. Spins baseline. Come on, Mark. A tough shot, but... <laughs> the playoffs are a couple weeks away, LeBron. Stop it. Well, remember Philly during the Miami streak. Had Miami beat. Uh, uh, Miami winds up winning that game 98-94 in Philly, but Philly was in the lead there. It was under two minutes to go. Uh, and they played Miami well as LeBron knocks down the long two. LeBron being guarded by Drew Holiday. That's not really a mismatch that I want to see as Haslam converts it at the basket. There's Battier for three. Got it. There are four different players on this Heat team that have made over 100 three-pointers this year. JB, that's pretty rare. Right for three. And rebounded by Lewis. James off the Anderson screen. Allen for three. Got it. Well, that one was on the money. LeBron says, I'll get you back. Five on the shot clock for James. Turns the corner. Wow. Uh, Spencer Haas has got to be thinking, okay, fadeaway jumper to the left, and as soon as he gets his body going that way, LeBron turns the Jets on and goes right underneath. Speaking Ooh. of Jets, huh? showtime. <laughs> LeBron mad at himself, slapping the ball, punching the ball after missing that layup. Well, he's missed five shots. I mean, come on. He's only 11 for 16 now. <laughs> Changes gears, and that time he didn't miss. <laughs> he, I don't know what's going on here. I mean, honestly, Miami's going to win it, 106 to 87. LeBron James with an impressive return to the court. Welcome back. Tonight's tip of the game being delivered by Papa John's, South Florida, the Heat Nation. Thanks for joining us. Off we go in another Miami Heat NBA adventure. Jennings leaving it for Ellis, broken up and taken by LeBron James. Good defense by UD. Let's see if it results in a basket, and it does. Points off the defense for Mike Miller. The Heat have a 4 to nothing lead. Ellis knocked it away from Miller. Loose ball picked up by Chalmers. Battier faking the corner three. Miller will fire from three. And Haslam keeps it alive for a shot clock. Miller, three in the air. Kaboom. Ah, keep shooting it. Coach Bolster wants him to shoot it when he's open. Finally buried one. Daniels on the move. Rebound to Miller. Going long for LeBron. Makes the catch look out below. Well, he was open for a while, too. Nobody covered the backcourt. Eight on the shot clock for LeBron, who will hoist and hit. Four points for LeBron James, an 11-4 lead for Miami. Chalmers able to turn the corner. And here comes LeBron. Nice catch by Haslam. Nice finish by Haslam. See the little shot fake throws Sanders inside. Bucks have missed five of their first seven shots. And they turn it over for the fourth time. LeBron has Miller, keeps it, and smashes it down. Wham with the right hand. That was a self-assist for LeBron James. It was. He passed that to himself. He was going to try to get it to Mike Miller when he left his feet, but the defender came over. So he improvised, threw it off the board, and then Faust, he gets a rebound and a basket. 
Brown comes middle on Pamute and made it look easy. Eight points for LeBron. Miami leads by 10 again. Cole steps into the jumper and hits. Morris Cole having quite a second quarter. Cole has all nine of his points in this quarter. He's having quite a second half of the season. You're right. Last nine games, he's averaging over 10 points a game. The shooting range has improved, and as has every other part of his game. Dunleavy for three. And a rebound in traffic to guy who started his career as a Milwaukee Buck, Ray Allen. Allen spent his first six and a half seasons with the Bucks before going to Seattle in the trade for Gary Payton. Reddick with a rebound. Gary Payton, who was just named one of the new entrants to the Basketball Hall of Fame. By the way, the Heat have missed 10 of 11 from three-point land. Payton was a two-way player. Great defender, good offensive player. Helped the Heat win a championship. A good rebounding tonight by Miami. Haslam had six rebounds in the first quarter. Anderson now has six rebounds as well. In and out for Ray Allen. Boy, Ray's having some problems in the three-point line tonight. Ray is 0 for 4. And the Heat 1 for 12. Both those numbers from downtown. He lead it by five. Foul on Miami on the J.J. Reddick track. Ray Allen picking up the foul. Yep, the new Hall of Fame inductees, Bernard King, Gary Payton, national championship coach Rick Pitino, Jerry Tarkanian, and former Houston Cougar coach Guy Lewis, joined by Sylvia Hatchell and the great Dawn Staley, who is one of the better female point guards you will ever see play this year. We had to play against her you know, when we had the Miami Soul for three years. She was terrific. And uh, you had a guy named Richie Guerin, who also made the Hall of Fame with Wyona College. Formerly played for the Knicks. And uh, he, he was a guy that uh, was from the Bronx, New York. And he and Denzel Washington have something in common. They both went to Mount St. Michael in the Bronx. 4-10 left here in the first half. Miami with a five-point lead. LeBron James, eight points in 13 first-half minutes. He's made four of his five shots. Gets tangled up with Ilyasova. A second on the shot clock. And this is Ellis with an air ball rebound. Bucks change ends well. Bamute missed it. Ilyasova got it back. And then Reddick splashes in the three. A pair of second quarter triples for J.J. Reddick. It's a two-point heat lead. Bucks with five triples. Miami just won. And has a difference. That's, what's, that's why the score is. It's only a two-point uh, lead for the Heat. 12-4 run by the Bucks, And that ball went off Mike Miller's hand. Turnover to Reddick. Oh! Drives in. LeBron blocked it from behind. He was tracking it all along. Yeah, he was tracking that all along. He was waiting for him to do that. LeBron James with eight points. And the big man, Sanders, swatting away and picking up a second foul in a row. Yeah, that's not a good matchup for the one. Well, the Bucks by one with 44 seconds left in the half. LeBron one-on-one -on -one against Baumute for two. 12 for LeBron James. That's his first field goal of the second quarter. Now, remember how good the Heat's ball movement was early in the game when they built those 11-point first quarter leads. Well, the other thing, Eric, is that the Heat, for the first 10 baskets, had eight field goals, uh, eight assists. In the next 10, they've only had two assists. Side is clear for LeBron against Daniels. That's good. 18 for James. Miami by three. LeBron's hit seven of his nine shots. Here's Hassel. Yes. Uh, excuse me, LeBron. Basket counts. <laughs> and the foul. <laughs> LeBron is so strong, concentrates. D Wade does the same thing. He gets hit, watches the ball. Look at him. Look at the ball go in the basket. That is concentration. And now LeBron has scored the last 12 points for the Heat. Nice pass. Battier's three. No. Miller with the offensive rebound. LeBron for the win. Yes. Yeah, second chance points. Good rebound by Mike Miller. Dante Ellis misses his three. And Haslam comes down with his 12th rebound of the night. He's getting some man-sized rebounds, too. Battier, try again. Come on. There you go. <laughs> And LeBron with the assist, Battier finally makes it, catches it in rhythm, and he's smiling to himself. <laughs> His 130th triple of the season. Yes, Shane Battier, give yourself a hand. Kaboom. Mario Chalmers, not only his first three, 
his first points of the game, and it's a new career high for Chalmers. That's his 115th triple this season. LeBron lays it in, so LeBron does come in to finish the game. That's his first score in the fourth quarter, James with 25 points. Now Larry Sanders does have to curb his enthusiasm a little bit with the ejections and the technical fouls. Allen for three, yes. There it is. Another assist for LeBron. He's got seven assists, seven rebounds, 25 points, and Ray Allen gets the stroke back. Now, Tony, the Heat have been a great offensive team all year. Now they're becoming a very good defensive team. Latest rankings has Miami sixth in scoring defense and seventh in field goal percentage allowed. Yeah, it was pretty high earlier in the year. Coach Bolson now is proud of that. They knew they were going to get it down as they worked hard. And they have, and there's LeBron going LeBron to the basket. LeBron James with a drive, the score, and the foul. He'll be at the line with his 27 points. They'll coach the Heat are going to get their 61st win of the season. 61 wins. Now tied with the 96-97 Road Warriors for the most wins in a single season in Heat history. And this Heat team still has five games left before the playoffs begin. An NBA Friday night inside the American Airlines Arena where the Heat have won 34 of their 38 home games. Tonight, the opposition, the seventh seed in the upcoming playoffs, we believe, the Boston Celtics. LeBron on the baseline, reverses it in over Jeff Green. Well, with the left hand. E. Wade slipping in. Miller for three, in and out. LeBron got it and slammed it through. Good job by Chris Bosh. He was boxed out, but he didn't give up on the play. He tapped it over to LeBron. Shot clock down the six. LeBron, baseline drive on green, look out below. Oh. A vicious reverse spine jam for James. Two of his three field goals tonight have been done. I think his leg's okay. LeBron sitting out the Washington game two nights ago with a tight hamstring. Nothing tight about that. Here's LeBron on the move. Nice pass handled by Bosch. In traffic, the hook. Oh my, LeBron wham with both hands. But when he's rested, he's got a lot. He has ups as it is, but he's very hyper right now. This is Courtney Lee. Good penetration and pitch. Green misses the three. Well, the Heat caught a break there. Good ball movement by Boston. Speaking of movement, oh, oh man, that's a freight train coming downhill. What a great pass by Mario Chalmers. Lewis, great position, terrific feed by LeBron. Oh, he threw it right to the outside hand, away from the defense. Good catch by Rashad Lewis. Celtics have not been a good road team this year. And they turn it over, the lead for LeBron. Yes. That is his fourth dunk. In the first half, he's got 12 points, and the Heat have their largest lead. Jason Terry loads up a three. And Ray Allen with a rebound. Celtics are two of ten from downtown. Heat up six. LeBron flips it in over Wilcox. <laughs> Tough shot. LeBron with 14, and the Heat up eight. Dwayne, he got it. Second field goal for Wade. LeBron driving on green, finding Wade. That's pretty to end the first half. What a nice way to end the half for Miami. LeBron underneath, Bosch with a flip, and the ball continues to move so crisply for Miami. Excellent ball movement, and what happens, Eric, is sometimes defenders get caught looking at LeBron. LeBron behind his back on lead of the hoop, and now to the free throw line. A late call. Bradley on the cut, Chalmers with a deflection. And Lee missing the three. Nice pass, LeBron. Boss with a lay-in. Oh, what a silver platter pass from LeBron James. Chalmers, James, and Wade wear those green shoes, and Mario Chalmers must have clipped his heels and felt like he was back in Kansas. <laughs> LeBron picks up his sixth assist. Jason Terry, the baseline puller. And LeBron with his fifth rebound. It's green week. That's why they're wearing it. There you go. You didn't think they were doing it to honor the Celtics. LeBron for two. 18 points for LeBron James, who makes the game look so easy. Ray Allen, corner three. Kaboom! It doesn't matter that Terry was there. He just shot it over him. LeBron, who has 18, working against Brandon Bass. Bosh! Yep. 
15 for Bosch. Heat lead by 12. LeBron, 18 points, 8 assists, 6 rebounds. Bosch on the pull up. And it drops. 17 for Bosch as Williams lays it in. And the final score will read Miami 109 and the Celtics 101. Meanwhile, for the Heat, James, Wade, and Bosch all playing this afternoon. Well, what do you know? And the reason Chicago is 7 and 3 in the regular season since as james drives it since the big three got together is when miami downsized chicago has stayed big they don't have that capability right now james finds wade wade of course has missed a bunch of games recently with his knee james with his hamstring and he drills the three-pointer he's only playing in a few games in april he's shooting 72 percent from the field in april <laughs> james gets in draws the foul puts it in and this is where obviously james is just incomparable the ability to finish but it also shows you the biggest weakness of the bulls nice feed flushed by james largest lead of the afternoon playing for his fifth nba team fifth in the last four years he started his career with the knicks for four and a half years and Boston parts of two seasons Oklahoma City for half season last year Golden State now first year Chicago as James switches to the left hand Dang. Had to launch that shot clock was winding down Despite the fact of being outshot 64% to 38% as Dang picks up His second foul the Bulls are right back into this game James are gonna post up cook Dang goes to help James blows pass and Phillies is right in the basket. Inside, who's it blocked from behind by Wade? Probably the best shot blocking guard in the NBA. Gets another, that's his second. James able to connect. James now with 18 points. And fairly well from the field, he's 6 for 6. Bad. Bumped by Wade. Taking his time. Wade on a pull up. Both teams shooting well here to start the third. Miller, by the way, after last season, went to see a couple of doctors. He said two different doctors told him he needed back surgery. He didn't really want to do it. Heinrich shot, misses. So he went to a third doctor who told him he didn't need back surgery, he needed to do therapy. That's what he did. He said he's the healthiest he's been now in three years. He's, James gets hit. And Miller getting a chance to play a lot of minutes last couple of weeks. Again, another cut by Wade. What a great pass by James. Robinson splits, pulls up. Moves it to the right for Ray Allen. James Anderson foul and one. The trailer play works to perfection there. And the Heat back up by a dozen. Bellinelli. Bad shot. James Norris, Cole, Cole the reverse. Beautiful move from Cole, and Tom Thibodeau needs timeout. There's a lead back up to 12. Robinson dives, Chalmers tiptoes. Bosh. Nice entry pass from LeBron James. Well, Tobias Harris may be most improved. Again, you have to be on a winning team to win one of these awards. All right. Empty numbers on bad teams. Miller hits the three, and that may be the final now. There's the lead back up to 10. The 64 and 16 overall for Miami. 36 and 4 here on their home floor as they beat the Bulls 105 to 93.